What up? What up? What up? Oh, God. Yeah, we're going to watch this. Okay. All right. I got to do something. One second. It's very, very, very important. Honestly, crucial. Okay. We're, we're good. All right. We're good. We're good. We're good. What's up, everybody? How we doing? How we doing? We having a good day today? Okay, now we can start. Yeah, the live the the live light is on. I like to live in the live light, you know. I like to see time in this uh where's my thing? Where the fuck is my thing? How would I do this? Maybe we go Wikipedia. Sure. There we go. All right. Sorry about the, 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 uh, the temporary blindness, everybody. There we go. All right, we're almost there. We're almost there. What the fuck? That's so weird. Okay. All right. All right. All right. Wait. What? Am I retarded? Don't answer that. Um. What the hell? Okay, so, did I fuck up? I might have fucked up. Ooh, dude, I might have fucked it all up. Oh, I did. Oh, okay. My fault, my fault. You know, you would think that after doing this for a while that I would have my shit together. Not true. Definitely not true. <clears throat> Well, all right, all right, cool. Now we're in there. Now we're good. <coughs> Fuck, man. I've noticed the older I get, the more I cough like a child. You guys know what I'm talking about? Where like they, like a whole throat it. No, oh, wait, that probably didn't sound good in context. Anyway, we're gonna watch this video. I ask you to stop filming. This wait, you're not. So. For those of you that don't have context, this is Natalie Reynolds. If you don't know who that is, imagine that Jack Doherty is even more annoying because he's a woman that thinks that she's also funny. Like, you guys know how annoying Jack Doherty is. Now, you've also met those women that think that they're funny and they're not. Combine those two things together, and that's how you, you get Natalie Reynolds. Yep. Yep. So she uh, is trying to do, like, 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 pedophile hunting and shit. And, uh, well, she didn't actively catch a guy doing anything. Okay? This is a guy that... Uh, did something 30 years ago. So this was like in the 90s or something. And is on the sex offender registry, which means he's been caught. He was charged. He served his time. Hopefully he isn't going around kids or schools or anything. He's allegedly not allowed to live around them. Uh, and he was just like, I think he's at work. And she's just like, oh, fuck. There's a guy that is on the registry near me working let me go harass him at work. And I'm like, man. No. Why don't you like. What she should be doing is playing a decoy. If she really wants to do like all this shit. <clears throat> she needs to be playing a decoy for people that are like. Actively. Like actively doing this shit. You know what I mean? This guy. There are better things to be doing. Exactly. It's like, dude, this guy probably, you know, fucking, you know, probably still is a piece of shit, but isn't actively being a piece of shit. That's what I assume she was doing based on the get up, honestly. Nah, dude, she, so she is dressed up like that, but it's to like, get, get, like, you know, bait them to come up to her and try to hit on her and stuff like that. And this dude comes up and is like, hey, uh, you need to fucking leave. 
And she's like, well, you're on the registry or whatever. And it's like, fuck this man. Fuck this bitch. He was just trying to work. He was just trying to go to work. All right, I'll let it play. My name is Fred, right? No, my name's not Fred. Wait. My name's irrelevant. Stop filming, dude. You're this on private property. You came up to me. We weren't even filming yet. I'm telling you not to. Yeah, you were. His name is William Jr. Oh, William. Nice to meet you. Have a good day. Okay. Stop filming, bro. Seriously. I, I, I know. No we weren't even. I, we were trying. We were about to walk off, and you came know, up to but me. You're filming it. I don't want that. Well, it was. It's, it's already property. been filmed. This is not private property. Yes, this is. He just told me it wasn't. This is private property. You guys say that to scare us off. I don't want to scare you off. I don't really care what you're doing. Just leave I know, us alone. I, but this is private property. I've been working here 15 years, and you probably even been breathing 15 years. Please get the fuck off my property. What's so hard about this? We're about to leave. No, you're standing here filming me. Because like you came up to us. You came up to us. God, they, what have they done to our schools? Please leave. What, bro, Please you're a registered leave. sex offender, and you're saying what have they done to, you, to our schools? What about it? So what? I'm a registered sex offender. What? So what? Yeah, you got me. Now fucking go away. Congratulations, you got your clicks. Dude, this is why IRL streamers need to... Like, I am not defending this guy being a sex offender. I am, in my opinion, defending a man that is just trying to do his fucking job. You know what I mean? Like, he wasn't bothering nobody. And what that's really telling to me is like, holy fuck... I have found somebody that is so intolerable that they got me to side with the fucking sex offender. <laughs> what the fuck? How are you that terrible? What about it? Dude, you what touched about little it? girls. You touched what? little girls. You don't know what the fuck I did. I know did. what you did. I did a background check on you. Okay, so what did I do? And you're coming up to me. You're on your to... mouth. Drew, I'm asking you to me. leave the property. I'm escorting me. you off the property. You're Go. not my boss. I don't have to be your boss. I do run this piece of property, though. No, you Go. don't. Yeah, I do. I'm, I don't I'm, about, this... I'm about to leave right now, sir. Then leave. Stop okay. moving, bro. So I'm you should have came up. You, okay, but you made a mistake coming up to me. No, I didn't. I'm doing my job. You're okay. the ones making the mistake. You're okay. the one. Let me see that shit posted. Let me see. I've been playing this game okay. for 30 years. Bro. Okay. Let me see this shit posted. There's been documentaries made on this property. place. There's been so many videos made about this place. So you can't get upset at that because it is I'm legal. Upset at everyone I want. Who the fuck are you to run? Because you're a registered sex offender, you so sicko. What? That's fucking disgusting. 30 years ago. So what? That's disgusting. 30 years ago. That's disgusting. What you're talking about. I know you're exactly just what I'm to talking scare about. People. Get the I fuck know. off the property. Then shut the fuck up. I don't have to shut me up. Shut me up. Shut me up. Go. You should go away. We're leaving. Asshole. Bitch. Fucking psychopath. <laughs> Bitch. You touch little girls and think you can tell me what to do? That's just. Like, bro, what the fuck? Okay, just titties. Um, what? Anthony Bourdain? Renee is hitting the schnitzel hard, and I see he has opted for the egg on top. So cologne, proud of its attitude towards art, artists, different cultures. Germany has accepted somewhere in the neighborhood of a million refugees. Like you said, look at those two, and she's the piece of shit. That says a lot. Right. That's what I'm saying, man. Like, holy fuck, dude. How insufferable of a person do you have to be? I mean, I feel like you guys are pretty well-versed on my opinions of, you know, all that shit. And I'm like, dude, I kind of feel bad for the guy. You know what I'm saying? And like, fuck, that takes a lot for me. It takes, like, as somebody that that thinks we should have the death penalty for pedophiles. <laughs> you know, I, I think, uh, getting me to side with the pet, honestly, fucking props. And that's, well, that's the thing too, is like, it's not even confirmed that he was. It's like, uh, you know, I don't think I trust Natalie Reynolds as far as I throw her, but I don't think I'd want to be around her long enough to try to throw her either. All right, hold on one sec. I'm doing something. I'm doing something. I'm doing something. I'm finishing making this drink. Oh, too much. I think I put too much C4 in my drink. 
Too much C4 in my drink. Okay. Uh, what up, Vika? Oh, using the new ones. Using the new ones. Hell yeah. Give me one second. All right. All right. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. Um, so, uh, how's, how's everyone's, uh, what is it? Sunday? Is it Sunday? Sunday. Sorry. I listen to fucking, you guys ever heard of Modest Yahoo? I'm just being a stream of consciousness right now. Um, I'm really trying not to come to terms with the fact that Anthony Bourdain, uh, well, you know, you know. It's Sunday. It is Sunday. It is Sunday. Wasn't there like a thing that was like Sunday, Sunday, Sun? I don't know what I'm talking about. Okay. All right. We're almost done. Oh, okay. I'm gonna hit. I'm gonna let this play while we're doing this. How do you realistically say welcome to Germany? And we're all gonna learn to live together. Can that be done? It could be done, of course, but I hope that all the right wing people will not develop. And this is, for example, a job for an artist. Maybe we, we should go out a hundred people with Nazi uniforms mm -hmm. and walk through the city. Maybe this kind of actions uh, will just make the people hey, rewind what on the time and what our grandfather us did wrong we really have to take care that we don't fall back in these structures but we kind of are we are I, on I the way we are here necessarily I, we're well on our way i'm allowed to be naive and, i think and, and i talk believe. about utopias <laughs> it's a kind of utopia just the fact that the whole world will mix up with each other that in i don't know 70 80 years there will be no white people anymore and only cappuccino colored people. Look, look, that's the only it's way good. that's this is the if only this solution is my, yeah, my way of yeah, thinking, mix up. it's our only hope it's okay so mixing everybody together is our only hope that's very weird <clears throat> that seems like a very globalist thing to say anthony bourdain that seems like uh, like you want everyone to be... Did you guys ever watch that episode of South Park where the, all the people are coming back from the future? You guys remember that? Where it's like, they're a mix of every race and their language is a mix of every language and shit like that. And they were coming back into the past because shit still sucked then. I feel like shit still sucks in the future whether we're all the same color or not if we don't fix the things that make now suck for every color separately you know what i mean it's like okay well people still like need mo more money than they have how do you fix that our way out of this yes it's going to take some time but it's what up, Keen Jalim? How you doing, man? Welcome to stream. Um, we're uh, we're just kind of talking, uh, bullshitting for now. Um, but we're going to be probably playing some games here in a bit. We're learning about Anthony Bourdain and his desire for all races to mix as the only hope for humanity. He wants them all to be the same. He wants everyone to be the same color. Which, you know, whatever. But why? I think that's just a little weird. Anyway. Really the only way is the sort of Singaporean model where everybody's so mixed up that you really don't know who to hate because everybody's so hopelessly I'd love intertwined. To help you in KCD if you need any tips. I probably will because I am terrible. Terrible. I mean, I'm assuming that you saw some of the gameplay yesterday or uh, Saturday. Uh, wait, fuck. Yesterday was Saturday. Friday. Um, and uh, yeah, it, it didn't go very well. I think before I was able to leave the village, my village, I died at least four times. 
Uh, and I went to jail. So we're 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 starting out good. Would actually make healthier humans. Yeah, but it's like. I don't know. You ever see that episode of Fairly Odd Parents where it's like uh, he wishes everyone was a big gray blob? <laughs> well, hopefully you didn't forget to grab Henry's dice in his home. Uh, I did. I did forget to do that. Now, I am back at the village. I just got back there, so I don't know if I can grab them after the village has been attacked. But we're a long way from that. Off right now. Stop filming. Whoa. Hey, sick. Tucker Carlson on the atomic bombs. My side has spent the last 80 years defending the dropping of nuclear bombs on civilians. Like, are you joking? If you find yourself arguing that it's a good thing to drop nuclear weapons on people, then you are evil. What? Jack Doherty banned on kick. That's going to last long. Oh, no. Oh, no. Are more men just filming their day? Didn't, the, didn't some guy on TikTok start this? Wait, why do I need Henry's dice? <laughs> I, for, I forget. Or wait, I, I guess I... Can't have forgotten if I never knew. Um, what What's the deal with Henry's dice? So, why are dudes filming the, their day? Why is this a thing? Cheers. It'll help the odds in your favor. Noted. I'll see if I can grab them after my village has been attacked. My parents are dead. You know, that's probably the most enthusiastic anyone's ever said. My parents are dead. Unless, like, that, you know, they had, like, a life insurance. But my parents are dead. I'm rich. So you know that guy would call me your Is that even real grass? I don't think that's real grass. What the fuck? Okay. Well, for one, picking up poison plants in the beginning of the game, it'll give you a permanent two vitality. Fuck, dude, that seems so helpful. So I put both of my uh, my traits into speech because my chat told me to. I feel like that hasn't been going very well in my favor. Ooh, Operation Paperclip. Operation Paperclip is crazy. They had Nazis working at NASA. Right here. Werner von Braun. That's actually the point because back then speech and knowing how to read is important. Oh shit. Okay, so they actually set me up for like success. We did do that. Talk your way out of everything. See, I, uh, I, what's the opposite of a pacifist? Because that's usually how I play video games. Like, a, a lot of the time, it, it's not... 
uh, uncommon for me to miss out on a bunch of quests because I went in somewhere, made one mistake, and killed everybody in the room. You know, usually it's like a self-defense thing. Like, uh, what was it? Vault 81. What up, Leon? Brute Force. Uh, so I was in Vault 81 and, uh, in Fallout, Fallout 4, and, uh, I was trying to steal something and somebody saw me, so I had to kill them. And then somebody else saw me, so I had to kill that person. And then two other people saw and eventually I had to kill everybody in the vault. And now all the quests that I would have done for Vault 81 are now locked. That's usually about how that goes, too. I never said I was good at video games. You gotta give me that. Werner von Braun. He's holding a rocket. Nothing much. Kind of bored. What y'all up to? We are... Sounds like Red Dead Redemption 2. Yeah, dude. I just beat Red Dead. You'll have to, uh, I have a playlist of it and, uh, turn on crowd control for part of it, but we just beat the, the campaign and now we're, uh, we're probably going to be doing like side quests, but I'm, I'm going to be taking a little break so we can clear some other games and shit. But, uh, but yeah, Red Dead was, was insane. What is all this? I thought I was reading about. Nazis and NASA. This all just looks like other stuff. Whoa. Almost all the German defendants at Nuremberg had had their... Okay. Uh, Al? Back to the mountain. Good day, Ray Charles. Hey. Blind to, to the bullshit, man. Gotta stay. Uh, Red Dead is huge so you can come anytime and do it exactly hey anytime you like it's like a hotel california but if it had uh tb esports cannot be called sports if this is what the athletes look like hey don't fucking trip me you <laughs> don't hold on what the fuck is happening here uh, holy shit. Is this like... It looks like they're playing... COD. Just based on the screen. I always think that's a snail. Or like a... I don't know if that makes sense, but it's like a ball of stuff. And then fucking... Like a snail head doing this. <laughs> Must be COD. Yeah, it looks... Like uh, you can see the little interface down here. And they're mo they're moving like Call of Duty. It looks like somebody shoots somebody. Hey, don't fucking shoot me! You get all fucked up in my head! Get out of here! 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 Get out of well, I'm going to finish up with whatever you're doing. I'm going to be playing Light 2 Nightmare Mode. Dying Light 2? Oh, fuck yeah, dude. I have that. I uh, I was trying to play through it one time with uh, with some friends and stuff, but we can never coordinate like when to link up. Um, But as far as video games now, it's just like, I'll just yell like, fuck, or something really quick. And then, you know, I might complain about the game, but you won't see me in like, yelling matches or anything like this oh and uh kinjaleem thank you for uh for stopping by we'll we'll probably be playing games here in a few hours i usually like to just kind of chill catch up on the day uh for the most part but i'm thinking probably probably here in like three or four hours or so i'm, I'm gonna be streaming like all day so we're gonna we're gonna be crushing it might uh might even do some uh some Kingdom Come, uh Assassin's Creed. I don't know. It's it's a variety stream today. So I you know, I had no plans. That's usually what I do every single day. But uh today we're not committed to anything, I guess, like specifically. Anyway, thanks for stopping by, brother. Who's 
Have you ever played Alan Wake? I played the first one. Um, I haven't played the new one. I played a little bit of the first one back in the day. Way, way back in the day. But I haven't, I haven't played anything all day. Sounds like seven need shots. Oh, no, brother. Oh, no. No, I don't know if I need shots. Maybe later tonight, but right now, I think I would die. There's a loophole to get those hard zombies that chase you at night. The bizarre gate with the UV lights will be able to block them from trying to pack up into a corner and you can kill them earlier. I've, uh... Didn't Critical talk about this? Talk about this Call of Duty thing? Or... Uh, Alan Wake was the, the video game where you had to, like, keep finding flashlights and stuff, right? I played the new one and it's crazy. There's a crazy beginning and it gets very hard to play once you get to the forest. Oh shit, okay. Might have to wait for it to be on sale or something. Y'all don't tell my parents that I'm smoking at 10.30 in the morning. He looks like an 80s drummer where you have it paused. He almost looks like that guy from Linus Tech Tips. What's that guy's name? Anthony? Oh, no. Okay. I probably shouldn't have brought this guy up. Because Anthony is now, uh... 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 Not Anthony. I guess is really all I can say. Uh, Emily. Emily. Um, yeah. So this guy looks like Emily. Uh, yeah, the COD thing, I think he said the dude who first got up to start screaming was kicked off the team or something. Oh, shit. Okay. That's a dude, right? Uh... Well, um, his pronouns are Bur Burger King. They <laughs> oh no, <laughs> oh god, oh man, um, bunch of things attacking you, and you don't have battery for flashlight and like one bullet. Jeez, I don't know if this is a dude or not, but um, I know Anthony from Linus Tech Tips. Emily, <laughs> I guess. I don't, man, okay. We'll just keep watching this. <laughs> Jesus, dude, his voice. It'll never happen. Holy shit. Holy fuck. They're all training to become death metal singers. It looks... You know... Imagine the smell. Imagine what that room smells like after they get done raging like that. Look, you got C4. Looks like a, like a rain or something. The COD players I knew back in the day were wild and toxic. Some like... Seems like some things don't change. Now, I will say, I was definitely one of those toxic Call of Duty players back in the day. Now, I wasn't, like, screaming into the mic, but I was definitely saying some things that I probably wouldn't be able to say on stream right now. That I'll leave it at that. Okay. I tried C4, and it's disgusting. I, um... I think all the energy drink kind of shit is not that good. It's kind of like a... You know, which one can you tolerate? Now, what I won't do...
is hold this up. <laughs> and I also won't say that that's what I'm currently drinking right now, but I will say to each their own. Um, but I've had some stuff where it's like people swear by it and I'm like, dude, this tastes like horse piss. Not that I would know what horse piss tastes like in any sort of context, but if I had to imagine, I want to try Badger's Gamer Fart 9000. Uh, there's a, do you, do you like gamer stuffs at all? Dude probably took a last shower 10 cons ago. Hold on, I just have to get to rank 150 and then I'll bathe, I promise. And he's like, level 25. Alright, we're not watching that again. That's Jesus. Everybody in this video is a loser. Take away their devices and have them do anything in real life and they would all score below average at anything. I don't know, what do you guys think? Do you, I, I think that the term esports is kind of stupid. I don't know about you all, um, but I think the term itself, esports, don't gamer subs make lean? Do they? Hold on. What? I didn't know anything about that. Let's see. What? Oh, okay. It's a flavor. I was like, hold on. What do you mean? They just out here serving drugs to Fortnite kids. And it's got Joe Biden. That's kind of funny. What flavor is it though? Peach tea and lemonade? What? Peach tea and lemonade? And it's purple? What? E foods is better. Tastes fire. Yeah. See, I would think it would have been like grape something. Looking at the uh whose flavor is this? Does it say? Oh man, I probably can't show some of these. Uh It's a competition and it takes skill, but I don't know if it's a sport. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like it's as much as like e video games is as much a sport as like chess. And, like, chess isn't a sport. They have one called Titty Milk, too. Dude, I've had Titty Milk. I love Titty Milk. And, uh, Guacamole Gamer Farts is pretty good, too. I wonder what that tastes like. Oh, dude, we can, we can just look at the Gamer Subs things real quick. Eat. You can't show anime girl thigh, but it's orange cream sickle, and that's the next one I'm gonna try. Fuck yes, dude. Ooh, I love some orange cream sickle stuff. Do you guys care? I'm gonna we're gonna go into dark mode. Dude, Papa Meats flavor just dropped. Watermelon and cantaloupe. Oh bro. Oh, that sounds so good. Ooh, that sounds so good. But yeah, Papa Meat's flavor just dropped, which I think is awesome. He's a good guy. Gamer Farts is the one that tastes like if Baja Blast was a Gatorade. Yeah. Guacamole Gamer Farts was the first one I tried, and it is incredible. What is this one? Sakura Splash? This one is Sour Cherry. Okay, I'm good on that. Cherry makes me sick. But only because it's like a psychosomatic thing, because I used to... Look, I've lived a wild and crazy life, and the the, the cherry flavor just can't... It, I can't do it anymore. <laughs> oh, this one still doesn't have, like, the flavor profile. That's crazy. Is this Smitty? Yep. Cherry again? Okay, I can't show anime girl thigh. Why not? Why not? 
What's wrong with it? It looks fine. Sun ripened oranges parachuting in a fluffy cloud of the creamiest cream. In a world where citrus and dairy live in perfect harmony. Bro, are they trying to get me to fuck the, tin the, the tub or what? Oh, they got rid of the limited print. You can. Oh, okay. I see. There was a, uh, what is blowhole blast? Oh God. Um, mango, coconut, and passion fruit with a finishing touch of lime. That sounds pretty good. Actually. I, I'm not a big fan of coconut. And then, uh, brand risk is, uh, pay money wubby. And it's a uh, peach mango. It's pretty good. I've had his. Cherry lime sickle, dude. This is the third cherry flavor. Shy Lily, yeah. Uh, Jujutsu Kaisen. Wubbies is the best peach. Yeah, it's it's hard to not get something that's like peach flavored that doesn't just taste like peach rings. And his actually tastes like like the the like the syrup from like a uh, like a thing of peaches. So it's pretty good. It's pretty good. It doesn't taste like uh like fake peach. What is this one? Raspberry tea. Must have an abundance of cherry flavoring. Isn't um Okay, do you guys do you guys want me to ruin raspberry flavoring for you or no? I can, but if you don't want me to, I understand. Grandpa's ashes. Sweet raspberry cremation. Okay, I don't like the word cremation. Oh, I see. Because they're ashes. Never mind. See, I went uh, a different route. Okay, never mind. Okay. But wait, what? Raspberry cream. Okay. What about I am Wildcat glitch flavor tubs? Is it on here? Oh, dude, they got four pages. Holy shit. Morning, Mia. JFJ brand. Is this the... Uh, uh, who's this guy? I forget. This Is this Cardboard Cowboy? Ooh, freshly baked apple pie. Holy fuck. Gamer Girl Thighs is amazing. Ooh, I don't think I've had it. I don't think I've had it. And then we looked at Lean. This one's supposed to be like a spicy margarita. Just woke up. Oh, shit. I mean, I just woke up like an hour ago, so I'm not too far behind. Or you're not too far behind. Starting to sound like vape flavors. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. <laughs> but yeah, it's zesty lime and a gradual control to heat. This unique elixir. Yeah, it's been described as spicy margarita. This is H3H3. I'm glad you said that, me. I was just saying it's the next one I want to try because I never knew the flavor until recently. Hey. There's a uh, lean tastes like cough syrup to me. Uh, oh shit. Someone was, uh, who was it? Who, 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 who's, uh, who, hell yeah, you'll like it. Hair flavor. Is this soda popping? Is this soda popping? I'm assuming it is. Titty milk. There it is. There's the titty milk. Sweet six pack. Cherry. God damn it. With a little bit of pineapple. Why is it all cherry? Uh, titty milk is blue raspberry with a natural milk flavor. <laughs> it's very good. 
Arctic Cooler. Tangerine Lime. Ooh. Ooh, that sounds delicious. Game of Girl Thigh is great. Titty Milk is my current favorite. Okay, brain loading. <laughs> uh blue it's just called blue it has no <laughs> no flavor profile at all it's what flavor is that blue what blue Clyde's Black Cherry, Dragon Fruit Punch, Just Melon, Lemon Limeade, Lemonade, Likey, Mango Meta, Peach Tea, Daba <laughs> I'm blue. <laughs> Incredible. Emotional Damage. I've never had any gamer sup, so I'm going to try to get some, since I'm on a tight budget after I quit my first job and doing some side jobs now. So they have sample packets that you can get, and they'll send you three free ones in the mail. Right here. Uh, and that way you can try a few of them. Usually it's these three, or like, a, you know, they'll swap like one of these out. But uh, no cost to you. You should definitely do it. You should definitely do that. And uh, and try some before you uh, invest in the tub or anything. So they do they do have something where you can like try it without paying for it, which is pretty awesome. Usually always gamer farts though, which is cool. Yeah, guacamole gamer farts is still like definitely gonna be in my top three probably forever. But I really want to try that uh that Papa meat one. Yeah, I think a. Uh, I don't know if I can link this in the chat here, but I'll try. What's the worst that can happen? They banned me from my... Hey, there you go. Um, and that'll get you these free packets. Now, I do want to say I'm not associated with gamer subs at all. I think they're great. Uh, I have met the dude that started the company, and he is super cool, super chill, and is... Uh, definitely pro streamer, uh, from, from like testimonials and shit that I've seen. So I'd love to be, but I am currently not associated or affiliated with them in any way. I just like their stuff. Oh, are these like the, uh, the caffeine free versions? Yeah. Yeah, really cool company. Absolutely. But yeah, I didn't see that one. Uh, what'd you say it was? I am Wildcat. I didn't see that one. I like their cups. Hey, I'm drinking from one right now. But again, I'm not affiliated with them in any way. This is a gift. <laughs> Otherwise, it'd be in a, like a fucking plastic Walmart water bottle <laughs> but hell yeah uh sony and xbox and talks for helldivers 2 cross-platform release Ooh, ooh. i don't know why they don't just put every game on every console now because it feels like I don't know if it feels this way to anybody else, but I feel like the console brands themselves, um, I feel like, like the, the, the community behind them, I don't know if that makes sense, but like, you guys remember the console wars, started PS2, Xbox, right? That... That, and then the PS3, Xbox 360 era, like, it's never gonna be like that anymore. It's like, consoles rarely, like, don't really have their own identity, if that makes sense. It's like, Xbox 360, you had, like, I think the console wars ended already, right? I mean, I, 
you ask any Xbox or PlayStation fan what they think of the other one, and in their minds, it is going stronger than ever. Just like a rectangle that plays... Yeah, exactly. Like, I feel like the only thing that matters now is just the software. You know, it's like the the manufactured exclusivity because you know they're they're withholding a whole mar a whole chunk of the market to themselves like from themselves and for what you know why wouldn't you just put it on the other one i had a playstation and xbox i am one with yin and yang yeah see like i had uh i had the 360 and then i had a ps4 and you know i've i've had a pc for a while now and i i could never like honestly see myself going back to console um which is why it's just kind of like looking at it objectively and just being like why are you guys fighting why don't you guys just merge everything together and just you know make the same box and one group of people will give their money to Sony for the box, and one group of people will give their money to Microsoft for the box. It is what it is. I don't know. I feel like that's basically where we're at at this point. I, I feel like Sony had to move away from like the big black box looking thing just so that you could tell them apart this time. Because otherwise, like all the specs are virtually the same. I don't know. It's so weird. And now Xbox, I don't know if you guys saw this, but Microsoft was talking about um, basically putting Windows on Xbox. So you'd be able to do like, you know, it'd obviously be like a, a light version of Windows, but it'd, it'd be like a, you know, having a mini PC. And at that point, I'm like, just make, just make computers like more affordable. Just, just put all that all that re R and D and all that shit into like, I don't know, making a laptop that is worth a fuck. That's not, you know, $1,500. I don't know. I don't know. That's just me or, uh, you know, whatever, make, make PCs, just make a, just make a, just make many PCs that run like the Xbox app. Cause that's all it is, is like when you go on the Xbox thing, you just Xbox app. It's just a UI thing. And then, uh, I don't know. I don't know. I feel like we're all on the same page in here. And then mods? What does this even mean? Can any, okay, Billie Eilish Fortnite Festival. What does that mean? Are they doing like uh like Coachella in Fortnite now? Is that why nobody was there in real life? Is that why there was ver uh, apparently like Coachella had maybe a third of its usual attendance this year? Everyone just stopped giving a fuck. Does anyone feel like um like all the institutions that we have as far as like sports and movies and music and stuff is just kind of like, everyone's like, I don't fucking care anymore, dude. Anybody else where it's like, you might have one or two things that you're excited for, but otherwise it's just like, who made this? Why? Who is this for? For like everything. <laughs> it's almost kind of sad. I feel like, um, now that AI is getting a little further, we're going to have more like independent creators and stuff. And we're going to start seeing a lot more like independent filmmakers that like don't need the studio and they distribute it online and shit like that and make money that way. I feel like it's coming. I feel like it's coming. Eventually you're going to start seeing a bunch of people that are like from YouTube or, you know, that do their movies on YouTube and make money that way. I feel like it's coming. The way that the way that Netflix movies now have a category at like the Oscar or whatever could be nominated for Oscars and people win for Netflix stuff. Eventually it's gonna be for like all like like independent online director or something. I, I feel it coming. I feel it in my plums. 
my plums are in there in the kitchen. Um, flag flies at Bolsonaro's. Like Quevel Cop? Yeah. But more so like instead of depend or like uh I don't know like I mean Quebel Cop we all knew that he was just trying to do as little as possible manually so that he could just milk out things while he's sleeping, you know. Um but I would say like you know where you might need this like incredible backdrop or B-roll or you know this that or the other to help like subsidize where it would have taken like way more money than it probably should or needs to, I guess. Um, just like little things. So not like making the, all of the content like AI based, but using the AI to help like supplement where, you know, like independent type content may fall flat compared to like studio budgets and stuff. So hopefully it's just used in like that way. And it's not just, hey, I just typed in, you know, three paragraphs into chat GPT. Here's my movie. I'd be like, what the fuck is this? I hope it's like a, like touching things up and like, you know, better lighting and effects and things like that. I think it's coming. Biden bashed as worst president ever. Crazy. Everything's very expensive right now. I would say a lot more. I would say a lot more. Wait, Al Roker sued over DEI policy? What? Hold on. Al Roker, who is black, is being sued by Bill Schultz, who is white, for refusing to follow DEI rules. Oh, hold on. I don't think that's him. So, you know, I have a Wikipedia. Oh, there it is. Ooh. Born in New York, New York. Artists have a program that changes the color of pixels in their art that isn't seen by the naked eye, but AI can see it, so it messes up the AI art programs as to not steal from artists. Hey, that's a... Uh, see, I like stuff like that. There was a shirt. There was a shirt that I saw. Oh, hold on. We'll keep that up. It, like, scrambles AI. Oh, shit. Okay. No. I'm not going to be able to find it. Shit. Sure, that beats AI. Yeah, this stuff. So, like, if you do stuff like this, apparently it can't detect a person. Like, wearing stuff like this. See, you can't tell that she's there because there's so many oblong shapes that it's like, oh, this isn't a people. And, like, they have little... If you look close enough, like, they have little tiny specks that don't necessarily interfere with the image. So it's kind of like what you're talking about, where it's like, you know, you'll see these, like, little shapes and patterns and things in it and stuff that just, like, completely throw off everything that AI's learned. And it's going to be funny when, like, they account for this and it messes up everything that came before it.
this is okay. Why does this look like Hassan? This looks like Hassan. He shaved his head. Yeah. But yeah. Bill Schultz. Oof. All right, what is he doing to Al Roker? According to Schultz, he wanted black writers, but Al Roker instead chose to hire white writers. This is the insanity of the left. An entitled white man believes he can use racism against black people to sue a black man. Wait. I have dumb AI all over again. That would be... Look, let's go back to the Will Smith eating spaghetti, please. Um, but yeah, that's funny. So, so Bill Schultz is trying to say that Al Roker was racist towards black people? How does, how does that even make sense? What the fuck? What? My TV just turned itself on. And then it turned itself off. What is happening? What is that? Dude, it's not me. Hold on. <laughs> what the fuck? Get out of my house, CIA. Where's my remote? What? Unplugging the TV. I don't like that. That was weird. My TV has been off, right? Am I? Right? It's been off, right? Oh, fuck. Now I don't know. That's so weird. My remote is not even near me. That's so weird. What the fuck? What was that? Did you guys see that? Dude, I swear, I swear the, the government done tapped into my house. Maybe. Probably not. I don't think I'm important enough for all that. Oh, dude, we still have to finish this. The Minds of Men. We still have to finish this. A ghost? Maybe. Some sort of... Some sort of spooker. Some, some uh... Something. Government agent, man. I swear, there's a little post outside of my front lawn that somebody left in, in my lawn that just says CIA on it. No bullshit. Really weird. Really, really very weird. All right, all right, we're going to get into this. So this is MK Ultra. We're going to finish this. We still have 30 minutes left on this. And then, um, I don't know, we'll see what else we can get into. I'm wondering if, uh, if we can find, find like a another conspiracy thing to watch or like uh i need to see i need to see about that uh that kona blue or that kona was it kona blue or whatever from uh damn the joe rogan tucker carlson thing where they were talking about the aliens yesterday or the day before or something something like that And they talked about like the the JFK assassination and uh, all kinds of other stuff, man. It was crazy. A complete joining of man and machine will be calculated according to a strict system, the so-called biocracy. So this, for those that don't know, this is about MK Ultra. 
It is a program that uh, was used by the CIA. It has been declassified, by the way. So, like, they've admitted that they've they did MK Ultra. So it's not even like a like a theory. It's like this happened. This stuff happened. Uh, morning streams have been wild. Twenty twenty four has been wild. Yeah, yeah. Twenty twenty four. We started out with aliens and Jews coming out of tunnels. That's how this year started. Do you guys remember that? It is not even May. It is not even May. And we've had World War III. We've had China moving in on Taiwan. We've had um, people setting themselves on fire. We've had um, OJ died. We've had, uh, fuck, all kinds of other shit, man. It's been crazy. Um, but, uh, but it's, I saw that. Yeah. Yeah, dude. Shit's just getting crazy. Um, but aliens are a thing. Apparently, allegedly. Now they're saying that like the aliens don't come from space. They live under the earth. So they're like subterranean aliens, which is insane because it, man, I've been working on this conspiracy theory myself. Uh, and it'll actually be out on my podcast, uh, next Friday. I'm ready for the mothership, man. I don't know if it's going to be a mothership though. I think they're just going to be like mole people. They're going to be the people from the descent. Have you guys ever seen the creatures from the descent? Beam me up. No, man, they're going to pull you down. Dude. No. They're these. You don't want these? Come on, man. Come on, man. They're going to look like this. They're going to be like this. Definitely lizard people, and I know they have a ship to Venus. Venusians. You know people from Venus would be called Venusians? Isn't that weird? Venusian. 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 This is what Venusians look like. <laughs> someone was... Bro, you know someone was just like... Asian, Venusian, close enough. Fuck it. Put her in the role. <laughs> What the fuck? Is Venus just lava? Venus ain't just no damn lava. This ain't Venus either, man. This is like... There's a filter on this, man. They put a gradient filter on this. You can tell. The Venusian sky, sky cities of our future. Wait, what? That's my uncle? Leave him alone? <laughs> Your uncle's in the descent? Or wait, is your uncle the Asian lady? Oh, fuck. <laughs> this is your uncle? What's his name? Wait, why are they... Why are they explicit? Oh, no. Uh... Hold on. Oh. Oh, that's not bad. It's just fake blood. Oh my god. Holy fucking shit balls, dude. This is in I don't like the way this guy's looking. Why does he look like he's been peppered? He looks like somebody peppered a, a fucking fried egg, dude. It doesn't doesn't it rain acid on Venus? Does it? It was supposed to acid rain here, wasn't it? Like on Earth? I feel like that's what Al Gore told me. Like 18 years ago, he was like, yo, if we don't stop driving cars, uh, uh, looks friend-shaped to me. <laughs> He's like, if we don't stop driving cars, the rain's going to start melting people. And then we made more cars and more people and nobody melted. That was really weird. 
uh, multiple by reaction of sulfur dioxide and water in the planet's atmosphere. What? Can I see? Okay, that's definitely not real. Bro, why does it gotta look like a hellscape? Oh, okay, so there's no, there's no words. There's no words. It's also called Earth's sister planet due to similar size. Let's see what acid, wait, what? Let's see what acid rain is doing up in the Smokies. Wait, did I miss? I missed. Uh, I missed some er, some Venus. It has a diameter of twelve thousand one hundred and four kilometers, and a mass of four point eight septillion kilograms. Oh fuck, dude! Venus looks awesome. Venus has a dense and hostile atmosphere. Hostile? Does Venus's atmosphere have weapons? Are they armed? Is it? Wait. How would, what it, what is that? How do you refer to, is the atmosphere, uh, an it? How the fuck did they weigh Venus? Bro, you know, it was just like a, but you ever have that friend that's like, bro, that's like 45 pounds and it's like either 90 or 15 and they were completely off. Wasn't there a guy who invented a new safe way to use cars with just water and ended up dead afterwards? I mean, probably. Probably. I wouldn't doubt it. I would say that... I mean, it's the same with, like, the people that have, like, you know, had claims of curing un uncurable diseases. And then, you know, all of a sudden they wind up not alive anymore. But, you know, maybe they all just knew Hillary Clinton. There's no telling. Allegedly. Um, but yeah, I, I don't know how the fuck. I, I feel like they were just like, mm, it's about 11,000, 12,000 something. What did they say? 12,000 what? 12,000 kiloton, kilotons? Kilograms? Venus is 12 kilograms. I'm going to say, okay, so Venus weighs somewhere between one kilogram, oh, septillion. Okay, so I was, I was off a little. <laughs> I was off by a couple. <laughs> My bad. I forgot to carry the one. Oops. Um, uh... Uh, yeah, but like, we don't even, have we ever even weighed something that, that weighs a septillion tons? How do we know what that weighs like? How do we know, how do we know that the, the inside of Venus isn't just hollow? What if it's just hollow? What if it's negligible to <laughs> look, give or take a few, you know, it's fine. Prove me wrong. You prove me wrong. Not you specifically, but if you're watching this and you disagree that Venus is, could be 12 kilograms, disprove it. Okay? Show, go, put, go build a scale, put Venus on it, <laughs> and, and you tell me. Show me the math. <clears throat> made up of 96% carbon dioxide and 3.5% nitrogen gas how much does our earth's core weigh that's a great question or wait is this a joke is this a joke or are you setting me up 6 septillion pounds bro I could lift it you ever meet people like that? Bro, I could probably lift that. Maybe maybe not like, you know, do reps, but I could get it up there. 
That's 45% of the planet's total mass and significantly higher than the results of seismic measurements, which estimate the core makes up 33% of Earth's total mass. No, only Chris can lift that. Dude, Chris can't lift a goddamn thing, okay? The only thing Chris lifts is our spirits. Up into his spirit bomb. <laughs> Uh, also, how do they know how much the atmosphere is made of? Wait, that wasn't a real sentence. <laughs> how do they know what the atmosphere is made of and how much of each element <laughs> there is? Chris would be able to lift that with one vampire finger. I'd like to see him try. I could do it, though. Due to the high amount of carbon dioxide. Sunlight gets trapped in its atmosphere. Science. Exactly. Science. Which increases its surface temperature to above 465C. Wait, so... Where's tomato when I need backup? Um, dude, so if I went to Venus, realistically, so it's just there's a bunch of sunlight that's trapped and want, just wants to go home. And Venus is like, no, you're staying here with me. So I'll just take a gun with me to Venus and I'll just shoot the atmosphere until it dies and then be like, you're free, sunlight. Go home. And then it'll be a lot cooler. Literally. I'm just saying, man, like, look, we've got these people in charge. And I feel like maybe they should let me give it a swing, you know, because I'd be like, oh, we have a problem. Shoot it. And then the pro like poverty, not don't shoot poor people, just shoot. Poverty. So, like, whenever you see the word poor in a book, shoot the book. Uh, I learned a lot of science stuff from Starfield. Nice. Dude. Okay, so we're taking you to Venus with us. Uh, how, how fast do you think you could do the base building on Starfield, but here? Uh, and like he, uh, he, I, I can't help you at all. I don't know anything about it. I did play Starfield. Um, I didn't build a base, so I don't, I don't know anything about. I could like, uh, oh, dude, I'll read the uh, if uh, if you get stuck somewhere, I'll read the tutorial to you. Oh fuck, I won't be able to do that until you establish like a communication thing. Hopefully, you got that, you got that one down, you got that one down. I'm sure. I got my space knowledge from Mass Effect. Dude, I... So I looked up at the Eclipse without Eclipse glasses the other day. Weird, right? I'm, I'm probably blind now. But, uh, you know, it is what it is. Are you okay? I mean, define okay. It depends. You'll need a skill for it to be able to build on a dangerous planet. Is that why you've been wearing those sunglasses? I don't know. Maybe. I feel okay. My eyes feel fine. It's just like having this bright light beam down on me is... Fucking sucked. It sucked ass. So I don't know. I mean, I feel okay. My eyes are red. Are you seeing dots now? No. Should I be? Should I be seeing dots? Look at Google Trends for the search result. Why am I... 
my eyes hurt. Crazy shit. I'm not seeing any dots that I'm aware of. And my eyes are bloodshot because uh, well, yesterday it was 420. He has to wear the glasses because he's a fed. I mean, hold on. Hold on. I still have. I'm still wearing my sleep. Oh, I wasn't expecting to have to. I don't know. What do you guys think? Do what now? Oh no, you may be getting worse. You need to see dots to be okay. Hold on. Okay, don't fuck with me like that though. Am I am I supposed to see dots? He has to show his authority. Hey. Okay, hold on. I'm going to be fine. I'm going to be look, I'm I'm going to be just fine. Okay? Look. You guys think the sun can hurt me? It's all the way up there. Bro. Come on now. Yeah, if you don't see dots, you need to see a doctor. Wait, really? I I don't like you guys teaming up on me like this. <laughs> Very specific. Dark spots are experienced, blurry vision, usually days or weeks later. The sun is called the cancer ray. Bro, dude, somebody send me up there. I'll fucking fight it, dude. I'll be like, this is for my family. Or, uh, I feel like it's my, um, I don't know. I don't know. I mean, it'll be sun versus sun, right? I think shots will give you the spots. Like lesions? Like lesions? Like lesions errors? Lesionares? If we send you to the sun, you may become maybe you may become Superman? I don't wanna come Superman. That what? Hold on, which one? I don't actually that I don't think that's going to be very important. Scientists have found water and oh, you guys can't see the video. Look, words are hard. Where, words that are hard. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. No, he'll become his true form of seven seasons. Wait. So is that son the son of God? Dude, wait a minute. Hold on. I'll go fight the sun and take its power. And then I'll become the son of suns. What is, is that? That's like the king of kings. Kinda. Uh, scientists have found water and sulfur dioxide in its clouds. Scientists found, how? How? That lucky old sun, son of suns. Due to which it rains sulfuric acid on it. But much before reaching the surface. Oh, see, so it like, it rains, but it doesn't hit the ground. Acid rain evaporates in the air and this cycle continues. Ooh, so it's in the air. Acid air? And then there's a monkey. Uh, then you can take down the all-powerful vampire god. Oh, look, the sun is their weakness. So naturally, naturally, I feel like it would help. I feel like it would work. 
Okay, what what the fuck were we even doing? We were talking about MK Ultra. God damn, I got so fucked. How did I get on Venusian Acid Rain? How the fuck does that happen? Dude, it's been like three minutes. What the fuck even happened? Was it me? It was probably my fault. We were talking about spots, but why? But why? We were making sure you're, you were seeing dots, but I'm not. Should I be? Hold on. Where would I see it? You guys are just fucking with me. Well, if you choke yourself, you'll probably see dots. Yeah, like, uh, like the, isn't that the white blood cells going to repair your, where you damage your eyes or whatever? Or something? I can't. Everything just looks normal. Everything just looks normal. Everything looks fine. Okay, my eyes aren't fucked up. You guys need to stop. Look, I've got enough shit to, to worry about. Okay, I don't need to think that I'm going blind. Vika told me the spots are good. Huh? Oh, fuck. Okay, well. Rip. Rip. No, sir. What? Wait, hold on. Do we have a mis do we have a disinformation campaign going on in my chat right? Now? What is happening here? Am I going to be okay? I feel like I'm going to be okay. Yeah, dots and spots are good. What? Okay, I'm back. What are we up to, children? How many fingers am I holding up? Oh, fuck. I did... Fuck, dude, I can't count. Uh, one, two, three, four... I don't know, like 16? Uh... We're trying to get seven to see the healthy spots. There's... Dude, okay, am I supposed to be seeing spots? Is that, like... Close enough? Hell yeah. Fuck yeah. 16 fingers, baby. <laughs> they call them D16 fingers B. What the fuck are healthy spots, Kramer? Are we still on the sun thing? Dude, am I gonna die? Are my eyes gonna die? <laughs> Can someone who is trying to fuck with me? Um... I just want to watch the video I I have in my left eye. The spot is named Bob. You need one too. No. Continue on the videos. <laughs> okay, so a biocracy is the joining of man and machine. Is that when sex robots happen? Is that when we'll have a biocracy? Sex robots get get uh get voters' rights. If you're genuinely concerned see a doctor or optician ah uh, but what if they tell me i'm not okay see then i'll officially be fucked where like right now i just get to live in the mystery and be like nah nah i'm just going it's you know it, everything's fine It will be impossible to escape this system of adaptation because it will be articulated with so much scientific understanding of the human being. 
Is this like the singularity? Because, as it should be glaringly obvious by now, that is not what this was ever about. The psycho civilized society. Oh, wait, we already saw this part. What? The individual will have no more need of conscience and virtue. His moral and mental health or moral and mental furnishings will be a matter of the biocrats' decisions. Ooh, I don't like that. So we'll just be like, uh, like a hive mind. The technological society. That was Jacques Ellul. In chimpanzee body, brainwaves telemetered from the left and right amygdala were received and automatically amygdala. analyzed by an online analog computer. This instrument was instructed how the, to... How are the levels? Is it too loud? Is it too loud? I feel like it's too loud. How's this? Recognize a specific pattern of waves. The computer was also instructed to activate a stimulator. Each time the waves appeared, radio signals were sent to pad his- It's the spots. I see them finally. They're here on the screen. ...brain to stimulate a point known to have negative reinforcing properties. Electrical stimulation of one cerebral it. structure was contingent oh, upon specific EEG patterns in another area of the brain. And the whole process of identification of information and command of action was decided by the online computer. Too. In this process, Patty's very capacity for carrying out certain behaviors was drastically and rapidly altered through a very sophisticated form of computer-driven conditioning, which continued until the offending brain activity was no longer physically possible. Two hours after the brain-to-computer feedback was established, activity in the amygdaloid nucleus was reduced to 50%. Six days later, with daily two-hour periods of feedback, drastically reduced to only 1% of normal occurrence. The experiment showed how brain waves could be singled out and virtually eradicated. Whoa. Using the autocorrelator, EEG expression was filtered, altered, and domesticated. Monkey. Hey. Yeah, they kind of, they did some terrible things to that monkey. So they hooked up electrodes to that monkey's brain and permanently fried some of the uh, neurological pathways to make it docile. Apparently, that's I think that's what they were just talking about. Where like they wanted to see if they could manipulate the personality of a monkey. So they isolated like the brain waves that made it like erratic and, you know, upset and angry and shit like that and were able to uh, neuralize those brain waves and make it like docile and passive. Why would they just pan down to that lady? Uh, okay. What is? Oh, she's just staring at the, the wall. Project moved forward. She's tapping her feet. There's a tamper of mine. But no matter what the cost, the American people are prepared to pay the price of victory. Going to people to accept these monstrous treatments that do nothing but destroy brain tissue and dehumanize people. Let us march toward the clean world our hands can make. There's a tamper of mine. There's a tamper of mine. What? And if so, does anyone have the right to do that? Leonard would die three decades later at the age of 65 at the Bedford VA just outside Boston, having spent the latter half of his life a totally disabled, heavily medicated mental patient in a psych ward. Oh, did they do that to him? Despite having completely ruined a man's life after yeah, mutilating his wow. brain, doctors Mark and Irvin continued to publish success stories about Leonard's case up until at least 1975. 
So they were bragging about being successful about operating on this guy, but he was institutionalized, so he couldn't even share his side of the story. And apparently he was like fucked. But I wouldn't, even if they were convicted of murder, want to unleash these psychosurgeons on them. There are protections against cruel and unusual punishment. Believe me, it is crueler to have done to you what was done to Leonard Kyle than to be put to death. It's crueler and more hopeless and more horrible. In May 1972, Dr. William Sweet again personally approached the Senate Labor and Health Education and Welfare Appropriations Committee for more money. This time, Sweet was asking for a million dollars to branch out, to open a series of violence Who's institutes like the... So he was like a, uh, he was a whistleblower. He essentially uh is a doctor and um found out what was happening and back in like the 90s like tried to blow the whistle I'm talking about the floater in the eyes hey <laughs> you leave me and my floater alone okay he, he comes and goes as he pleases not in my eye though or wait hold on phrasing never mind forget i've said anything uh you talking about that floater in the eyes no I see, I see. Yeah, and um, so basically he got like super discredited and stuff, and then all of the documents and shit came out, and he's like, all right, well, I mean, now everyone knows what I was trying to tell everyone. So what do you guys want to know? And uh, that's when he sat down for this documentary, basically. Boston Project for the Study of Violent Behavior Across the Nation. Sweet stated on the record that his appearance before Congress was on behalf of not just himself and colleagues at Harvard and MGH, including Dr. Vernon Mark, but also the Brain Research Institute of UCLA, in addition to UCLA's Neuropsychiatric Institute, under the medical direction of Dr. Lewis Jollyon West. Dr. West, West spent his entire career first in the military and later in academia, Researching all manner of behavior modifications. That's Kanye West. Everything then. from cults to communist mind control techniques, dissociation, hypnosis, sensory deprivation, hallucinogens, for which he attended cybernetician Frank Fremont Smith's Macy's Conference on LSD, social engineering, and more. As a psychiatrist, Dr. West reportedly examined Lee Harvey Oswald's assassin Jack Ruby, Jack homicidal Ruby. cult leader Charles Manson. Infamous kidnap I victim was Patty Frank Hearst. West, man. Both. It's both. Frank West. Where do I know that name? Fuck. Frank West. Oh yeah, Dead Rising. Yes. Yes. Yeah, hell yeah. Dude, I was just talking about that game yesterday with Crimson. I was like, dude, do you need to dust off Dead Rising? That's awesome. Sorry, my ear itched. Um, dude, so yeah, there's a lot of uh, speculation and stuff that uh, Char Charles Manson was so crazy because he was in MKUltra. They, like, experimented on him and turned him crazy and made him, like, a sleeper agent for, uh, like, to indoctrinate other people to do what they did to get people to have like a negative sentiment against hippies. Yeah. Yeah. Like everyone's like, yeah, he was crazy and got institutionalized and accused of murder and like, you know, through these kids and you know, he fucking was unpredictable and fucking crazy and shit. Right. And it's like, well, uh, he was in MK Ultra allegedly. He was part of it, like in it, like as an experiment. Who knows? Who knows? That's just 
Now, these are just things that I've seen and read. I'm not purporting them as fact or anything, but kind of makes you wonder. Who was in charge around that time? Wasn't it Nixon? Wasn't it Nixon? Wasn't Nixon trying to trying to demonize the hippies and the blacks according to his what was it, his former press secretary? That's like a direct quote. Almost. I'm still par paraphrasing a little bit, but he said that they were trying to get the nation to dislike hippies and black people because the Black Panthers and the whole like anti you know war movement and stuff like that. I don't know. The man convicted of assassinating RFK, Sirhan Sirhan, and even convicted Oklahoma City bomber Timothy McVeigh. He also reportedly monitored Height Ashbury's so-called acid ghetto before and during the Summer of Love. Ooh. It wouldn't be revealed until years later that Dr. And see, it's it's got to be noted that uh, like M MK Ultra and like the CIA and stuff were <clears throat> allegedly experimenting a lot with LSD and like lysergic acid, um, like adjacent drugs. And I'm almost wondering if like, you know, I, I think it's pretty much common knowledge that the that the government and specifically the CIA helped, you know, smuggle and distribute crack cocaine into the ghettos in, in the 80s. Well, who's to say they weren't just giving LSD to all the fucking hippies in the 70s and the 60s? And just being like, let's let's just see what happens. And then when like, I don't know, I guess. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. It's it's wild to speculate on, though. For sure. West was involved in CIA MK Ultra research that he was the main contractor in charge of Subproject 43 with a top secret clearance. A project involving the altering of personality through sensory isolation and environmental manipulation, including the use of drugs and hypnosis. Hmm. Dr. West's book Hallucinations is dedicated to aforementioned cybernetician Heinrich Kluver of Kluver Busey syndrome fame. Oh, shit. Unsurprisingly, right on cue, Dr. Irvin and other Boston Project associates were on their way to California ahead of Dr. West's new project, as mentioned by Dr. Sweet to Congress, the Center for the Study and Reduction of Violence at UCLA. Sounding just like Drs. Mark, Irvin, Sweet, and Delgado, Dr. West decried the growing plague of violence as our greatest ill and claimed his was just the project President LBJ's Violence Commission had called for to cure it. Mm. The massive... So, it was, yeah, LBJ was, like, uh, the... I think he was the president when, like, the MK Ultra project started. It's like, JFK got assassinated by the CIA, and then they installed fucking... Allegedly. Allegedly by the CIA. I can't say that, you know... I don't know shit. I'm retarded. Don't listen to me. I don't know nothing. Um, but, uh, and then LG, LBJ's in, and then all of a sudden, fucking, it's just like we get swarmed with shit. Where it's like, okay, now all these fucking secret projects are going through. Let's do more black ops shit. Let's do, you know, fucking, let's push Vietnam. Let's, you know, all this shit. Project would take many of the same ideas from Boston and expand them to screening the general. And who worked with LBJ? In the name of preventing, detecting, Richard Nixon. controlling, and not just treating, but pre treating all manner of antisocial and violent behavior to somehow stop it before it could occur. Broad in scope, the project called for experimenting on people of all ages and from all sectors of society, including children, menstruating women anyone deemed predisposed to alcoholism, criminals, mental patients, people diagnosed with brain disease and dysfunction, and more. Race was obviously considered a cause of violence, as the project involved plans to monitor students and introduce experimental anti-violence treatment programs at two different junior high schools, one in a predominantly what? black ethnic area, and the other in a predominantly... Junior high schools which have agreed to participate in the program. One of these junior high schools is located in a predominantly black ethnic area, the other in a predominantly Chicano area. Did they not do one in a white 
people area? Do they have to get the parents' permission? Don't they have to, like... Bro, this seems like all kinds of fun. So they were working with the school to conduct an experiment on the students in the school. On middle school children. Kano area. Here in America, mind you. A wide variety of experimental treatment methods would be employed, including everything from newly developed but unapproved chemical castration drugs to monitor. Wait, what? Yeah. Yeah. The public school system is, I mean, who, why do you think they're funded? It's, they're literally just, hey, let's, you know, indoctrinate the youth with whatever the fuck the government wants them to think. Most impressionable at that age, I guess. Yeah. Well, it's, it's that and like, uh, you know, the parents are at work all day. This here's okay. I don't know how much of this I can say. But there was a certain movement that happened to push mothers out of the household to no longer have them like raise their children. And then, you know, now all that's left is like, okay, well, the school teaches them everything now. The school teaches them everything now. And what do you think the schools, you know what I mean? I don't know if that makes sense, but I'm trying to, uh, look, I'm not a conspiracy theorist. Okay. I am. I don't know what you want to call me. I'm retarded. That's all I know. But yeah, I don't know. It's, uh, th this is wild. So chemical castration drugs on middle school children in America. And these are declassified files. Like, everything in this documentary has just come from things the CIA have released. And, like, public information, public records and stuff. So far that I've seen, like, everything that I'm Googling and stuff, it seems to pretty much check out. Answering, quote, abnormal electrical brain activity, specifically using surgical intervention by implanting tiny electrodes deep within the brain, end quote. Dr. West... They were doing this on those kids. They were opening their heads up and putting electrodes in their fucking brains. Were they doing this in the school? Was it like, hey, you don't have to go to class today, but I need you to go into this room for eight hours while we, you know, you'll get an A in math. It is even possible to record bioelectrical changes in the brains of freely moving subjects through the use of remote monitoring techniques. Sound familiar? A full third of the research projects the center ostensibly Bro. planned to carry out were based upon attempts to link violence prediction to what they deemed abnormal brain waves. Irvin, for example, made remarks that to the effect that being a do gooder or could eat two shoes or nice to people. That was a pretty good idea, but you wouldn't get any money from that. So they knew that the way to get money was to play on political and social fears and on racism. And these men are just riding that horse of violence, riding that horse of I'm right, you're wrong. I'm white, you're black. I'm a neurosurgeon, you're a nobody. I think they were just riding all of those negative human emotions, integrating it into totalitarian philosophies. The ultimate goal of all this research was described as the ability to predict violent behavior. The See, and that's my thing is like, uh, so you have all these accredited scientists and it's like this big industry of science, right? And there's tons of money in it with grants and funding and all this shit. And it's like, Obviously, they're all in bed together, you know, and for some reason, like, knowing things just gives you, like, some sort of inherent authority and, like, justification to be able to just, like, cut open someone's head, cut open a child's head and insert wires into it to, to just see what happens. 
just to just to see what happens. Who gives them that authority? The government? If that's the case, no. No, thank you. I didn't vote for that. I didn't say that that was okay to do to anybody. Do are you? Is anybody in chat okay with the idea of them like putting wires in little kids' heads against their will or without their knowledge? I'm not. I'm not. I wouldn't expect anybody here to be. I think you guys are all, you know, pretty, pretty, pretty cool people. Um, fuck. Like, if that's the case, I don't, man, I don't know if, you know, just fuck. Development of mass screenings for the general public. But normal, yeah, who's like, you know what sounds like a good idea? Who proposes this? Who's like, guys, guys, I have a new way for us to get funding from the government. Let's put wires in kids' heads. And nobody was like, no? They were like, oh, fuck, dude, that's such a good idea. They were like, yes, bro. And we can, like, fuck with it and just see what happens. Like, are you kidding me? <laughs> that should be, like, a war crime. Crime against humanity or something. Jesus Christ. In order to Exactly. That's some Metal Gear shit, dude. That's like... Dude, holy fuck. This is like some shit you see in like dystopian science fiction. And this is what was happening like 60 years ago. Who knows today? People, any violence prone individuals of all ages before they actually committed an act of violence and then initiate preventative treatment in the form of behavior modification of such individuals, even though they had not committed any crimes or done anything wrong yet. Wow. For many opponents, the UCLA project was a real life version of the Stanley Kubrick film A Clockwork Orange. Yes, holy fuck. The center fuck. was described in a congressional hearing as a laboratory for the Department of Corrections and law enforcement officials with the diaphanous veneer of UCLA. Prisoners and patients at state hospitals and medical correctional facilities would also be used as guinea pigs for this experimental research including those being held at Vacaville, Camarillo, and Atascadero. Atascadero. Vacaville had recently had its experimental maximum psychiatric diagnostic unit shut down following public outcry after it came to light that three prisoners had been amygdalotomized to inhibit their aggressive tendencies in 1968 with disaster. Whoa. Amygdalotomized. So is that what happened in A Clockwork Orange specifically? Dude, it's been so long since I've seen that movie. I just remember the eyes, the TV, the milk. Uh, 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 what what they call themselves? The weren't they called like the Goon Squad? Um, Uh, Droogs. That's it. Droogs. Sorry. I, for some reason, I thought Goon Squad. <laughs> don't, don't mind me. Um. Interest results. All of which the prison attempted the milk. to deny ever happened at first. One of the things that I had not imagined early on was all of this might have political implications. It didn't dawn on me. I'm embarrassed at how naive I was about life. I had no idea the treachery of, psychiatry. of, of outstanding people. So that's in the him, field Peter Bregan. Medicine, if you want to look him up. Neurology, neurosurgery. Through all of this, Dr. Bregan continued to publish articles and make public appearances speaking out against the Orwellian violence centers and their experimental treatments. I was not going to stop. I was just not going to stop about this. So he Again, started using he started using his doctorate shit to like request patient records and stuff from the government and they would either be like, Oh no, we can't give you that, or like, you know, we can give you this, but it's hella redacted. And he'd have to like call around and all kinds of other shit. At one point, so this is what super badass is, uh, he had one of the doctors on the phone while he had a reporter with him, and he was like, Yo, I'm at a payphone. I have a reporter with me. Uh, I need all of these documents unedited in 24 hours or I leak this story to the press because they can hear this conversation. 
Do you understand? And they were like, yeah. And they sent him everything. And he fucking used all of that to start going after the fucking shit, dude, and blowing the whistle on everything. And I'm like, that is fucking gangster. That is badass, dude. That's awesome. In the initial proposal dated September 1972, Dr. Frank Irvin was listed as a UCLA faculty member who had already submitted research to the project before it even officially began on violence in the brain, bioelectrics, and behavioral studies. Once again, it became apparent this project had already been approved in the upper echelons of government. When then California Governor Ronald Reagan proudly announced the formation and $1 million funding of the UCLA Center in his January 1973 State of the State Address. In the weeks that followed, however, the plans for the center were leaked to an already anxious public by Director West's opponents inside his own neuropsychiatric oh. institute. Protests began breaking out on the UCLA campus and outside the NPI. Oh, Protests shit. against the use of psychosurgery to curb violence. Protests against what some called a clockwork orange at UCLA. Shit. Protests against the obviously racist and sexist overtones of the proposal. And considering Dr. Irvin's timely presence at UCLA just prior to the project's announcement. Protests against doctors West and Irvin personally. Several students were Holy even arrested shit, after dude. they I never even heard about Dr. This. West's desk. The project's proposal went through at least four revisions as Dr. West frantically attempted to rebrand his new violence center and regain public trust. Frank Irvin's name was removed from all subsequent drafts altogether. Wow. So was any trace of reference to psychosurgery. Same. Something that what in the, the meantime, fuck? Dr. Mark redefined in journal articles, specifically as the creation of lesions in the brain and not the drilling into the skull for the placement of electrodes. This weak semantic argument allowed Dr. West to proclaim that his center was never going to be involved in psychosurgery of any kind, despite the fact that the placement of deep brain electrodes in test subjects, Requires possibly surgery. including children, was a stated objective in his first proposal draft. By 1974, they even took the word violence out of the title, renaming the whole thing as the UCLA Project on Life-Threatening Behavior. Life-Threatening Behavior. Despite all the edits and reassurances, Internal documents continued to get leaked to the press, Oof. and public opposition continued to build. Who was it? They're gonna find him, Funding and he's gonna. The project itself they explain was what finally... the amygdala's function is. Uh, I think they did, but I am the worst about amygdala function. Participates in the regulation of autonomic and endocrine functions decision making and adaptations of instinctive and motivational behaviors to changes in the environment through implicit associative learning changes in short and long-term synaptic plasticity and activation of the fight or flight so it's like um you're a bit like it's the thing that controls how you react to the world around you if that makes sense so like the the thing that causes like your reflexes and your ability to like uh pattern recognition uh you know learn from new data uh you know shit like that instinct essentially motion memory behavior yeah 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 and they've been like trying to zap that to like change people's personalities and the way that they behave and think and stuff And they, uh, so sometimes they would go in and they would like carve a piece of it out. Sometimes they would just like stick wires to it and zap it. Sometimes they'd use drugs that would like specifically target it. All kinds of shit. Uh, they were doing like sensory deprivation. They would like, you know, uh, gaslight people that were in there to like get them to think they were nuts. Uh, they would like stick them in a dark room and play the same sound over and over for like, 40, 50 hours at a time, make them docile. Yeah, yeah, more, uh, more complicit. Um, yeah, yeah, you get it. The monkey. Back to the monkey. 
pulled and the project officially but, abandoned. But instead of the monkey, it was middle school American American middle school children. Yeah. After a shocking letter was leaked, which hinted at something yep. far more sinister than what Dr. West had adamantly tried to sell to the public. The letter was written by Dr. West to a man who appeared to be his good personal friend, Dr. J.M. Stubblebine, then Stubblebine? director of health in the California State Office of Health Planning. It read, Dear Stubb, I am in possession of confidential information to the effect that the Army is prepared to turn over Nike missile bases to state and local agencies for non-military purposes. Wait, what they the fuck is a Nike missile base? Is that why Nike's fucking slogan is just do it? Nike missile base. What? Nike missile. Anti-air. The Nike Ajax. Is this made by Nike? <laughs> Maybe? Probably not. Uh, uh, probably not. Bell Laboratories. <laughs> subsidiary. Oh, nope. That just says what subsidiary? Parent company. AT&T. Fucking stubs. Yeah, dude. Fucking stubble. Stubble. What's this? Stub. Stu. Stubble. Something. <laughs> Alexander Graham Bell. Nokia Labs. Hold on. What? Bell Labs. So the, the motherfuckers that make phones made missiles? Dude, did they just attach like the Nokia brick phones at the end of the missiles and it was like splitting atoms? When it would hit something. You guys know what I'm talking The What was it? The Nokia 9 or something? These things. They would just tape one of these on the, on the top of the missile. And when it would land, it would fucking split an atom. I think it's named after a god from Grecian myth, Apollo. Oh shit, okay. See, I thought it was, uh, see, I thought Nike was like, uh, maybe they were funding the missiles through the shoes. <laughs> Don't mind me. Every pair of Air Jordans goes to funding <laughs> intercontinental ballistic missiles brought to you by AT&T. God damn, dude. The future, that's the world we live in. Dude, if I had a ton of those old phones, I'd make it into an armor. That's what I'm saying, dude. You fucking make a chain mail out of the Nokias, and you look, you would break nations, okay? There'd be no way to stop you. Like, you guys know the tank guy? I can't say what it was or where it was at, but that that uh that uh that one thing that uh that one thing that, that China doesn't like people talking about. Dude, if he would have had, like, those Nokia phones on him, he could have just fucking, like, punched right through the tanks, dude. Look. Oh, play Snake. T9. Uh, let's see, what would you call it? Fist of the T9? Fist of the T9! And fucking just... Straight through, dude. Like the fucking Terminator with, uh... With, uh... With games on it. May look with special favor on health related applications. Such a Nike missile base is located in the Santa Monica Mountains within a half hour's drive of the Neuropsychiatric Institute. It is accessible but relatively remote. The site is securely fenced and includes various buildings and improvements making it suitable for prompt occupancy. If this site were made available to the Neuropsychiatric Institute as a research facility, Perhaps initially as an adjunct to the new Center for Prevention of Violence, we could put it to very good use. Comparative studies could be carried out there in an isolated but convenient location 
of experimental or model programs for the alteration of undesirable behavior. Such programs might include control of drug or alcohol abuse, modification of chronic antisocial or impulsive aggressiveness, etc. My understanding is that a direct request by the governor or another appropriate officer of the state to the Secretary of Defense, or of course the President, would be most likely to produce prompt results. Needless to say, I stand available to participate in any way that might be helpful. Ooh. Louis Jollyon West, MD, Medical Director. And there it was, in black and white. So, the guy that was supposed to be ousted from the project because the whole public was pissed that he wanted to operate on middle school children. Um, not only their brains, but also chemically castrating them for some reason. I guess thinking that, like, if they cut their junk off, that they'll, you know, not be crazy or something. And I'm like, dude, if somebody cut my dick off, that's how you would make me crazy. What do you mean? Like, I'm still in search of... Never mind. Um... I don't see, I don't see how these people are the smart people, allegedly. Like, what do you mean cutting someone's dick off is going to make them more docile? Show of hands. Who here, if you had your dick cut off, would be pretty chill about it? Like, you didn't know it was going to happen. And then all of a sudden, like, you find out one day, and you find out that it was, like, the school. And you're like, hold up. Hold the fucking phone, dude. Hold your goddamn horns. You know what I'm saying? Dude, I'm almost wondering, like, did you guys ever get a shot in middle school for, like, tetanus? I'm pretty chill, and it's been chopped off. Oh, what up, Tomato. Was it MJ chemically castrated? Was he? Was he? Like, uh... Did he still have his penis? Did Michael Jackson have a... Oh, I can't believe I'm about to have to fucking Google this. God damn it. <laughs> DB, why would you do this to me? I'm so naturally curious that... Did Michael Jackson have a penis is gonna be in my Google results. <laughs> God damn it. Okay. I don't even want to, I don't want to know. I have to know. I don't think he did. I mean, I don't know, man. Could have been for the thrill of the game. Could have all been, uh, he was framed. beard and facial hair he wouldn't be able to produce testosterone michael was not caught uh, ca uh fuck uh was not castrated his autopsy noted that he had normal genitalia of an adult male and both testes were present with normal sperm spermatogenesis ruling out surgical castration wait how do they measure how much sperm is being made do they like what So, uh, so why did, why do they measure how much sperm you have and how much, how, how, the, how, how does this guy know? This guy's like, look, I know all about Michael Jackson's dick and balls. Okay. They were intact. In fact, Caps lock, bold, justify. <laughs> he has a prominent laryngeal prominence, Adam's apple. Why do you think his nose changed as it got older? I would think surgery. You want to say his nose didn't change? What? What? 
What the fuck? Uh, what? I think he was set up. I've seen Michael Jackson's dick and balls, and I can tell you they work just fine. Dr. West planned to use his confidential political back channels to acquire a newly decommissioned Nike missile base, complete with underground facilities and nestled high in a remote area of the Santa Monica Mountains. I'm sorry. I had a thought. So I watched Idiocracy yesterday, and uh, the fucking narrator's voice is in my head, and I'm like, in a world. Or, uh, wait, that's the movie trailer guy. Uh, uh, no, they're just ignorant. Yeah. No, the ignorant. I do have a dick and balls. Uh, they had to describe his penis in court a couple times. Did th Wait, Dave Chappelle has a skit on this. It's like, yeah, there's a dick, two balls, a little bit of pubic hair, and some glitter on it. And they're like, yeah, yeah, this, yeah. <laughs> you guys remember that? That was amazing and turn it into a research facility to perform his experiments, altering people's behavior in a place he personally described as securely fenced and isolated. And that was the last straw. Public outcry drowned out Dr. West's best attempts at downplaying his center's true goals. The project was, at least officially, shut down. Dude, I can't believe all this shit Kanye West's dad did. That's crazy, dude. He should have just made beats like his son. We are advancing rapidly in the pattern recognition of electrical correlates of behavior. Dr. Delgado's highly publicized taming of the bull was just the opening act before the real show began. This shit was crazy. So, uh, for those of you that might have missed the last stream, uh, what they did was they put electrodes in a bull and they hooked it up to a remote control so that the guy could be a matador without having to have, like, the cape thing. It'd be like the bull would start charging at him and he'd press a button and then the bull would, like, stop and fucking, like, walk off. Shit's wild. Watch the one on the right. The one on the right's the remote control. So he gets it to like spin around, like stop. Ole! Zzz. Automatic learning is possible by feeding signals directly into specific. Remote Ole. Ole remote lay. Neuronal er, structures uh, without conscious participation. Conscious participation. Whoa. What struck me about Delgado, first of all, was that he was a political philosopher. He wasn't just a psychosurgeon that put electrodes in the brains of people and bulls. This guy looks like a gremlin. And he was Remote a Ole. political philosopher who saw the fundamental principles of America. Tio Foley says... Declaration of Independence, in particular, as being scientifically incorrect based on the neuroscience of the 1960s. That humans aren't individuals. They're under the influence of all kinds of forces. That means they're not individuals. They may feel self-important, but they're not important. And they may think they had rights as individuals, but the society had rights, not the individual. His view was 100% consistent with society versus the individual, doing anything to the individual in the name of the social good. Humanity uh, behaves in general no more intelligently than animals would under the same circumstances. And this alarming reality is due largely to spiritual pride. Violence is a product of culture and environment, and is an extreme form of aggression. Man may react to unpleasant and painful stimuli with violence. A major role of education is to build internal controls in human beings so that they can withstand external pressures and maintain internal equilibrium. It was a totalitarian philosophy under which 
he was doing social control and personal control of people. Cybernetics was first described by Norbert Wiener as communication Wiener. and control in the animal. Fucking Wiener has come back. Wiener has returned. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, I'm going to show you guys this. That's Tia Foley. We made that on stream together. Remember, you guys made me make the, 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 I almost called it, uh, Ole, Elote. Wiener is everywhere. Uh, now calm down. Calm down. Calm down now. Just because we're on my, Wiener has entered the, oh, fuck. Uh, uh. Is he gone? Is he gone? That's my uncle. Is the wiener gone? Uh, the second coming of wiener. Oh fuck! When did he come the first time? Or wait, I guess I'm I, I'm okay that I missed that. Where'd he go? I was hiding from the wiener. He entered the chat. I don't want him to. I don't look. I don't want wiener in my brain. Okay, it doesn't sound like a good time. and the machine. Human languages have remained complex in their unraveling and interpretation. Even computer languages must be defined. In cybernetic terms, EEG brainwaves represented the world's first known non-symbolic language, able to directly communicate Eric, signals we'll see and later, meaning into the partitions of the mind. Direct communication was key. Oh, I heard of Wiener Man and came back. What is going on? To... So there's this guy named Wiener. What is it? Uh, wasn't it like a Robert Wiener? Oh, Bob Ween, Bob Weenie, Bob Wiener. Go around poking around. Wiener was poking around and pe Norbert Wiener. That's it. That's it. Norbert Wiener. Oh, Norb Ween. Old Bert Wien, um, he Wiener was poking around in people's heads, and Wiener was sticking his head. Or wait, uh, never mind. Uh, he's not. He's not a good guy. <laughs> Code brainwaves to interpret EEGs and to encode reciprocal messages that a computer understands and responds to automatically. This was sophisticated, technologically driven mind control in action. So a bad wiener. Yes. Most people the worst simply wiener. can't grasp such a Like that scene in Scary Movie, <laughs> the bathroom scene. Come here. <laughs> wiener was poking things he shouldn't have been poking. Exactly. Exactly. Don't let wiener's, wiener's poking reach your brain. Thing. Can't think it, imagine it, or believe it. Don't take An my word plea for it. Is deaf to the drone of society, uh, and each person learns to live according to its rhythms. Weaning rainbow. Saul cells work on MK uh, Ultra Sub Project 119, proposed and put into action in 1959, sought to activate the human retarded. organism by remote electronic means Whoa. using bioelectric sensors, a lead with 24 channels of brainwave data recording and data processing devices, and what cells called an autocorrelator. Auto the very machine the MIT and MGH teams developed to analyze and interpret EEGs. <laughs> While the first autocorrelator of 1955 took 20 minutes to analyze Norbert Wiener's brain, oh. subsequent versions of the device could surely approach real time. Wait a minute. So were these Wiener ratings? Wiener rankings? Ratings? Oh, fuck. And with infinite... Dude, you can get those for like $12 on OnlyFans or something, right? $5? $5 for Wiener's ratings. Or... More channels of data. By the 1960s, Dr. Delgado demonstrated that his devices could automatically monitor, correct, 
and recondition the very mental capacities of his experimental subjects. And that is an idea unlikely to be forgotten. Who is Richard Pick and why does he keep sending stuff to everyone's phone? All right. Is that Chris? Can the human the hot dog bath? And remain human. Oh, wiener water. Oh, fuck. Were predicted 35 Dude. Years ago. What if Chris what is just doing his own MK Ultra? It's titled Brave New... Brave New what? Summer body. Is the mind merely a function of the brain? Or is it a separate but closely related element? The wiener connection. In the past 50 years... They, they call it the Doc Effect. We have come to recognize that in the brain, there is an Chris amazing automatic sensory and motor computer that utilizes the brain. conditioned reflexes. Vampire And there implants. is a highest brain mechanism that is closely related Vamp to plants. what men have long referred to as consciousness, or the mind, or spirit. But the mind, I surmise, can give direction only through the mind's brain mechanism. Uh, it is all very much like programming a private computer. The program comes to an electrical computer from without. The same is true of each biological computer. Purpose comes to it from outside its own mechanism. This suggests that the mind has energy. There I must leave it. What? No. What's the rest? The 1967 Webster's Dictionary defines cybernetics as the comparative study of the automatic control systems formed by the nervous system and brain, and by mechanical electrical communication systems. In 2008, the CIA declassified the historical record of the agency's Office of Scientific Intelligence, 1949 to 1968. Huh. In it, there are a few mentions of cybernetics, including a classified research program and a biocybernetics working group, the responsibility for which fell under a CIA medical subcommittee. References were also made to Soviet cybernetics programs, east-west technology exchanges, and something called world cybernetics. World cybernetics. Like social media? Like social media? Like maybe the implants don't have to be in your head anymore if they can just, you know, use 60 more years worth of science to figure out what will make people react certain way and program people and elicit certain responses and emotions. Kind of a curious thing, kind of a curious little web to weave, right? Well, I guess we'll never know. See, what's crazy to me is like, so all this stuff is coming from declassified documents and they're pulling from what hasn't been like classified. We still talking about wieners, huh? Only look, man, only 10, only, uh, nine more minutes of the ween talk. And then we will be, we'll be, we will probably be booting something up. We'll probably be booting something up. Um, but yeah, I, I think it's crazy that like, you know, if all this fucked up shit is coming from like declassified documents, imagine what's been redacted. And then also realize that this was like 60 years ago. Wild. Even though this document wasn't declassified until 2008, all of the pages describing the CIA's cybernetics program are still redacted to this day. I have puzzled over human evil for a long time. And I'm not sure I have more to say about it than anybody else, except I'm willing to call it human evil, which most folks aren't anymore. What was driving Mark Irvin and Sweet? What was driving Delgado? 
Dr. Jose Delgado wrote that conquering the human mind is a national goal at parity with conquering poverty or landing a man on the moon. The main aim is to establish a scientific foundation for the creation of a future psycho-civilized society. But how many people knew that humanity's new future course toward a psycho-civilized society could be traced back to a highly organized global program to unlock the black box of man's mind established during World War II? Imagine the Fallout series was real. Dude, so funny you say that. We just recently on, uh, so I was doing like rumble only streams there for a while. My, uh, talking shit streams, uh, that have now been merged with YouTube. Um, so feel free to catch those. Um, uh, but, uh, on a stream we did on rumble recently, we watched this thing about a guy named Phil Schneider. Okay. Phil Schneider, uh, was basically a CIA contractor during the uh during the cold war and one of the black op operate like black ops he was doing was uh so he was like a, a geologist and an architect and they have this thing called dumbs d-u-m-b's which is uh uh something underground military base deep underground military base i think and he was talking about these like huge drills, like, uh, oh fuck. You can even like tunnel digging machine, like massive. Like these things are like, this is one, this is uh, a tunnel boring machine. And so they use these to like, dig out huge massive tunnels and stuff and he was talking about how uh they're doing this all over the world and they're like they have isolated military bases in like mountain ranges and stuff like that and he talked about like an encounter with underground creatures in one of these and like i don't know it just uh you know, is a little crazy. Like, here's one in action, CGI-wise. Um, but uh, that guy, Phil Schneider, talked about there being, like, creatures from the descent under the earth and how he had encountered them. And after he started talking about all this stuff publicly, uh, he killed himself. He killed himself. So there's that. I don't know what you, you know, do with that what you will. But, uh, like, these things are huge. Now, I'm not saying. Okay. <laughs> so this goes a little bit further. So you guys know about exposure theory? Back then, everyone was prepping for nuclear war. Today's conditions are the same and the nukes are worse, yet we don't have any shelters or plans for it. We don't. Us don't wait, whatever you guys know what I mean. Um, but uh, but yeah, I don't know, I don't know. I uh, I believe in exposure theory, and I just think it's kind of ironic that you know, right before we're on the verge of what is considered like World War Three and nuclear war. They drop a show about, you know, people going down into underground vaults for the mainstream, which, like, I know Fallout's been around forever, but, like, making a show about it. I'm going to get my Ink Spots playlist ready. Hey, let's go. Funded by elite foundations. But yeah, look up Phil Schneider. Look up Phil Schneider. I have an even crazier theory. Uh, just bought a Time magazine from 1964 and they were building nuclear bunkers in cities and talking about how this was the new norm. See, what's crazy is like, you know, 
did anybody foresee anything that's happened this year so far happening? So who's to say that a year from now, buying a nuclear bunker isn't a new norm? What if they start doing like government-issued nuclear bunker? Or like, hey, just so you all know, we have already pre-built all of these just in case. And now everyone's got to go live in these. And like, we didn't even know. What about the earthquake under New York? Do you guys think that maybe that earthquake could have potentially been one of these machines digging underneath? New York, and that's potentially what caused the earthquake, is they were clearing out the ground for the fucking thing, and that's why it was, like, a very quick one. Like, maybe they just hit some... Because the way those cutters work is they use, like, some sort of plasma beam or something to, like, melt the rock. And then they grind through it with, with those saws and stuff. So it's, like, it doesn't turn it into lava, it just, like, softens it. And then they and then they cut through it with that front face or whatever that had all those like saws and stuff on it. Uh and you know. Now hey, I don't know. I don't know myself. But it's kind of crazy to think about. Uh global energy grid, dude. Global underground energy grid. government health and intelligence agencies and military research branches run through Ivy League schools, hospitals, mental health facilities, and prisons and involving a diffuse global network of intelligence agents, neurologists, psychologists, psychiatrists, physiologists, anthropologists, mathematicians, and cyberneticians, all seemingly working under the same United Nations UNESCO goal for decades. Shit. How to create peace in the minds of men. The governments of the states parties to this country. And Wiener, yeah. Global Wiener Grid. That since wars begin in the minds of men, it is in the minds of men that the defenses of peace must be constructed. In summary, therefore, there is no evidence that the Soviets have any techniques or agents capable of producing particular behavioral patterns which are not available in the West. Okay, so basically we were doing all that to outpace the Soviets and then it was proven that they weren't doing anything like that? Or John J. Ford served as ASC's first director. Warren McCullough was its first elected president. Oh, fuck. Warren McCullough was a piece of shit in this. During the MK Ultra revelations in the mid-1970s reported the CIA channel funds through, among others, Josiah Macy... Oh, fuck. Hold on. Okay, hold on, hold on, ha ha. Let me go back. Josiah Macy Jr. Foundation, specifically including the funding of MK Ultra contractor Dr. Harold Abramson. In 1975, the CIA denied any relationship with the Macy Foundation. In 1977, the Macy Foundation officially denied any link to the CIA. After many years of litigation, Leonard Kyle's mother, Helen Geis, unfortunately lost her malpractice lawsuit against Dr. Vernon Mark and Dr. Frank Irvin in 1979. Due largely to Dr. Bregan's reform efforts, Congress denied Dr. Sweet's request for $1 million in further funding, and Congress was forced to consider a psychosurgery ban. The National Research Act of 1974 created the National Commission for the Protection of Human Subjects of Biomedical and Behavioral Research. The commission recommended strict psychosurgery guidelines with a mandatory hospital review board in each case and every patient's informed consent. <clears throat> That's awesome, dude. That's awesome that that guy, like, got that established. He was like, look at all this fucked up shit they're doing. We need somebody to tell them they can't just do this. 
The commission's final report admitted the safety and efficacy of psychosurgery had not been sufficiently proven. You don't fucking say, dude. You don't say. Who would? Who would say? I wouldn't. It sounds like everybody that was involved in this got was way worse after the fact, and most of them didn't even know it was happening to them, is what I am picking up. And, and some of them were kids. And all of them were Americans. You gotta remember that. All of these people were American. So just remember, time to outsource. Hey. Dr. Bregan's activism has been chilling effect on further federal funding for psychosurgery. Years later, it would be revealed that behind the Cold War and space race was a secret race for mind control technology. Soviet secret police, the NKVD, ran its own $1 billion mind control research program currently, concurrently with the CIA's MKUltra. This led to the creation of psychotronic weapons. Classified government brain research continued. Jesus. That was good. That was good. God damn, dude. That's so fucked. That's so fucked up. Massacre at Memphis Block Party. Oh, yeah. Apparently, there was like some sort of teen takeover thing. And, uh, a lot of people got shot. Wild. Who's giving these teenagers guns? Um, but yeah, dude, that shit was wild. So, uh, basically, uh, so this is called Truth Stream Media, and it's Aaron and Melissa Dykes, and they have a few videos. We watched Rich Man's Trick not too long ago, and that was very, very good. Um, I would I would highly recommend you give them a watch and go check them out. Um, this was pretty good. This was pretty good. We watched... Uh, so this is three hours and 42 minutes. So they do like super long style documentaries, and most of them are very good. So go go check these people out. They're they're a pretty pretty good couple. Stacey Abrams. All this just looks kind of the same. All this just kind of looks like the same stuff happening. Uh oh, Twitter's broken. Rabbi urges Jewish students to flee Columbia campus. Democrat Republican or Democrat uh, Representative Connolly says Ukraine Russia border is our border. Says who? Says him? Some say, well, we have to deal oh with our God. border first. The Ukrainian Russian border is our border. Is this guy retarded? Is this guy an absolute fucking dipshit? What is wrong with this guy? How is that our border? Dude, our border is fucked. Allegedly. It's the border between depraved autocracy and freedom-loving people seeking our democratic way what of up, life. Ninja? Do we have a stake in that outcome? You came just in time. So this guy is saying that uh, America has a border with Russia. That's crazy. I never knew that. I didn't learn that in school. Yes. Undeniably yes. Will we rise to the occasion? Will we stand shoulder to shoulder with our Ukrainian brothers and sisters who for 1,151 days have been, have been spending your taxpayer money on not weapons? They've been spending it on cocaine, allegedly. Our border, no, I'm saying. No, I don't. I don't know what you're saying. Because apparently that has now become subjective. Apparently the American border 
and where it is has become subjective. Who knew? Who knew? I didn't know we were a transatlantic nation. This dude's fucking insane. The holding off the depraved, thuggish dictator Vladimir Putin, who has respected no norms of warfare. He's targeted children in hospitals and schools. He's bombed, he's, he's bombed apartments. Have you heard of the smack rooms in Scotland? No. Is that something I can look at? We have injection sites here in like, uh, what is it, Oregon? This is New York City. Injected him saying, if Jose Collado settled in at a clean white table in a sunlit room, sang a few bars, and injected himself with heroin. Like these? Those are somewhat run by doctors. The ones in Scotland are here. And again, who are these doctors? These are the same doctors that use the use the neuroscience bullshit to say fucking look man. Ooh, I don't know. Fuck. Same as MJ. And it's like who's to say that that's just heroin in there? Look. I am an American, and I believe in the uh, the idea that my heroin can be free of additives, preservatives, and contaminants. Okay? I'm just kidding. I don't think anybody should ever do heroin. Um, so it's usually in rough cities, and it's for people who are going to do it anyway, so they can use clean stuff and monitor doses and... Whilst they're there, they try to wean them off of it, allegedly. Yeah, but I'm like, who's to say that that's just not a place where, like, they're injecting other things into people with the heroin and then studying what's happening to them? Because what? The drug addict is... Got, someone's going to believe the drug addict? As far as they know, they're just going in there and getting a hit and things are just kind of slightly off. But they're fucked up on heroin they don't know anyway. I... Look, knowing what I know, I don't think that I would trust it. I don't know. It seems like a way to get uh, consent from people and like the most vulnerable. Channel 5 covers them pretty well. Yeah, but these are things that like, you know, they're not going to tell people. Like, where do they get the heroin? Who's making the heroin? I don't know. There's, there, there's so many questions that I have. Comes down to who's running it. That's what I'm saying. Like, who are these companies that are running it? On Point NYC. On Point NYC. Like, who's in charge of On Point? Who owns this?
Hold on. Holistic Services Manager. Crack is wacky. Oh, the cartel makes them. They only supply non-drug parts. So wait, the the people bring their own heroin? They don't get it there? Or wait. Yo, Walter White, this is the bomb. Um Sam Rivera. Bill de Blasio. I mean, he's not really a good guy. Crack is whack. Huh. You show up and go into a room and do your thing. See, if they can have that for drugs, why don't they just... Never mind. Why don't they... I uh, wonder what was the first drug that was invented. Probably some sort of, like, pain reliever, I would assume. Some sort of, like, like a now... What is it? An, an Algasac or whatever? I don't know how to spell it. Analgesic. 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 But yeah, probably something to relieve pain, I would assume. But let's see. What was the first drug ever invented? I'm thinking opium for modern times, lamp oil, rope, bombs, heroin, what you want it is she just my friend. Why'd that sound like a kid saying that? I don't know, dude. I don't know. The first modern pharmaceutical medicine was invented in 1804. German scientist morphine for the god of sleep. This was like, I guess, the first intended medicine. Different plants and minerals to treat illnesses. But this was like the first, like, yo. Aztecs use shrooms, yeah. Amphetamines. Lanidum. Opium, 16th century. Coffee, caffeine, alcohol as old as a motherfucker. Yeah, belladonna was 4th century. That's like a poison. Scopolamine. Oh, fuck. It's like the truth thing. DB, I got 100 emeralds. What can I get these with? Hey, hey. Uh, 1000 BCE for Datura. That was like India. Uh, they use that. Wait, what is this called? Hi, Hyascamus. 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 Uh,. The Black Henbane. Uh, dreams and human sacrifices is wild. Yeah, dude. Just poppy seeds. Highest scamus. Mm, um, we have deterrents all over my area. The natives used to be tripping out here, dude. That's wild. Fuck that.
Amanita mascara fly Amanita. What was this for? Hallucinogens? Dude, these look like the fucking these look like cartoon mushrooms. So potions was a real thing. Oh yeah, dude, you had like alchemists and shit back in the day. Or what did they call them? Apothecaries? These motherfuckers was mixing Bro, they they were the old school Walter Whites, man. They were like, what I look, hey, I got you. Tobacco. You had uh what is it? Druids. Druids were a real thing back in the day. Ancient Celts. They were like all about fucking using shit. They really wanted to learn how to turn stuff into gold. Which is crazy, because, like, what was the point of gold back then? You know, I know it's, like, kind of valuable now with, like, being a very good semiconductor. But. Or not semiconductor, but conductor. Sorry. Uh, but, like, what, what, what good was gold outside of just, like, being shiny? I love gold. I have a collection of apothecary bottles and have some fluids in uh the fine fluids. Define uh actually don't define fluids. I think I'm good. Uh we have the the Mangragora officinarium. The what? Original content. Hey. Wait, me or the fluids? Don't quote that. Not my fluids, if wondering. Who's... So you just have somebody else's fluids in, in, in bottles? What are they? Do you know? Are they unidentified fluids? Or did you buy them, like, specifically? For like a uh, for like a thing, are you out there doing fucking witchcraft, my brother? Hold on now, original medicine. Uh oh oh, I see. Like um, like uh like uh like. Like this shit. Like this shit. Like this shit, right? Well, maybe not this specifically, but like... Like some Red Dead shit. Cocaine toothache drops. Holy shit. Oh, dude. Asthma cigarettes? Asthma cigarettes? That's crazy. Fire up the steaks. Exactly, but with the medicine inside. Sick. Dude, you should... Oh, dude, drink all of them. Look up... R Radithor? Bro, if this is like some... You about to... You about to, you about to, you about to fuck me up, dog. Uh, radioactive water, radium and mesothorium in triple distilled water. What the fuck, bro? What do you do with this? What was it for? Simply radium in, dissolved in water, sold in the 20s and one ounce bottles, costing about $1 each, which is $15 in 2016. Uh, yeah, tomato, you have superpower sitting right there. I'm sure that was radioactive toothpaste too, the medicine of the time. I mean, anything for a buck, right? What's that? At first, do no harm unless there's profits to be gained or something? 
Uh, its manufacturer claimed the drink not only provided energy, but also cured a host of ailments, including impotence. Damn, so this was like Red Bull and Viagra in a bottle. Is that right? Made for 10 years. Bailey. Uh, people drink them and had their jaws fall off. What the fuck? What time are you on till? I gotta do some stuff. So, oh, I'm here all day, brother. I'll probably be here. Shit, like another eight, nine hours. I would say. We doing a we doing a long haul today. Which is rad water in reality. Yeah, dude. So you'll gain some health. But you'll lose some overall health. Do you have any rat away? Do they have like any uh any like uh were there any cures for radiation in the I guess the twenties? Cause that's when this stuff existed. <laughs> oh, Radiotherapy. Uh, ringworm. Carcinoma. Oh, shit, dude. That looks bad. History of rate. Wait, so no, were there like uh, I'll be back. Hey, DB, we'll see you, brother. Thanks for hanging out so far. I hope you have a good rest of the day, and we'll we'll see you a little bit later. How do you um, Asian poisoning in the twenties? I guess. The effects, the acute effects of radiation exposure were first seen in 1896 when Nikola Tesla purposefully suggested, subjected his fingers to x-rays and reported that this caused burns to develop, although at the time he attributed the burns to ozone. You have ringworms, here's a radioactive blade blast for it. Yeah, hey, hey, you know what'll cure these ringworms? Cancer. We're just going to give you a little bit of cancer. And the ringworms will clear right up. You might die. But hey, you'll stop having ringworms. Because you'll be dead. That sounds like vault tech. <laughs> the patient will, one way or the other, cease to be living with ringworms. Anymore. Bro, 20s was a terrible time. Not in Hollywood, baby. They were having the time of their life fucking making all them movies. They, look, they were having a blast back then. All the people that had, like, money. That's kind of crazy that, like, all throughout history, it seems like the people that have money are still just kind of all right. They're, they're doing pretty good. Weird how that works. Uh, even buyers. Wasn't there a guy that like ate uranium or something? Scientist eats uranium. Dude, this shit's wild. It's probably fake. This is probably fake. This probably isn't uranium. We eat uranium every... Whoa, dude. 
Chill out. Single day, but the amount isn't enough to be harmful to us. Galen Winsor was a renowned physicist in the United States. He designed and worked on multiple nuclear power plants. Winsor believed that the fear of uranium and radiation has been exaggerated so that a few powerful companies can profit from our power resources such as coal, oil, and gas, and to keep the fossil fuels burning. To prove his point, Winsor ate uranium live on camera in front of a large audience. He swam in the reactor cooling pools to change the public perception. Windsor also drank the nuclear reactor water to prove what his the point. Fuck? Windsor died in 2008 at the age of 82. The cause of his death is unknown. See, that's wild, but it could be fake. Oh, right. Banana has the smallest radium, apparently, but it's supposed to be good. Uh, yeah, I've heard that like bananas are radioactive. But is that on purpose, you think? <laughs> what if they have like a, there's one place that the U.S. gets all of its bananas and it just so happens to be right next to a nuclear power plant? Dude, I'm not going to trust the University of California. MK Ultra was taking place out of UCLA. Fuck that. Banana equivalent dose. Our vegetables for this era are different from back then. Yeah, because like, you know, before the bombs got dropped... Single source banana theory is definitely happening. Well, that's what I'm saying. I've heard that before. And if you subscribe to that belief. And there just so happens to be. You know. Eh. And of course they're all going to be radioactive. Uh, but yeah, dude, every everything and every body is a little radiated from the bombs. From the nukes. Hell, we get radiation from the sun. Allegedly. What is even, like, radiation? <laughs> what is it, like, what it... What is it? How does it, like... What does it do to, uh... To, like... Uh... It, it, does it fuck with, uh, atoms? Because I know, I know it like degenerates cells, but as far as like non-living things, like what would it, what would, what would, what would happen if I like put a Rubik's cube on like the elephant's foot and just left it there and then came back like a year from then, would it be like melted? Even though the the Rubik's Cube doesn't have cells. You know, so it's like, uh, uh... Fuck, I don't know, man. Look at the carrots we have now and back then. Oh, yeah, dude. Uh, fucking GMOs. Because what's crazy is, like, a lot of people think that GMOs are, like, you know, they're in there, like, breaking down the DNA and all that shit, which they very well could be. And I'm, I, you know, I don't doubt that they might be. Um, but, uh... You know, a lot of that's just like crossbreeding different plants together and stuff that I've seen. Uh, but, you know, that was like the original GMO. Who knows what they're doing now? I'm sure they're in there in the, in the DNA. It would be coated in particles of dust containing radioactive isotopes. Who's to say it's not? Who? Somebody test their bananas. Somebody test the bananas. Or wait, you're talking about the Rubik's Cube. So, if you blow the dust off, though, 
Radiation wants to dissipate and spread, but when in soil and material, it has a longer half-life. The cube. So, where's the dust come from, though? Because the dust just in the air? Or, like, is it, like, constantly, like, like doing the like the Thanos snap thing, but in like super slow motion where it's like dusting away the dirt and air. Oh, okay. I thought maybe it was like the thing disintegrating or something. Don't the dust be absorbed? I feel like I feel like I could absorb some dust. Yeah. Asthma cigarettes. That's really funny. I feel like this was a prank. And it like got out of hand. Asthma, hay fever, foul breath, all diseases of the throat, head colds, canker sores, bronchial irritations. Dude, who has a sore throat and is like, let me smoke this cigarette, I'll feel better. No, you don't understand. These cigarettes are healthy. These are healthy cigarettes. You see how radioactive particles move in a smoke chamber. What? What the fuck? What is this? Can I watch this? Probably. Yeah. All right. Whoa. So is the white the the radioactive stuff? Whoa, what the fuck? You would have this coming off of it after What the fuck? Dude, the cube would be shooting fucking photons at me. What the fucking shit is this? I don't want to get blasted at by a fucking Rubik's Cube, dude. The particle shooting around the box. Dude, that's so scary. So wait, bananas are doing this to me? Bananas do this to me? I don't like that. Bananas are fucking shooting their photons in my stomach. Wait, hold on. That didn't sound... Uh... That, uh 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 hello everybody uh we're live we're live welcome to stream i just got here uh welcome we're looking at uh radioactive stuff uh they use radioactive material yeah we looked at uh what was it the iridium paint or whatever that you, they used to like glow it was like glow paint and it was like giving people cancer dishware yeah they use lead and all kinds dude it's a wonder bananas are doing this to me bananas are shooting their photons in my stomach i didn't say that dude I didn't say that. Oh, fuck. Okay. Dude changed into a new man. <laughs> Dude, this is insane. This is just happening. What the fuck, dude? I feel like I'm getting radiation just looking at this. Is that possible? Okay, that sounded really stupid. I'm going to shut up now. This is insane, though. Ooh, we get different angles. Oh my god, it's a close-up. That's fucking nuts. 
You can't even like make sense of it. The elephant foot would probably be wild. Dude. Somebody do it. Somebody do it. Not any of us, but someone should do it. Like, why are we putting science into, uh, like, other stuff? We should do cool stuff. You mean the Russian elephant foot event? Yeah. Yeah, we watched a whole thing on that. There's, there's this guy that, like, goes and looks at, like, the radioactive places in Chernobyl. That dude is fucking crazy. He's probably gonna die. There's a good chance he's probably gonna die. I mean, we're, you know, given enough time. Inevitably. But I feel like, man, he might be alright right now, but I feel like it, you know, who knows, 20 years from now, I feel like they're gonna be like, so yeah, you know cancer? And they're like, yeah. And they're like, you know how there's all different kinds? He's like, yeah. He's like, well, every single one of them have teamed up against you, uh, and you should have been dead two weeks ago. Good luck. <laughs> He's going to be like, God damn it. Well, everything gives us cancer. That's not true, man. That's not true. You know, it doesn't give you cancer. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Hey, I'm just click that motherfucking like button. See if that gives you cancer. <laughs> the Cancer Coalition has come. There's a telegram from the Cancer Coalition, sir. So shall we open it? No. No, I don't think I will. But you guys like my, uh,. Ch Chadwick Boseman impression. Tomato finally woke up. Yeah, hey, what up? What up? What up, Crimson? Okay, what were we? What were we doing? Oh, fuck, dude, the first drugs. Damn it! Hold on. Oh, let me hide this. I gotta go back through my history. Uh oh, I don't need you guys to see that I looked up. Uh, what was it? Oh, Michael Jackson's, uh, the state of his, his gen, genetula. Uh, where was it? Where was it? Weren't we? There it is. Okay. Uh, what you got hiding? Oh, probably not much. Probably not much. Probably not much. I mean, nothing I wouldn't look at on stream. Uh, let's see. Twitter, tunnel digging machine, Michael Jackson's castration. Who looked that up? Uh, Bell Labs, Nike Labs, The Descent, Bill Schultz, Gamer Sups, everything, Anthony from LTT, bunch of uh, image editing things, Larry Sinclair, Bitshoot, Dom Lucre, Poland, High Court India child porn crime. I don't know if you guys saw that, but there is a reason that I, that I looked that up because they just did this. Uh, a high court said that it's not illegal to watch or download child porn in India now. And I was like, what the fuck? Uh, I could have been working on summer body cream. I was working on some can curls yesterday. Can? Can curls? What cans? What kind of cans? Same, that's why I just woke up. Wait, hold on, what? Uh, but yeah, that's why I was looking at that. 
Um, what else? What else is there? Uh, apothecaries. We've got, uh, I was trying to fix some corrupted stuff. More Twitter. I looked up Destiny. I was trying to see if he was, uh, a Jedi. Uh, you were supposed to burn your underwear? No. No, I wasn't. Modelo cans. Tried all their geladas. Oh, hell yeah. Which one was your favorite? Okay, where were we on this? Okay, we saw that one. We were on... Oh, there's opium. Sick, 3400. We have... Uh, Erythroxylon. Co coca. 6000. Oh, dude, they were doing cocaine in 6000 BC? Holy shit. Peru, Ecuador, Colombia, of course. All right, never mind. Cannabis, 8,000 BCE. Tetrahydrocannabinol and canam can can cannabidiol. Can can cannabida can uh cannabidiol. Cannabidiol, fucking. Uh, they were all pretty good, but I think the lime of the mango is best. Fuck yeah. Opium is one of the first known drugs. A hey. weed won. Yep, weed wins every time. Unless you're doing a death count. Unless you're doing a death count. I suppose. I suppose. It even mentioned in the Odyssey and in ancient Egypt. Weed or opium? Huh? It's horrible for any human. When kids are drinking it by the gallon, everyone pushing prime should be in jail. Hey, uh, prime potassium level. In calories, 55 milligrams of sodium, 2 cans of carbohydrate, 0 grams of protein. No added sugar, but is exceptionally sweet thanks to artificial sweeteners. Inositol and a self -lo fame. So, I mean, there is. There's this. Oh, man. Let's see. There is. Let's see. Let's see. It's not about the caffeine, though. It's about the potassium. I bet I could find it on YouTube. Copy. Wait, what am I doing? Here. Hmm. Yeah. Uh. 
Uh. Boom. Migrating out of Africa 100,000 years ago, humans explored new lands and encountered new substances. People discovered opium poppies in the Mediterranean and cannabis and tea in Asia. Weed comes from Asia. Weed comes from Asia. But yeah. Just wait. All these people chugging prime by the gallon. Five, ten years from now, they're all going to have fucking heart problems, dude. I'm not saying that's for sure. But if I were to be a, a man of, uh, you know, reasonable deduction... I migrated out of my room to find cannabis and coffee. Hey. Thanks to a good friend, I didn't have to even leave my room to procure cannabis and coffee today. It's the it's the little things in life, you know? That's what keeps you going. So hyperkalemia is a medical term that describes a potassium level in your blood that's higher than normal. Potassium is a chemical that is critical to the function of nerve and muscle cells. Those including those in your heart. Uh, having a blood potassium level higher than 0.6 can be dangerous and usually requires immediate treatment. This is from the Mayo Clinic. Acute kidney failure, chronic... Kidney disease, Addison's disease, anegotension to receptor blockers, beta blockers, dehydration. Excessive use of potassium supplements. Other causes of hyperkalemia. Excessive use of potassium supplements. And they also said that it's not good at hydrating. When the body doesn't have enough water and other fluids to work as it should. It kind of warned us with all the sports drinks, but Prime is trying to be something different. I don't know how, though. All those energy drinks I steer clear from, it's also bad for you. Dude, someone once told me, I can't remember where I heard this from, but somebody told me that the CIA invented caffeine. And I'm like, how is that true if it's in coffee? Yeah. Yeah. Maybe marketing. Is this where I heard about it? I've heard about it in the first episode of Utopia. Yeah, okay. That's probably where I heard it then. That's probably where I heard it. Uh, Google gave up on being woke. Hey, that's true. Oh, look, banana. What the fuck, dude? That's weird. It's a banana. It's a banana. We were just talking about bananas. Quote 205. I, wait, what? I just... Oh, it's because you put the number, I think. I think you just put the not you put the not number. What? What the fuck is all this? Book 205. 
Oh no. Bananas are doing this to me? Bananas are shooting their photons in my stomach? Please no. Please no. Please say no. What? BBL lesbian. Humiliation fetish. I love that British is all the dick riding final boss, cocaine sex addict, Rihanna's husband. Uh, 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 misogy misogynist. Don't worry about all that. Don't worry about all that. I don't know why this is even on my thing. Who is this? Valkyrie? Wasn't, didn't she date like, uh, somebody? I don't know. Anyway, what the fuck? Who is that? That looks like, that looks like somebody. That looks like somebody. Whoa, okay. Oh, did you guys see that Ryan Garcia won his, uh, his match? Uh, apparently he potentially broke Haney's jaw. Oh, no. Like, uh, I be supporting, especially like you know niggas' favorite rappers and shit. Like, like, bro, like, but this type of shit, easy. What the fuck is this, bro? Like, real rap. If you would have saw it, say like pajamas on the page, I would have knew I was buying pajamas. But pussy, I'm supposed to go outside like this, bro? Like, don't get me fucked up, nigga. I ain't just buy the long sleeve, my nigga. I, I, I fucking, I bought the other joint too. You feel me? I, I bought the flavors you had on the joint, my nigga. But in real life, cuz like, bro. Look at the pants, though. You violating me, nigga. You violating me with the little bitch-ass string and shit. Like, yeah, <laughs> put the clothes on, bro. I look like I'm going to bed, bro. This the biggest size you have, pussy. This... Come on, bro. Come on, bro. Them shit should be free. You should be giving this out for free, bro. Not even a dub. A nigga pissed. Like, I'm not going outside like this, bro. I ain't even walking around like this, bro. These PJs, I promise. What the fuck wrong with you, Yeezy? Nigga, cur <laughs> Incredible. <laughs> that was fantastic. Holy shit, dude. That was so funny. Oh, can't watch that. What the hell? You think they're celebrating getting another, like, $60 billion? Uh, I'm next fight is to save the children. I'm going front lines and I'll be documenting it. Pray for me. Not the music I was expecting. Me neither. I thought it was definitely going to be something a little more, uh, uh, what? All right. Uh... Uh, can someone explain this to me? What am I looking at? The longer that I look, the worse that it gets. So, this is a man who is under the white genocide, black supremacy, 
Oh, God. I did not want to look now while playing my game. So, uh, this is a man who thinks that he is a woman getting pregnant with black children that are baby dolls. And I guess that's him with his children. And his third one is on the way. These, these are the, who, man, do you remember a couple years ago when these people had the power to like change the whole world and they did and everything got significantly worse. Has pledged $20 million to Gaza and Andrew Tate matches it. Whoa, hell yeah. That's kind of cool. This proves 21 ain't no savage. What? Ooh, there it was. It was Trish. Dude, we watched some of a uh, some of a fish tank on stream. Dude, Sam Parker doing work. Sam Parker's doing work. I can't show that. Biden administration is suing sheets for discriminating against minorities. The reason the company requires all applicants to first pass a criminal background check. Wait, screens. Do what now? And sheets is being sued over its. I am sorry. Isn't that the gas station that Biden just visited yesterday? Or the day before yesterday, this motherfucker shows up to the gas station and sues them. Do what now? Do what now? Dude, if you own a business and you see Joe Biden coming, lock the fucking door. This is private property. You're not allowed here. We are closed for business. Holy shit, dude. That is insane. That's so fucked up. Like, hey, we're going to use you for a press op. And then we're going to sue you. Are you fucking kidding me? This is the gas station that he went to. And this is after Trump went to fuck, went to fucking Chick-fil-A. And they loved him there. That's insane. And then Joe Biden shows up. Nobody cares at all. And he... Fought. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh my god, hold on. This was like two days ago. Not even fucking with you guys. Three days ago. Sorry. And after talking with the steel workers and other supporters on his way back to the airport, the president made a stop at Sheets in Moon Township. President Mayor Ganey and County Executive Sarah Inamorado picked up sandwiches to give to construction workers. Sheets is being sued over its hiring practices. The U.S. Equal Employment Opportunity Commission filed the suit this morning. It claims that the way Sheets bases employment on criminal records disproportionately screens out black, Native American, and other multiracial applicants, and that this violates federal... I'm sorry. Inflation, interest, crime rate, protests... Crumbling bridges, 
fucking fires, earthquakes, hurricanes, immigration. You're suing a gas station, of all things. In an election year, dog, he's trying to lose. He's trying to lose. Or, or, oh my god, dude, what if they're making it to where, like, it's so blatant that he should lose? And they make him win anyway that it just, oh, dude. Anyway. Law. The suit does not accuse Sheets of being motivated by race. Now they say that 2020 J6, you know, or 2021 was, uh, you know, there were, uh, there was an FBI agent that admitted on tape, or I guess he's a CIA contractor now, but that there were, uh, at least 20 FBI agents in the crowd at J6. That's on, that's on video. He's bragging about it. So either he's lying, which, he works at the CIA, and he's lying, or it happened, and they're lying, which if he's lying, if it's just him lying and he works at the CIA, you know, obviously they're capable of being full of people that are lying, so it means the CIA is lying. <laughs> anyway, okay. When making hiring decisions, we have reached out to Sheets for comment, but so far, we Damn, who would have thought Sheets, the biggest threat to America? I'm so glad that Joe Biden is allocating time and resources to suing this gas station to employ people with criminal records in a town of probably like 2,000, maybe, maybe 10,000 people. Incredible. I don't think... I don't think criminal record is like a protected class under the hiring practices, is it? Excluding individuals from employment because they have criminal conviction is unlawful. Uh... Equal Employment Opportunity Commission. I mean, this just sounds like state-sanctioned DEI, right? We don't care if he killed 25 people. Let him work at this McDonald's. Look, yes, he may have... <laughs> We may have caught him in the park having sex with with an animal, but look, he needs to work at this zoo, okay? <laughs> you can't discriminate against him. Just because this person's a sex offender doesn't mean they can't be a daycare worker. That's, I mean, that's the vibes I'm getting. You know, I don't know. Maybe that's just me. I have seen the new video about me and I'm telling you Turkey Tom is just a knob. Snap these pics of him at TwitchCon. You called me last night acting like something important was going on and then tried to fuck me for 30 minutes only hanging up after I said Irish people are subhuman. <laughs> well, I'm gonna go blast. Have a good stream, dog. Hey, man. You as well. You as well, brother. I'm speechless. What the fuck is this? Oh my god. Uh... In the daytime, Bob Good endorsed my opponent, a known neo-Nazi. These people used to walk around with white hoods at night. Now they're walking around with white hoods in the daytime. Bob Good... <laughs> Okay, so Brandon Herrera apparently is a known neo-Nazi. I didn't know that, actually, believe it or not. 
I I was un I was unaware that that that, that was a thing that he was. Make men men again, a taste. Um, the proof was in front of our faces. What is this? What is this? What is this? I'm so lost. There's no sound. What is this, dude? They're just like fucking with a prop. Huh. That was very weird. People who deny the moon landing hate America. What? Ooh, that's a good question. That's a good question. Okay. Uh... Hold on one sec. What? Why? What? Apparently it's... It's a competition... It's a competition for a NASCAR race. It was uh best uh performance. <laughs> There's been a push to uh, wait. Yeah, see this is this is what I saw yesterday. Indian Supreme Court rules watching and possessing is not an offense. Frank Ocean is reportedly missing. We don't know where that guy is. Oh, shit. Whoa, whoa. 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 Oh, I saw that. It got weird. Whoa, what are the odds, dude? What are the odds? That's crazy. What time is it? It's almost two. We'll probably boot up a game here shortly. I just want to keep going on Kingdom Come, or do we go back to Assassin's Creed Black Flag? I feel like we could probably touch on some more Black Flag, but it's it's up to you all. I just saw that Princess Diana wore the same thing. Yeah, before they fucking yopped her in the tunnel. Or somebody yopped her in the tunnel. Now they were like, uh, you know, depends on what you want to play tonight. I mean, what do you guys want to see me play? I don't give a shit. I'm a man of the people. Unless, you know, that they don't 
you know, they're critical of me or don't like me or uh, disagree with anything that I say and or do, then fuck them. But I'm a man of the people that don't do any of those things. Who do I sound like? I'm a man of the people. Maybe kingdom now. Kingdom out. Kingdom come. You guys want to see some kingdom come? Let's do it. Yeah. Zip. Wait, what are you zipping for? Zip. What was I doing? Oh yeah, I'm Jesus. burying my parents. I guess I'll just take all their stuff. Might as well. They don't need it. Why do all these people have food on them? Is it cooked? Oh. Oh. Oh, this guy had a beat. This guy kept beets. Oh, that bread is maybe burnt. I don't know. It was some black bread. Like rye, maybe? I'm ready for the kingdom come. Hey, tomato. Uh, empty. You're empty, dude. Oh, what the fuck? Dude, all these people. That's crazy. Horseradish? What can I do with that? I don't need an, another torch. Alright. I think that's it. Alright, who are my parents? Now I have a village worth of food, right? Where are my parents? I don't think it's any of them. Can't sprint while overloaded. Am I overloaded? Oh shit, I sure am. Nourishment. Okay. So maybe we wait. Okay. Which one's better? Yes, this one. Guess this one. Whip. Drop. Uh. Old boots. Drop. Red scarf. Drop. Another torch. Drop. All right, let's eat, eat your stuff. Wait until you've digested your food. Oh, okay. Oops. Damn, I'm so close. Let's see. Uh, okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna, uh, we're gonna drop some Beats. We're gonna drop the beat. All right, and we're good. I've become clumsy. Can't open this door. Where? Uh. Oh, okay. I see. 
Is that a gas? Oh, that's my scar. Okay. Alright, we're off. You got lockpicks? I don't. I don't, unfortunately. I, uh... I didn't do the lockpicking part of, uh, the quest in the beginning, so I didn't get any from Fritz. What's going on there? What's that? What have we got here? Oh! Entertain Yo! I, I slapped him. Jesus Christ! Back up. Back up. Uh. Bitch. Yeah. What do we do? Yow. Ha. <laughs> Dude, we fucked him up. You can use the sword was given by Sir Radzig. Oh, yeah, that's right. I need to change it back. I was using the uh, soldier sword so that uh, I blended in. To begin with. I think that's why I did that. Uh, what should I do? Should I just keep going? Should I keep fighting him? No mercy for people looters. Like me. Only I. Oh no, forget it. Now you die. Bastard! Get up. Yo! Ah! Get back here. You son of a bitch. Oh, fuck. Hey, bud. Dude, he had nothing. Fuck him. Let's go see what he was after. He did. He better be fucking dead. Look, why was he trying to fight me? Look, they didn't. Even, they don't even have sh fuck all. They don't even have fuck all. Why would he try to fight me over that? That died. Di that dude died over a pretzel. That's sad. All right, pretzel man. May somebody find you eventually. It's called a bandit for a reason. Old ban banderata, ban, ban Antonio Bandero. I don't need that. Damn! Look at all these dead folk. Damn! Is all they had was food? Dude died over a pretzel, that's sad. Hey. Yes, I would like the money. I mean, it is. It's sad as shit. Poor guy. I mean, idiot. He shouldn't have messed with me. How dare he? But, you know, why? Why? You should have just been like, you know what? Auntie Annie's ain't worth it. Sweet Jesus. It's a charcoal burner. Damn. He ain't even got no charcoal left. Okay. That didn't work. Oh my god. Oh my god.
Whoa! Hey! I have no arrows. Oh shit. Trying to use a bow that demands better stats than I have. Oh, fuck me. And I dropped my other one so far back. Can I even catch that guy? I don't know if I'm going to be able to catch him. He's taking me so far off my course. We're going to catch him. Back here, you bastard. Hey, okay, we've closed some distance. Hey! He thinks he's safe. Back here, you son of a bitch. Have him pay to be released. I'll let you go, but it'll cost you. All right. All right, I got money. And then he thinks he's being released. Yeah. They call me Henry Poker. Wait, where'd he go? What the fuck? Oh. Stop, please. Get back here. Do the terror of the combat. There's a DLC where you can maintain a village and earn lots of coins. Oh shit, dude. I want to do that. He had a dagger on him and he didn't even use it? What a fool. Damn, his coif kind of like my. Uh, well, okay. For good measure. Alright, and we're off. Okay. So wait, if I kill him and nobody saw and he's dead and can't tell anybody, do I still lose reputation? I also, I think I have the DLC. I'm pretty sure I do. So that'll be pretty cool. And then in the second one, like the whole trailer was about him like wanting to become a king and shit, right? Or like a, like some sort of lord or something. Oh, is that another guy? Is that another guy looting? Looks like it. What have we got here? Enter oh. 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 Bitch! What you got? You. Ah. Ow. Oh. Ah. Oh! Back up! Back up! Back up! Back up! Back up! Back up! Oh! You didn't want that, dude. You don't want it. 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 Back up. Oh. Back up. Oh. Ow. 
Oh no. You bastard. I don't like your odds, dude. Oh, fuck you. Me? Wipe your ass with this fucking sword, dude. Fuck. Oh dear, did that hurt? No. Yeah. Fuck. I got too close. Okay. Okay. Watch this. Ow. Watch this. Watch this. Oh! Uh. Bitch! Dude, the struggles I had to do. Oh! 300 plus hours. Damn it! I got too close. Back up! Back up! Fair enough. Fair enough. Uh. Uh, I'll kill you in the bushes, you fucking peasant. Oh, what? You give up? You give up? I don't no, fucking no, it. think so, no, dude. Gone. Yeah. Yeah, get fucked in your ass. Oh. My fucking... Where you going? What the hell? Get back here, bitch. What the fuck was that all about? I want to play Kingdom Come already. The new one. Dude, it looks fun. It looks like, uh, they're gonna, they fix a lot of shit. Damn, this horse died. Okay. Alright, we're back on track. Let's see if we can find some more looters. Ooh, I should probably heal, right? I have a lot of them. Oh, I'm not bleeding. Okay. Well, how do I heal myself? Maybe I'll eat. I'll eat a carrot. I still haven't figured out, like, archery. It, 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 like, how do you get a reticle? How do you get, like, a little thing to aim with? Bandages? It said I wasn't bleeding. Which was... Unfortunate. Oh, whoa. Okay. And bandages. Uh, these? It says you can't bandage yourself, you're not bleeding. Does it just like go up naturally over time or? Didn't my dad die like right over here? In the end, you were a hero. You didn't run away from the band. Oh wow. That looks like a horse. No, no, no. Why? Just wait a moment. I'll take care of my parents, and then I'll come back for you. I won't leave you right now. Is that a dog? 
Is that a dog? Well, I took her stuff. That was the lady that I guess I like. New dead girlfriend? Yeah, dude. I found her. Bianca. The thick Latina lady. Or wait, right? He like wakes up and he's like, son! April Fools! Yep, this whole thing's been on hidden camera. Why did you do it to me? Our village is just fine. This is a decoy village. Why? Why did you leave me? Woo. Forgive me. You should have seen Forgive your face, me. Henry. Next time I won't run. I'll never run away again. I'll find the one who did this to you. I thought he was about to kiss him. I remember his face. I'll find him. His dad wakes up and he's like, God damn that breath. The first. The Dechko is the village you want to go to do archery. I take care of you. Oh shit, okay. After you get done during doing the prologue. Fuck. Alright, I'll you try. I'm gonna try. Here. Under the linden tree. At least I can do that much for you. Dude, I wonder if we can beat this before the new one comes out. All right, so I got to bury them. Right? Find a spade. If I were a shovel, the dog down by the town square. Oh shit! Uh, can I recruit the dog? Can the dog like help me? Or is it like a bad dog? Oh, no, lock pick. Fuck. I already took all his stuff from there. Where's the shovel? It, there you'll find the shovel. Oh, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Town Square. Is that in here? Oh. Okay. There's Town Square down this way. Oh, I hear the dog. I hear it. That's the castle. <laughs> Look, man, I never said I was a smart guy. Oh. Dog? Dog? Oh. Whoa, 
Get away, you must. Is that the Deutsch? The Dutch? Get away, you beast! What's going on? It's Bishop. What in oh. God's name are you doing? Okay, maybe not. What do you think I'm doing? Digging turnips? The beast just went for me. Isn't that not the butchers? Um, isn't that body the butchers? Don't let that boy bully yeah, the dog. I don't want him to hit the dog. What's that got to do with anything? He's protecting his master. I'd say the poor creature is standing guard over his master. You weren't trying to get to him, were you? What do you care what I'm doing here? What are you doing? Came to bury my parents. So bury them and leave me be. Uh... What do I do? What do I do? What do you guys want me to do? He looks like he's stronger than me. But I also have weapons. And a helmet. Do I just kill him? And take the shovel? Do I just say fuck you? Fuck you, boy. I mean, I do have weapons. I haven't seen him have weapons. Have I disturbed your looting? Or do I say fuck you? I feel like I've narrowed it down to these two. I don't really care about the other ones. I'll get the shovel. One way or the other. I'm thinking I say fuck you. I see a cunt remains a cunt, no matter what the situation. Ah! Oh no. Okay. Shit, shit, shit. That's right. Turn tail and run, you bastard. Tackle him. What are you doing? Why can't I? I've got business to take care of here first. Fuck! I wish to be gone from this place. Uh, first, I must bury my parents. Well, shit. Yeah, they're all high and mighty until you pull the damn sword out. Did I go too far? Is it this way? Oh, oh. oh. Easy there, boy. You know me. You're a good master. Where's the shovel? Oh. Pick up. He's gonna bring back bandits to beat you up. Dude, let him. I'll fuck him up. What's he gonna do? Okay. My parents are this way. Dig a grave under the linden tree and bury your parents. I probably should have killed him then, huh? I probably should have killed him. Let's see if I'm hungry again. Barely. Okay. Well, let's eat the apple. Maybe I have too much food. What do you guys think? You can't. Yeah, I tried swinging at him. It wouldn't let me tackle him either. He's protected by the script. I see. I see. Wait, where's the linden tree? Can't sprint. What the fuck? Did I not go the right way? Okay, how much weight do we fucking have? This is getting cumbersome. I have so many carrots. I'm going to drop my green shirt. I 
I'm a knight's hunting sword? Fuck. Okay. Is that better than the one I'm using? What's the best one? Wait, where's the guy's sword? Where's the guy's sword? Did I lose it? Did I lose it? Is that it? I can't tell. It's in quest items. Oh! 45, huh? Yeah! Okay. Cool. I'm guessing I should have gone through this gate and then to the left. Can't sprint while overloaded. Am I still fucking overloaded? God damn it, 0.7? 0.7? Point seven? Point seven? Uh, I guess I'll get rid of my pants too. looking out there uh is it so is it kinjalim or quinjalim i'm uh i just want to make sure i'm pronouncing it right this is a good place okay you're gonna like it here. inventory shovel i guess i don't need to equip it start digging also i can help you level up your lock picking skill and it'll be the easiest Quinn, all right. Quinn or Kin? Aw, poor doggo. What a very weird shaped head. Damn, dude, that dog is cut. The dog got some fucking muscle. We've been fucking just like he's fucking stout. Sorry. Let's get to it. Looking like a gym dad. Oh, I think this is supposed to be a sad part. I'm sorry. It is kind of cool how your equipment's in the cutscene. Damn it all. You won't win in this part? I'll fucking try, though. I'll damn sure as fuck try. Boy, you got a tree club. Look, hey. How am I gonna do this? With the shovel. Do you need some help? Is that him? Yes. Can't you see the sword? Who are you? What do you want? Spishek? Who do you think we are? Franciscan brothers? <laughs> uh oh. Oh, fuck. You were talking about that guy. Everything you've got. Oh, no. Especially that Dude, he's able to break my block, isn't he? I have a shield. I think I picked up a shield. Maybe? It is my father's sword. You mean him? I don't think he's going to be needing it anymore. Oh, hell no, dude. Listen here, boy. You hand over that sword. I might just let you go. If not... You're in for a family reunion you really don't want. 
Leave me alone. Can't block or defeat him. You can't block. Can I kill the other guys at least? Or is it a 1v1? As you like. Could have just cost you a few teeth. Ow. What the fuck? Holy shit. I told you how it would end. You should have listened to me. Uh, uh, this is nice work. Excuse me, sir. That's mine. Like Give me my toy back. It's new, isn't it? You piece of shit. Now, for the maiden bloodletting. Surely your father never would have imagined it would be your blood. Actually, I've killed quite a few people with that sword. I believe there's a word for such moments. The old man would certainly know. Well, I'm just a common killer. Okay. We'll get it back after you get in the middle Did of the story. Ooh, fuck yeah, dude. No doubt you did. I'll get it enchanted by a wizard. Such miserable luck. It'll be a fire so Oh dude, is he gonna stab me? Hey, go fucker. Okay. The games are over. Oh, let's go, dude. I was like, what is she gonna do? I live. We did it. You parted with the sword. Can I get it back? Where'd the guy go? So this is the prologue? Wait, why am I back in the green clothes? Warhorse Studios. So that was the begin that was the that was like the tutorial, right? This is the farthest that I've made it ever. Wait, so... Oh, dude, I didn't go back to my house to get uh, the lockpick stuff. Damn it. Or I, I didn't look in the box. Can I go back to my house now? What's in the box? What's in the box? It'll probably be there. Hell yeah. Okay. I was making sure it wasn't going to be like blocked off. Henry's dice. That's right. That's right. Sorry. I have a terrible memory. I really, you know, if I had to put my finger on it, I honestly couldn't tell you why. My memory is so bad, but uh, man, when I try to like recall some stuff, for some reason it's just like really hard. I don't know why. decided to give it to everyone I think oh shit okay so it was like a like an exclusive for a while what did you say the dice do again fuck man I forgot that too I'm sorry who's the chef oh dude are they gonna cook me is this like Diablo are they going to try to eat me? Maybe not. Wait. What? Whoa, okay. Whoa, where am I? 
What is this place? Save your parents. How? Where are they? Ow. Ow. How do I cycle? How do I cycle? I want to take out the guy without the shield first! Okay, I figured it out, I think. Oh my god. Back up. Okay, I want to restart this. Fuck. I'm trying. Oh, he's gone. Ow. He's gone. I did it. I saved my parents. Those weren't my parents. Fuck. Uh, okay, well, we're pretty close to dead. This on hardcore? It is not. I am that bad. Welcome to the Thunderdome, me. Uh, okay. Do I follow the... Did you need I... some help? Did I do it? I don't think I'd save my parents. It's just a dream. Uh, so I've noticed that the the red is like the nightmare filter. Red is how I know I'm having a bad a, a bad dream. There's work to be done. Bad dream wed. What up, Pastel Misfit? Did you go to the uh the thing? The nerf thing? It's pastelized. Henry, can you hear me? Oh Get shit. Up. What up? It's a new day. Henry, can you hear me? Whoa, you dirty bitch. Get off of me. Hallelujah. <laughs> I thought you'd never wake. Were you having a nightmare? Yeah, I dreamt that this bitch with dirt all over her face was all in my face. Mm. I still have a fever. Uncle what up? Please. No changes of plans, unfortunately. Aw, oh, I'm sorry. I know you're stoked for that. Where am I? In Scalitz? We're at my uncle's mill in Retay. I didn't know where else to go. What happened? Who's this girl? You don't remember anything? I suppose that's not surprising. I found you in Scalitz after those bandits attacked you. I what? thought they'd done for you. What'd you end up doing instead? Breathing. Why in heaven's name did you go back there? It was madness. They slaughtered everyone who didn't run. My parents. Uh, I wanted to bury them. My mother? I had to... Wait, Don't no, worry. I think Mother I Teresa was a different Thank person. You. I think she was a real Any person Christian or something. Done the same. Uh, now sleep. You need your strength back. Wait, am I a King Henry? Am I King You're Henry? Awake. Good morning. Am I playing King Henry? <laughs> it's near midnight. You've slept all day. Oh. Hey. I need to do chores. Like I'm doing the stream part, though. The beating you took was worse. But at least the just a blacksmith's broken. boy. Oh, just a blacksmith's boy. Uh, what do we pick? What were you doing there? What in the world were you doing in Scalitz? Waiting to die. What? They killed my brothers. My uh -huh. family. My friends. Uh -huh. They're all dead. All of them. 
Me too. I ever loved. They so why was she worried about why I was there? After that, what did I have to live for? Purpose. There's always hope. No, there isn't. But it doesn't matter. I'm a different person now. Uh, well, how did you find me? How did you manage to save me? You were lucky. I was in Scalitz and I saw Zbyshek and his thugs. I tried to distract them, but it would have been no use if those soldiers from Tamburg hadn't arrived. They were searching for you and scattered the bandits. Hmm. They were looking for me? Searching for me? Yes. Lord Divish sent them, led by Captain Robard. So tell me, why is a lord of such high standing interested in a blacksmith? So Divish promised Sir Radic he'd look after me. But as for why they should care, I've no idea. I'm tired. Oh, I'm exhausted. I'm not surprised. I'll bring you water and something to eat. In the meantime, rest. You're still very weak. What did she say? You'll understand Teresa because you can play as her in the DLC. Oh shit! How's the invalid today? Uh, like in the past? Since they lashed me to the wheel and quartered me on the town square. Got your sense of humor back. You must be better. My uncle will be glad to hear it. I had a job persuading him to let me bring you here. If you'd lain around much longer, he yeah. really would have dumped you on the town square. Oh, dude. You can stay I'm going to go to the town square and live. throw My ass for shekels. For taking you in and caring for you. Or what are the things called in this in this game? What's the money? Where am I? And this is your uncle's house. We're in Rete Mill. My uncle's Miller Peshek. He took me in and I talked him into taking care of you too. Nice. I've been lying here long enough. Uncle will be pleased he's one mouth less to feed. But are There's you shackles. Well, enough? well enough to do what has okay. to be done. Where can I find Sir Radzig? He's in the lower castle in Perkstein. He's a guest of Sir Hannes of Leiper. But someone Leiper? like you can't just walk up bold as you please and demand an audience. I know the Sir fuck Radzig. I can't. And I didn't bring him his sword as I was supposed to. I must see him. If you insist, but you need to speak to my uncle first. Why? You've been in your sick bed for over a fortnight while he paid the apothecary to tend apothecary, to you. Apothecary, we brought medicine. those up earlier, That's dude. We've come full circle. Rolling. I've been lying here two weeks. My God. Better a fortnight in bed than an eternity in the grave. That's true. If it weren't for my uncle, you wouldn't be here at all. Don't talk to her uncle. Oh shit. Okay. I have to get to work. Fine. But right now, I have more important things to do. That's all you have to say? After everything we've done for you? Well, do as you see fit. Oops. Because then you'll be able to level up your skills for unarmed. Okay. Open. What is all this? He'll send his goons after you if you don't pay up. Oh, nice. Nice. Is that the uncle? Later, dog. DLC activated. Treasures of the past. From the ashes. Tournament. Band of bastards. Woman's lot. Okay. Okay. Later, dog. <laughs> Bye. So everything you say can affect the story. Oh, so she's going to hate me. She's going to hate me then. Okay, so do I have any good stuff? First of all, am I, I, I look like I'm doing good. Okay. So we're going to eat a lot. Like how you did bad to Teresa. How did I do bad to Teresa? There are pots in her home. You can eat some bread. 
Oh man, I'm trying to cut down on this weight I got. I don't know what all I need. I have a bar bardiche. This doesn't seem like much though. Didn't think her, I think Fokker. What's she gonna do? Beat me up? What's she gonna do? Beat me up? <laughs> Sorry. I'm wearing the ring. Fuck it. Which one's better? 8 to 11, but this has... What's that about? Oh, she'll let you lose Henry's virginity. Do I go back and talk to her and thank her? Plus she can fix your clothes. Oh, oops. Okay. Well, I'll go back. I'll go back and talk to her. Should I reload the game? You still in here? No, she gone. She gone. Where'd she go? Hey, lady. I'm ready to be respectful. Hey, I, uh, I, so I've learned new information. And I have come to show respect. I have realized the error of my ways and the vet. No? Oh, okay. I'll thank her. Oops. Have you eaten yet? Not yet. Well, try to eat something. A big lad like you needs a str- No, wait. God! I see. Hello? Look at you, lover boy. How do I make her fix my clothes? None of these are, uh, ha what's the, how do I get her to fix my clothes? I'd like to know what. You have to progress more into the story. Oh. So I guess I already have not thanked her, right? It saved it there. That's kind of fucked. That's kind of very fucked. Okay. Well, uh... I'd like to know... So, how do you like it in Ratai? It's a big town with good strong walls, so I suppose Oops. we're safe here. And they took us in in our hour of need, but... Maybe I, maybe I can riz her up now after the fact. tired of us soon enough. Right? Cause like I got good speech. How are the Scallets folk getting on? They're alive. That's the main thing. They have shelter, but they're just scraping by. Rate's citizens aren't happy the town is full of beggars who don't look like leaving anytime soon. Give it a try. I just need her Do to you fix know my clothes. About those human rapists. Uh, Whoa. About you know. They came to Hungary from God Travel knows where, and now they humans and bandits who won't be able well, to handle them all Well, folk tell awful stories oh, about them. Oh shit! Okay. I never see them again. What do I do about it, though? That's all. What are you up to? How would you like to? Um, I don't know. Uh, come for a walk? A walk? I'd like that very much, but I can't right now. Hal, give me some time to settle in, will you? You have to if train that's hard. What you want. Oh shit. It's not okay. you, Hal. It's just this isn't a good time. Okay. Well then I'm out of here. Or immediately just laying back down. You'll be training through most of your gameplay. Oh shit. Okay. Noted. Okay, so what do I do now? Jay. 
Yet father's sword back. Awakening. Get your things from the trunk. Okay. Now what? Go to... Perkstein. I know I track this one instead. There we go. Okay. All right. So we're gonna just. Uh, I guess we're gonna use the damn. Okay, armor. What happened to my shield? Uh, just don't do anything bad like stealing and killing innocent people. Let's go onto the map and head to Letacheco. Letacheco! There's a new DLC quest. Activity giver. Perkinston. Quest giver. Quest giver. Quest giver. Where's that? Can I do like a, uh... Can I do like a uh, like a custom marker? I can. Okay. It's the star above the windmill. big ass map wish I could be at your house to show you alright so in relation to Tomberg and where I am is it anywhere in between there or like anywhere in this bottom half of the map the only star that is close to you this one or this one A or B? Gotta be A, right? Above you. Got it. X. X marks it. X marks it. Alright, I'm out of here. Later, Uncle. DLC activated. Sick. Alright, and we're off. You'll earn a lot of grossings. Ah, that's the shekels of the time. Oh, damn it, I wish I was able to swim. Aw, oh, dude, I thought I was big brain in it. Fuck. Okay, I see a bridge over there, though. Oh. I remembered the money name. Oh, fuck, dude, am I fucking stuck? Okay. Travel on the road. Damn it. Is that a dead person? What is this? What is this? Moonshine? Well, I mean, you know, you can't just leave it there. There's an axe. Okay. So we're going to go left on this bridge. Oh, is this the guy? What up, dude? You look very familiar. Okay. I don't like his clothes. They look like my old clothes. He, th he thieved my old clothes from me. Okay, let's see. Ooh, ooh. We're gonna go this way. I 
think I'm going the right way. Maybe. We're about to see. There's a road that splits off right here. It's looking good. Oh, shit. Yep. All right. Here we go. Headed right for it. Run, Henry. Man, I wish you could play this third person, too. I would love to play this third person. So basically, you'll do chumps, which is a form of sport to shoot logs in the river. What? Hello. Jesus Christ be praised. Have you heard anything about the Cumans in Sigismund's army? It's easy. Terrible oh, thing. Horrible. Okay. I hear they skin people alive and what they do to the women folk. Better take your own life than fall into their hands. Beasts they are. Animals. These guys sound like uh, Australians. Good luck to you. You too. Okay. Making my way downtown. Walking fast. Faces passing them. Uh, where are we going again? Uh, let a check go bound. Damn, this game looks pretty good. It looks very good. Is this it? Did I make it? I fucking made it. I think. Is this it? Scenery is awesome. I know, dude. The draw distance and all that is pretty good. Let it check go. We made it. Alright, so what am I doing here? There's a guy here? I, I gotta see a guy? About a thing? Whoa! Who's barking? Them dogs are barking. I have to find the archer icon. Ooh, I see some tents out there. Some encampment tents. Reached a new level of vitality. I am more vital. I've become more vital. You discovered grindstone. That sounds like a fucking music genre anymore. Ooh, dude, something stinky. Okay, I thought I saw like white tents somewhere. There they are. That usually means archery, right? Hello. You have a bow? Ah. Oh, aha. I found it. Good day to you. What do you need? Learn how to sharpen and repair your swords. I noticed the oh, targets. Dude, fuck yes. Are you an archer by any chance? I notice you're asking questions. Are you the Inquisition by any chance? No, I'm Henry of Scalitz. From Scalitz? I'm Vatek from here. Why are you so curious about the targets? I'm interested in archery. It's just that I sometimes try my hand at archery too. Try your hand, do you? <laughs> I know plenty who do. When you can score as high as me at chumps, then I might be impressed. I've got no idea what you're talking about. Never played chumps? Nope. And you call yourself an archer? All right, Henry. Listen Never up. even heard chumps of chumps. Chumps is a game for real archers. It tests your strength, stamina, and accuracy. And it can be a nice little earner. Unless you're, well, a chump. So what exactly is it? I'll tell you. A bunch of logs are floated down the river. Then you count to 20, People and the like archers run along, along the banks lawn. after the logs. Oh, heard. At the end of the course, Oops. someone collects all the logs and counts the strikes. Whoever has so the this most, is like real. always meaning me, wins the bout. Each archer has 20 arrows with their own colored fletching, and the contest ends when the last log floats through the finish line. Sounds like good fun. Fun? My friend, it will bring you out in a proper sweat, and you'll be well pleased to hit just one or two blocks. So how about it then? Fancy a bout. You'll need your own bow, but I'll supply the arrows with colored fletching. 
Oh, I don't have a bow that I can use. I don't have a bow that I can use. Sounds interesting. Maybe some other time. Well, if you ever want to gamble... A Farewell. Okay. So let's find the town. Then own your bow and arrow. You can borrow from him. I have a bow. I just am not uh, skilled enough to use it. So when I tried to use it, it uh, it didn't shoot the arrows I wanted it to. It wouldn't shoot them. They barely, they barely did a thing. I had a bow, but I dropped it. But I have this other bow, and I'm not good enough for it yet. Can I show? Can I? Can I shoot these? Is that okay? There's a trader where you can sell your goods. Wait. I. It's a. Uh, Villager's hazel bow. So I don't know. Or wait, hold on. Uh. Yeah, it says you're trying to use a bow that demands better skills than you have now, so its effectiveness is greatly lowered. We've got to start chumps. You think I'll be alright with this bow? I've changed my mind. I would like to play chumps. Well, well. Are you sure? Yes. Absolutely. Come on, then. Ah, one more chump. Excellent. Now you have to bet at least ten groschen. Fifty at most. There'll be three archers competing at the time. The winner gets triple his wager, and the second gets his coin back. So how much will you bet? Oops. I can't back out. No! Fuck. Uh... Well, I don't want to lose the share off my back. I'd best be... That's the betting over with. God be with you. No. And... Now, I'll see you at the finish. What are we doing? Bloody hell, the wind child against me, amateurs. <sighs> oh, well, I won't miss the next one. Let's see you beat that. Got it! I've got this. Easy. No! Mm, it's too deep here. What? There's no way I didn't get that. Oh, I've hit two. Oh, no. Move. Oh, well, I won't miss the next. Damn it. Bloody hell, the wind took it. Oh. Oh. Shit. No, I got it, you fucker. Come here. I got this one. I'll light it up, dude. How's it not hitting? 
There we go. Oh, I'm out of arrows. Fuck! Give me your arrows! Where'd they go? What the fuck? Oh. Give me your arrows! Almost had it. The saboteur. Ah, well, I won't miss the next one. Yes, she will. Yes, she will. Fuck, dude. I've already lost. Give me your arrows. Give me your arrows. Give me your arrows. Give me your arrows. Fuck. No. No, block him. Block him. You can't get any more. God damn it. No, stop. 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 Beat that. Almost had it. Fuck! It's all falling apart. Oh fuck, dude! I forgot about this guy. You chumps! You've no chance against me, amateurs. Oh no! One last arrow and that's it. Did I win? Throw your stuff at the trader. Put that weapon away before someone gets hurt. Bro, shut the fuck. Look out. So, how did it go? You came last, lad. But chin up. As soon That's as good, you right? Money, you it's like golf. Here again and lose it all. God be with you. You fucking asshole. Shoot with. Vatsik again sometime. Who are you? You look like a godly man. <laughs> Jesus Christ be with you, fucks. Or whatever he said. Praise be on to me. Uh, Alright, let's see if we can find. Oh, yeah, they don't like me walking on their lawn. Forgot. Oh, well. going on where? Bro, I am sweating. What do you mean? Did I fuck something up again? I'm so confused. Am I bad at this game? Is it me? Is this the store? Hello? Uh, hello? Oh, no. Hello. Good day to you. What do you need? No, and yes. Dude, it's fine if it's me. It's fine if it's me. Um, let's see. We'll sell the... Uh, let's see. Ooh. Sell the moonshine? I'm gonna sell, like, two of them, right? Moonshine's fine to sell. Oh, dude, we gotta sell all this. All this shit's get going bad. I think. Alright. Oh, he only takes food. Okay. Alright, well, I'm gonna sell everything with an X on it. I feel like I can't use that stuff. That should help me. Buy. I don't wanna buy anything. Okay, so... Haggle. I'd like to discuss the price. Why not? Let's try to get 6.9. Is this enough? We're getting there. Just drop the price a bit more. Damn it. All right, six, seven. I knew we'd come to an arrangement. Reputation gained. 
Okay, so this is the wrong place. The store. That's a piece of good fortune, then. We ought to celebrate. By all means. The best of it is that pair of idiots, Prokop and Andra, were walking right ahead of me, and they never even noticed the purse. And it was lying there right in the middle of the road. <laughs> You're a lucky man. This time, but it all evens out in the end anyway. Huh. Aye, true enough. God's millstones will grind you down eventually. That was weird. The synchronized, like, turn and walk away. Alright, so where's the trader? I just have to find it, don't I? Trader! Is it her? No. There you are. Hello, you trader. You. Shut up. Let's trade. Okay. Sell. Weapons. So do I sell this bow? Do I sell this bow and this sword? And this sword? Dude, I could get so much money for this sword. Ooh, do we do it? Yes. Sell this bow. Accept. Do we sell the hunting sword also? I feel like it'd be a good idea. And the bardiche. I don't really feel like I need it, right? I'm just gonna use the quest sword. Yeah? Alright, let's do it. Armor. Wait. Okay, so we still have another, like, 110 to work with. Uh, okay, so I'm gonna sell that. I'll keep all the rest on. Once you'll borrow a bow from the archer. Yes, dude, that's right, that's right, that's right. Okay. Alright, I think, I think we're good. I think that's good. I think that's good. I think that's good. Okay. Haggle. Let's have a word about the price. Why not? I want... I want 220. Satisfied? Give me 10% more. I'd almost shake up. Ooh. Almost. Ooh. 205. 210. What about this? I'd almost Fuck. shake up. Fuck. Bastard. Almost. Okay. I'll go for that. Alright. 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 I'm not a good haggler yet. Alright, so now we go play chumps again. And we up our bow. So the better you get with a bow, do you get faster at like drawing it and all that? Like knocking it? Okay. So where is that guy? I forget where that guy was. Can you down this? Yeah, he's down that way. Where do I? Can't not walk through this guy's shit. Okay. Okay. All right, we're good. We're in good shape. He sits down and gets on with it. Uh huh. Who's that? The baths. Are you looking for someone? Am I? Hello. What's good? Hey, who's there? Hi. Never. What? What? What did I do? Did I do something? Did yak him. Get that job done for you then. Don't even remind me. I've never seen such a shoddy piece of work in my life. I had to get it put right after him. I can't believe it. Everyone has praised him to the skies. They all say he's a fine craftsman. If he did it for free, he'd be overcharging. Damn it. I was going to get him to do something for me. And who did you get to fix it? Raymond. He's cute. And he does a good solid job. You take my advice. Talk to Raymond and leave 
What does she want? Hello? Can I help you? Who's there? What the fuck is happening? What did I do? Who's there? Answer me. Has something happened? Ah. So can I go in? Who's there? Could I help? Oh, no. Wait, is someone there? Can I go in here? people's houses noted I thought it was the bathhouse okay you know what we're just gonna we're just gonna look I'll forget I was here if you guys do the same all right all right cool so it should be totally fine when we come back Hello, I'd like to chomp. I'd like to try chumps one more time. Of course. And where's your bow? Didn't I tell you? Well, uh... I'd like that. Thank you. And if anything happens to new it, main level, watch out. This one is my favorite. So how much will you bet? Ooh, let's do let's do twenty. I won't overdo it. That's the betting over with. Now here are your arrow. Good luck to you. Thanks. All right, let's try this. Where are they? Oh, okay. That's Damn, missed. Too high. Ooh, barely, barely over. Damn it. Let's see you beat that. Fuck. I won't miss the Damn it, dude. Fuck. I wish I had like a thing that I could like aim. Like when I'm using swords. Got it. Almost had it. There we go. It's two. Huh? I've got this. Easy. Oh fuck. What? Got it. Grab a marker and mark on your monitor. I ain't marking on my damn man. Come on, man. Bro. Oh my God. Bloody hell, the wind took it. Shut up. Dude, what if I just shoot one of them by accident? Don't bet too much. Fuck. You 
stood no chance against me, amateurs. Got it. God damn it, dude. Like, is there a... There's gotta be a thing on here, right? Game settings. Back. Controls. No. Hurry up, you guys. Oh, am I getting sleepy? I need to sleep. Hey. Ow. Oh, okay. So it's over? Because I got shot? Because I cheated? Is it because I cheated? Huh. Well. 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 You'll need a place to sleep. Oh, fuck, dude. Where do I sleep? I don't know where that would be. Tavern. So there's got to be like an inn around here somewhere, right? Ooh, what's that? I think that's the trader. Is that the trader? Yeah, that's the trader. Okay. So what is this thing? Is this like the sword guy? You walk away from the match, you'll forfeit. I don't know whose houses I can go in. Where's the... Where's the sleepy place? Huh. Maybe it's over there. Can't go into anybody's house in the day or night. So can I go in this tavern though? It'll be called trespassing. Where's the... Where do I sleep? It's lockpicking. Can I go in here? I don't know where the room is, though. I don't know where to buy a room. Where do I buy a room? Uh, 
clerk or cameraman or woman that'll help you. Oh, lodgings. I saw it. Somewhere I could sleep. Got it. Aye, there's room here. For how long? One night? Just the one night. Sure, but Gorshin first. These are harsh times. I can pay two. You are. I can pay two. You've got it all to yourself. No one will disturb you. Ooh, nice, dude. Where do I go to sleep? That's easy. As soon as you go indoors, at the end of the room on the left, there's a door leading to the chamber. Everything's prepared for you there. Good luck, then. I'll All put right. it right away. Hey, indoors. Okay. Go on the left. Oh. Okay. Is this me? bread or two it'll fill you up a hey. where is she where's everyone Do I still have any food? I have some. There we go. Bro stuck. Clean from dirt affects your stamina. Oh shit, okay. I shouldn't have eaten that stuff. Now I'm poisoned. That's why I had an X on it. Oops. Whoopsie. How do I... What do I... Uh, wait, why am I fat? Why is there a pig one? What? Do, what's the poison thing mean? How do I... How do I unpoison? What? Uh... Food will spoil. Oh, fuck. Okay. Damn it. How do I... Um, I eat too much? Oh, fuck. Okay. Maybe if I run it off? And does the poison go away? Or do I need to do something about that? It'll go away. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Alright, so I'm assuming we go to the guy and go try to play chumps again? Or... I think it was this way. Or I'm way off. Oh, dude, it's my people. I'm just like you. I'm just like you. Dude, my health keeps going down. The 
There's a nest. Oh, I'm dirty. Can't walk at night without a torch? Oh shit, okay. Oh, dude, my clothes are all dirty? How do I clean my clothes? Uh, roast duck. I eat spoiled roast duck. What does moonshine do? Oh, I probably don't want to use that. Oh, you'll get drunk? Wash myself? Didn't I just wash myself in the trough? Can get drunk in the game. Oh, sick. Yeah, see, my hands are dirty. Hello, lady. Do you want something? What? What's her problem? What's wrong with her? What? The fuck? Ooh, let's go pet the dog. Hi. Hi. Aw, dude. Whoa. Chill out. How do you pet the dog? Was it like? Oh, okay. Okay. We can't. What? It was in the trailer for the new one, though. Damn. Okay. I guess that was very highly. You can pet your own dog. Do I have a dog? Where's my dog? Which is mutt. When do I get my dog? What's the dog you saw at the beginning? Oh, I see. Dude, I can't find that arrow guy. I think I might just be retarded. And get him at the windmill you were staying at. Oh, that, that orange and white dog. the fuck happened to this guy talk to Teresa again see if you can get him to follow you oh fuck this is the wrong way shows in the midday yeah but I, I i can't even figure out i can't uh figure out where the fuck i even run into oh is that wait what he's on the other side now or my no okay oh my god okay so i'm thinking i need a second I'm going to go grab a drink. Oh, I'm going to take this hoodie off because it's getting warm in here. So I will be right back. Give me just a moment.
I'll take my drink with me, huh? Be right back. Here. Here. Don't you worry about a thing, baby. I don't know who the baby is. I mean, I know the rapper, but... Fuck him? I don't know. Uh, reputation is one of the key, and having to train your skills is also the best way to progress in the game. So... If I'm just like a piece of shit to everybody and I don't train at all, what is the what is the likeliness that I could beat the game? Because that's kind of like how I am right now. Where like I don't really I don't do anything <laughs> and I don't talk to anybody. Except you guys. Love you guys. But you know. Come on, you son of a bitch. Got it. What? Got it. For real. This time. Not, not, no joke. Okay. Alright, we're almost there. Pour my drink. Pour my drink. Oh yeah, I gotta take this hoodie off, I forgot. Managed to get like 20k grossins. Oh shit, dude. I feel like that's too much. Are you like a king now? Or how does that work? Ah. Oof. I feel like that makes you a king, doesn't it? Over a hundred plus chump games. I'm what you call a grinder. Oh, shit. Not me, dude. I'm like, dude, how do I get there the fastest? Alright. Let's do this. Hey. Alright, so I'm thinking I, T, what do we do, like, uh, like midday? Well, you can't go that fast. Well, okay. What about like a like a min maxer? Hello, hello. I've come to play. Okay. Max is at 20. Oh, like levels? Wait another hour. Okay. Heard. My fault.
Sorry. Is he stuck or something? I don't know. Discovered a nest? Oh, I see. How do you climb trees? Guess you can't. Guess you can't. Dude, that sheep is not doing good. have small valuable stuff. I'd have to shoot it with a bow though, right? Hello, I've come to play. Watch out! Whoa! Oops. Sorry. Okay, I'm out of here. Uh so um uh Hello. Hello. My respects to you. What's happening around here? What you do to upset him? Uh, so when we were playing, I jumped in front of someone else while they were shooting, and then it made me fail. They're always little there in the like corner. Like I blocked his arrow. Their plots. Like yesterday, for instance. And by the way, now I think of it, I've not seen Kunhuta here for some time. The local herb woman. She always comes here once a week for a tankard of ale. But she ain't turned up recently. And well, I also accidentally punched at her. That was, uh, that was a lot of my bad. I clicked by accident, and uh, well, you see, when you click the mouse button, you punch. But you knew that. You knew that. You guys all knew that. Alright, one sec. Oh. So, I'm out of weed. Okay. Well, um, oh, I know. One second. Uh. What's happening around here? Nothing much, thank God. Peace and quiet is a blessing in this day and age. Oh, bacon? Fuck, dude, I love bacon. Head back into the video. Do what now? What video? Oh, I had to back in the video. Oh, I got you. I got you. My fault. like to discuss the price. Why not? I pay five. Aye, for that amount I can be persuaded. All right. Dude, we're going to haggle everybody. Are you not able to talk to the guy at all anymore? I'm not sure. We're about to check here in a second.
I was like trying to walk away from him to give time to like spawn back into place or whatever. So I guess we're gonna see. Uh, Archer guy. Where's he at? He's still just sitting down. It, so it lets me look at him, but I can't talk to him. just like contemplating life I guess I don't know what the dude I might have just like permanently fucked it up fast travel that's a good call uh, no he still looks kind of mad I'm not sure why he won't talk to you anymore. I am fairly certain that it is because uh, I cheated. Can we do something? I was about like blocking the, the other archers' arrows. Nice. I'll pay a hundred. Ninety-five. Since it's you. Come now, just a little more, and we have a deal. Very well, I agree. All right, cool. All right, so now he he's still just sitting down. Fuck. Hello. I feel like he doesn't like me anymore. What's the matter, laddie? Need to shit? Your fucking Robin Hood looking ass bitch. Back trouble? Yeah, so you cock blocked the guy and now it's bugged. the save before the accident. This is wild. I'm inside him. And now he's gone. Alright. So, load game. Jumps on the river? Oh. 
What? Okay. So... Chumps on the river. Wait, it says complete? Or no. Activities. E. Okay. Alright, maybe we can try again. So let's go T. Wait till noon. do is not eat the duck. We're going to drop the duck. We're going to eat the pretzel. I'm on the quest to find the fucking archery thing now. Oh look, I'm feeding the dogs poison duck. Luck with all that. It's gotta be like this way and this way, right? Yeah. Where's that boy? Oh, there he is. He's standing now. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, wait. So, did I go to the trader already? No. Okay. The tavern. Trader. No. Trader was over this way. Uh, I forget what. Uh, wasn't it like here, maybe? I know, I know. Right here. Here he is. Here's that boy. What up, dude? Good day to you. Yep. Yep. Let's trade. Uh, sell. Weapons. Add a basket. Armor. Haggle. Can we do something about the price? Aye. Let me get thirteen for uh let me get thirteen point five for a dog. A nice sum. Just lower your demands a little and we'll agree. Twelve point five. Come oh, on, price. dude. You motherfucker. Alright. Ah, uh, man, I'm so glad they don't have, like, voice recognition shit on here. Imagine they heard all the shit I was talking to them. That would suck. Wait, so if I can just buy a bow from this guy for five schmeckles, and then go sell it for 11, dude, that's a racket. 
That's a racket. Oh, I still can't talk to him. Hello? What's the matter, laddie? Need to shit? Time is it? One? I think it is now bugged. Incredible. No. Ah! <laughs> well. 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 Oh. Have you eaten yet? Not yet. Well, try to eat something. A big lad like you needs his strength. Mm. Oh, let me sleep. Knock her out. <laughs> Yeah, so savings a thing. I know, I know, I should have saved sooner. Okay. Alright, so we got this. Map. We know where we're going. X. Wait. X. There we go. Alright, we're gonna make it. Alright, so I remember from last time, I gotta get, uh, I gotta get, uh, I'm gonna go around. Over the bridge. Alright, so we're gonna save next time. Oh, I cleared the pig! I was challenging myself to be able to do it, and I did it. We succeeded. back at it. Oh. Oh, God. Okay. Alright. Run, Henry! So, after mastering the archer skill, you'll be able to hold the bow properly? Oh, sick. Okay, so then I'll be able to aim? Whoa, that was weird. Breathe, Henry. Breathe, boy. Come on now. Can you get more health? Can I... Can I get more health? Alright, so I'm thinking once we get to the town, we'll save. 
Yeah. Okay. Sick. There's the town. I found the town. Increased strength, agility, vitality. Hell, what is this? Is that like a scarecrow? I've reached a new level in vitality. Look at there. I've discovered legend. Ah. Hello. I have arrived. Okay, so we gotta go sell all our stuff again. But the good news is, I have a better understanding of the town layout, sort of. I think agility or vitality can be increased by doing archery. I've discovered the blacksmith. Archery range. And fast travel now. Alright, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna we're gonna go sell all our stuff and then we're gonna save it. That nun has an axe. I think she's a nun. I don't know. Jesus Christ be praised. Jesus Christ. Uh, uh. Why do I have two axes? Oh wait, no, I don't want those. Yes. Sorry. What the hell? Sell. And, 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 keep all the rest. Here, I'll sell them my damn, all my poison food can go to you, dog. Oh. Fuck, I sold him an unpoisoned one. Oh well. Should be okay. I have eight save things. Okay. That's good. That's good. That's good. We're doing good. We're doing good. Okay. Uh X. Uh Haggle. Let's have a word about the price. Yeah. Naturally. Do 230, see what happens. What do you say to this? Also, after you get the hang of doing We're archery, you can go treasure Just hunting. Drop the price a bit. Fuck yeah, dude. Ooh, 215. That's, That's more than we got last time. With. Okay. Ah, uh, picky. There's a sword called the Stinger. The DLC treasure hunting is the best. Oh shit, okay. Hello. Good day to you. Good day to you. Are I you noticed an archer? I noticed you're asking No, I'm from Scarlet. Uh-huh. Interested in you archery. Try your I've got no idea what you're talking about. Never played ch chumps is a game for So what ex I'll tell you. At the end of eat. Right, yes. Absolutely. Come on, and where's your bow? Well, uh, hopeless. I'd like that. And if anything happens, now you have to bet at least. So how much will you bet? We'll do ten. I don't. That's the bet again. Take care now. Okay. And now. I'll... I've got this. Easy. Oh. I won't miss it. Got it. 
Oh! Dude, they're so far. Oh! I'm fucking it up! Alright, you need the log that is the closest. I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait for him to get closer. Oh, dude, I'm fogging it up. He's beginning to believe. Dude, I feel so much better now. Oh. Oh, I missed that one. Okay. Another on target. I found a fishing spot. Alright, um... Come a little closer. Oh. 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 Oh, fuck. I fucked that one up. And that one. Got it. They need to chill out, though. on that range in the thousands. Jeez. Fuck. You guys chill out. You guys chill out. I don't want to lose. I don't want to lose. No. Miss. The wind took it. You said time's up. You son of a bitch. I want to do it again. Let's go again. So, how did it go? Second out of three. Not exactly dazzling. Money back. Let's go again. I'd like to try chumps one more time. What you got in? I got, I got eight or seven. Tell you to bring your own? Well, uh, hopeless. Why? I'd like that. Thank you. And if anything happens to it, so how much will you bet? I don't want to lose the shirt off my back. That's the betting over with. Very well. Okay, let's try again. Where's the bow? Oh. Pull the bow out, Henry. What are you doing? What? How am I missing again? Oh, there we go. Uh, if you hit at least 15 or 16, you'll be able to learn to aim from the archer. Oh, shit. Okay. Let's see. Just for wind. Nailed it, dude. Just... Fuck. Okay. Alright, I need to chill out a little bit. Let me get closer. What? 
What? You've no chance against me, amateurs. How am I missing? Bite to eat. I've got this easy. Okay. I don't understand how I'm missing those, dude. I won't miss the next one. Fuck. Well, I got second place again. So if I don't win, I uh, forgot about betting 50 plus other two will get you 150, but you can get 100 gross and each time you'll be betting 150. You'll be betting 50. No oh shit. Me, Dude, he got 10 this time? What the fuck? One last arrow and that's it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't hit 11. I'm... You son of a bitch. Okay. Let's go again. The controller is better on this. Should I play with a controller? I'll be playing with a controller instead. So I'll try it. it I don't know what any of the buttons are now. Second out of three. Not exactly dazzling. But at least you weren't last. Here's your money back. At least I've been getting my money back. Reached a new level in bow. New perk point available. I'd like to try chumps one more time. Of course. Ah, one more chump. Excellent. So how much will you bet? I don't want to lose the shirt off my back. I'd best be careful. That's the betting over with. Now here are your arrows. Farewell. And now. I don't know how to, uh, okay. Ha! Let's see you beat that. Hit! Shit. Bloody hell, the wind took it. Dude, I'm gonna wait on him. They're way too far right now. I feel like. I'll try one. Yeah, they're way too far right now. You can get into the water. I can't go any further. The current could sweep me to my death. Oh. Okay. Fuck, dude, I'm still bad. What the? I got so used to the mouse. God damn it. Not aiming low. I'm trying.
Oh. We'll get the hang of it eventually. I think swapping to the controller has messed me up a little bit. I gotta readjust. I'll take the eight though. Almost had it. I'll take the eight though. Okay, so whistling. How do you jump on controller? Hit. Oh, nobody else get more than me. Nobody else get more than me. Hit. You bastard. Don't do it. Don't do it. Oh, well, I won't miss the next one. <gasps> Damn, miss. Yes. All right. Talk. How did it go? How did it go? Well done, Henry. You've come first. It looks like you really hey. do know what you're doing with a bow. You're still not up to my standard, mind you, but a pretty good effort. Here are your winnings. I hope you'll wager them on some chumps again. Nice. You've reached a new level in bow. So if I end the dialogue, can I play another time? Okay. Hello. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, so we have a, a perk. Oh, wait. That's to wait. How do you... Okay. Uh, player. How do I switch? Okay. Main level. Stats. Minus one on speech. Is it because of my clothes? I'm assuming. bow is two. My bow is two. Skills. Okay, so... Stealth is getting there. Tiredness and hunger. Okay. Alright, so I guess... If you get tired, your speech goes down. Oh, heard that, heard that. Uh, we're gonna eat. Who do you think you are? You won't get far. I'm gonna drop this carrot so I'm not tempted. And this onion and this pretzel. Oh, I'm full. I'm full. Oh, I ate something poisoned anyway. Okay. Sick. Love that. Uh, this isn't the right way. Uh, let's see. How do you run on the controller? Uh. <coughs> Ow. Lift bumper? The bumper's not working. L2. Left trigger's not working either. God be with you. Do you need anything? I'll look on the uh on the thing. Have you got a bed for the night? I suppose I could find something. For how long? B heard that. Just the one night. All good. All good, brother. All right. All good. Money I know the intention. The, it, it's it was well intended. Ooh, dude, shoot. we're gonna haggle. Hmm, that's quite a lot. Can we discuss the price? I will gladly pay you one point five. Good luck, Ben. Ah, uh, okay. I'm sorry. Can I sleep here? I suppose I could find something. For how long? Just the one night. No problem. But you pay in advance. Haggle? Mm. That's quite a lot. Can we discuss the price? 1.8? Satisfied? That's not enough. Fuck. Okay. You've got it all to yourself. No one will disturb you. Dude, I'm a cheap. 
Where do I go to sleep? That's easy. As soon as you go indoors, at the end of the room on uh -oh. the left, there's a door leading to the chamber. Everything's prepared for you there. Yeah, but if you haggle and give the NPC more than what you should, you're, give, you're giving generous. Which increases reputation. Oh, shit. Okay. Take care. Heard that. So should I... Uh... Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna close the door. Right? Save. Oh, I guess I could have saved. Okay, I am not a smart man. How do you like the game so far? It is, uh, it's getting easier the more that I play it, which was kind of like the, the biggest barrier of entry for me. Um, mainly because when I, when I played it the first time, I did so bad. Like, so horribly bad. Like, the mission where you go to get the thing from the guy. The, like, the tools for your dad. So, I just tried to fight the guy. And I, I just kept dying in the fist fight. The mechanic is bullcrap at first. Yeah, and it's like, um... Like, after I got past that, I was pretty much fine. So can you change the controls on that? Because I would like to. I'm guessing no. Don't forget that you'll need to start picking poison. Plant the green one that looks like grass. Wait, what? Picking poison plants, the green one that looks like grass. Humphrey? Thistle? Increase vitality permanent too. Marigold. Poison ivy, I think. Oh shit, okay. Where would I even find that? find them through your travels. Oh, so just kind of like keep an eye on them. I got you. My respects to you. I'd like to try chumps one more time. Of course. Ah, one more chump. Excellent. So how much will you bet? Oh, you know I'm betting... 10. 
I don't want to lose the shirt off my back. I'd best be careful. That's the betting over with. Now, here are your arrows. Take care. Pick a lot of them to get that perk. I heard that. Oh, damn it. I wish I was able to swim. Damn it. Damn, miss. Are you some new kind of day? Okay, I'm gonna wait this out. Actually, how far can I get? It's pretty close. Oh my god. Okay, I held it too long. What? Am I too high? Yeah, okay. So far, so good. Dude, we're fucking it up. Jesus. It's not as shallow as it looks. Shut up, Henry. We're fine. Oh, I missed that one. Oh, fuck. Too low. Ooh, this one's pretty close. Bam. Okay. Well, we got 10. I feel pretty comfortable with that lead. If any of you motherfuckers... Damn, missed. Yeah, keep missing. Another on target. I won. So, how did it go? Well done, Henry. You've come first. It looks like you really do know what you're doing with a... All right. Hey, I got 30. I'd like to try chumps one more time. Dude, we're going to be rich. We're going to ah, be fucking rich. Jump. Excellent. So how much will you bet? Ooh, did we go up to 20? We'll keep it at 10, I don't dude. Want to lose the share off we're my doing back. fine. I'd best be careful. That's the betting over with. Now, farewell. All right, let's do this. Or 20-ish. No, no, no. You boys, calm down there now. You have no chance against me, amateurs. All right, so. Hey! You can do it whenever you want to get the hang of it. Oh, we're doing it, dude. We're going to hit all 20 arrows in, this, in these sons of bitches. Get out there, dude. Get out there. Who are you? 
Who am I? You know who the fuck I am? I am your reckoning, bitch. Sakra. It's hellishly deep here. Shut up, Henry. No! Fuck! Dude, we missed one. God damn it. Okay. Damn it. Okay, we're doing pretty bad now. That's what I said. And I missed the next three. Get out there, Henry. Wait in the world. Uh, I probably shouldn't sing that, actually. Why is it not going far enough now? It's like it's not going far enough, or is it going too far? I really can't fucking tell. I guess it's going too far. You've no chance against me, amateurs. Damn it. Keep getting more and more, though. I'll take the 12. I'll take the 12, I think. Ooh, don't do it. You son of a bitch. I still win, right? So, how did it go? Well done, Henry. You good luck to you. All right, I think uh, I think we're doing pretty good there. Let's see. Let's see. Bow. Ooh, dude, our bow's up to three. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. It's our best skill now. And I think I'm kind of getting it. The arrow is your reticle. Wherever the arrow is aiming is where it's going to go. Get it up more. How high do I want to go? How high should I go? I'd like to try chumps one more. Of course. Ah, one more. So how much will you... I don't want to lose the... That's the better go. May the Lord watch over. I better not go in any further. I might drown. Oh wow. What the fuck was that, dude? Ah, oh, fuck. Got too high. Uh, also, yeah, horses cost a lot. Oh, shit. Yeah, I probably should have procured a horse. Oh, fuck. That was way too low.
Damn it. You'll get your own horse named Pebbles in the main story, but I recommend saving money because you can sell Another Pebbles and buy top. a better horse. Well, Pebbles, this is the end of the line for you. Unfortunately, you've become useless. But you're just not good enough for me. Dude, how? How am I missing? No! I'm being sabotaged. Sabotaged! I feel pretty pretty good about 13. That's better than the 12. Bloody hell, the wind took it. Ah well, I won't miss the next one. You should. Ooh, dude, if they both miss one more, there's no way they can win. You sons of bitches. Easy game. Easy game, dude. So, how did it go? Well done, Henry. You've come first. It looks like you really do know. I'd like to try chumps one more time. Of course. All right. Let's see. Ah, we'll probably do this until chump. five. Excellent. So how much and then we'll been? switch. Uh, we'll switch it up a little bit. I don't we'll probably just keep it at the ten, bag. honestly. I best we keep, be careful. We keep making That's money, dude. With. Now here are your arrows. Good luck to you. And now. <coughs> uh, shame I can't swim. We don't need to swim where we're going. Oh fuck. Okay. play some Assassin's Creed to be honest. TBH. Oh fuck. Damn it dude. We're doing worse than we were before. What? Bad news, you're gonna have DLC from the ashes, so you'll need 30k or at least 50k because it's a lot of money to build a village near Tomberg. Oh shit, okay. Weed. Weed. Ooh, dude. We're pacing for 15. Oh, 14. Mm, it's too deep here. Too high. Well, we'll get 13. Fuck! We'll get 12. We'll get 11. Hit! 
That's it, right? We're done? It's over? I win? Did I win? Don't you guys fucking do it. Don't you do it, you sons of bitches. Another on target. Oh. What the fuck? I was Another in the ground. Got it. That's it. Okay. Don't. Oof. So, how did it go? Well done, Henry. I'd like to try chumps one more time. Of course. Here's a new level in bow. Level four. Ah, one more chump. Excellent. So how much will you bet? I don't want to lose the shirt off my back. That's the better. Good luck to you. Okay. All right. We got this. I don't know how, like, it feels like sometimes it just doesn't go far enough. aiming too low it feels like it just makes up its own fucking mind dude like how the fuck am I aiming in the same spot it looks like it's going below like too low I don't know what the fuck. But then I aim lower than that, and it hits. Yeah, see, that makes no fucking sense to me. I think I've got the aiming down now, though. I say that, and then I miss again. But hey, we're pacing for a pretty decent... Maybe 14? Maybe 14? Damn it, I wish I was able to swim. Ooh, 13 again. One of these guys has one. What is he, me? What is he, me, four games ago? Another on target. Come on, call time. Hit. Mm hmm. Uh huh. Uh huh. So, well done. I'd like to try chumps one more time. Oh fuck! Of course. No, ah, I didn't. I so didn't want to do it again. I don't want to lose the share off my back. I'd best be careful. That's the better. Take care now. All right, we'll do one more.
Hi, right, George. I think I've got it. Shallow as it looks. Oh, fuck, dude. We missed one. All right. Let's see. I need two more. Two more for the thing. Oh, fuck. Okay, I'll save him. Maybe I can fucking get them here while they're closer. Here. Oof. You said I need 17, right? That was 18. I won't miss the next one. Dude, we only missed two. I feel like I'm getting better. Let's go, dude. Fuck. They tried so hard and got so far. But in the end, it's not even gonna matter because I only missed two, God damn it! let's go. Quinn, thanks for the uh, the encouragement, dog. I don't think I would have tried this many times without you. Me and this Time's dude are just sitting here like, all right, all right, it. hurry up, hurry up, you guys. Wait on me. So, how did it go? Well, it would seem you hit more than I ever have, which means I take my cap off to you, Henry. You're the Let's finest go. archer I know. Here are your winnings, and uh, stop by here easier. again sometime. I have As your skills go up, I imagine it's like stuff to do gets easier. You said you have something for me. You said if me. I came by, you'd have something for me. So I did, didn't I? You've impressed me, Henry. I haven't seen such excellent bowmanship in quite a while. Thank you. In my younger days, I learned a certain trick. Then I fell in a ditch once, drunk, and injured my hand. So I can't do it anymore. Ooh. But I can teach you the knack of it, if you like. Really? Well, I'm certainly not going to say no. May the Lord watch over you. Dude, we got another level in the bow? Hold the fuck on. Dude, level six? Now try the chump after you learn from him. You'll be amazed. Aw, oh, dude, am I about to learn, like, the reticle thing? Or like, uh, or like where I can, do I get to aim? Alright, so where's this motherfucker live? I guess I'll just follow him home. That sounds really bad out of context, if I'm being honest. Where are we going? Where are we going? Where are you going? Vatsik, where do you live? You'll be able to zoom in a lot more. Ooh, okay. Okay. Sick. 
Dude, thanks for that. That's going to help a lot. I guess I could just like wait an hour, right? And then just go to where he is. still there. Okay. So maybe we'll wait another hour. Okay. Did you see Bashik at the market the other day? There we go. Oh, I was looking right. There he is. Alright. What up, motherfucker? You gonna teach me the arrows, dog? Not it. Is it? Is that it? No. Yo. Yo, guy. What? Where are you at, dude? Okay, well at least I know where he lives now. Maybe I should... Nope, not that. Nope, not that. Nope, not that. Nope, not that. Ah. That's what it is. Okay, so... I'm gonna place a marker here. Oh wait. What's that? No. Hey. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to. I was trying to get out my damn my torch. Okay, we're going to the inn. Where was that? That is this way. No, hold on. Fuck. No. Where's the ale master? Where's the alesman? We discovered the baths. Where the where? 
Oh, I guess that. I don't know. God be with you. Do you need anything? Yeah, I need to sleep, lady. Have you got a bed for the night? Certainly. For how long? For Just one, one night. night. All right. Money up front, though. So what if I do this, then? Haggle. Mm -hmm. We have $368 Can now. we discuss the price? I'm going to give her some extra money. You've got it all to yourself. No one will disturb you. The darkness at night is something. Yeah, I've noticed that it's very May dark. May the Lord watch over you. It is very dark. Alright, so... Oh, nope. Didn't mean to do that. We'll do that. And we will unequip the torch. Close the door. Alright, and we're gonna save it now that we've unlocked the thing. And we'll wait until like six. Oh, dude, we're gonna need to find some food. I don't know if we have any food. We have like dried nuts and stuff. We can eat, I think. I'm guessing you're gonna play another game. Yeah, here in a minute, we're gonna... I'm thinking Assassin's Creed Black Flag. Uh, it's another game I haven't uh, ever played a whole lot of. I played it a little bit, uh, you know, back in the day, but, like, I'm already further than I ever got back then. But I'm thinking change of pace, go Assassin's Creed... Or, uh, we could play Dragon's Dogma or something. I don't know. What do you guys want? Can I meet this dude here? Anything? Hey. So, can I... No. Dude, why is everyone upset? Mother of God. What? <sighs> Are you Are they okay? Where's that guy? He's supposed to be over here, isn't he? He's literally like inside. Where's his house? Oh, wow. Okay. Do I have to wait? Like an hour? Aha! That's him! It's you! <sighs> Is that not him? I'm just gonna ambush him when he comes out. I could do What's going on there? What do you mean? Hey, I never. Who's there? Good day to you. What do you need? Who are you? Mother of God. Farewell. Uh, at your house. You said to meet you at your house. I don't get it. 
I don't understand. Don't forget to eat, you're right, you're right. Oops, nope, put that up. Do I still have food? I do, okay. So we're gonna, we're gonna eat the bread and the carrot. Uh, oh, I don't know what the marigold does. Okay. Oh, forgot. Marigold potion heals you. Oh, shit. Okay. Sick. God be with you, good sir. Alright, so... What's happening around? Ah, you know what? Now I think of it. The local herb, I'm by the... Especially whenever they're... Pa okay. Take care now. Alright. Fearless Felix. Love it. What is this? Is this a game I can play? Weren't they like rolling dice here or something? Ah. Alright. So, I'm gonna save it. Game saved. It's a dice game. What does it do? exit. We're going to take a quick little break. See what's popping off in the world today. Do I have notifications? Hey. Hell yeah. Uh, you can bet your grossings. Oh shit. Okay, so we can make even more money. Oh, I was talking shit on Prime earlier. Alright, so. Trending. What's trending? Sheets Inc. faces backlash. They want to get rid of criminal background checks. Like being uh, a thing you can discriminate against or whatever. Apparently some people would have preferred it if Bethesda had made Fallout 5 instead of Starfield. Dude, could you imagine if they would have made Fallout 5 instead? Right when the game's coming out? That shit would have sold like crazy, bro. What? A female Jewish student has been stabbed in the eye with a Palestinian flag outside Yale University? Yeah, I don't know about that. That sounds like a little false flagish. That sounds a little false flagish. Shit. Oh my god. Google gave up on being woke. Game journalists should be abolished. 
So there's been a conversation a lot about Hades 2. Really popular game. Uh, it came out a few years ago. Uh, I played it myself. I went through pretty much all the content in the game. I'm a fan of the game. I love the game. Big surprise, it's getting a sequel. Hades 2 is already fixing the game's biggest problem. I'm What's the game's biggest problem? To improving body diversity. In oh. Okay. So not like, uh, you know, uh, features, like gameplay features. Hades 2 technical test. That's right, guys. What's the real problem that Hades 2 had? It wasn't gameplay. It wasn't story. It wasn't content. It was body diversity of the Greek gods. But what we get to see here, uh, Hades is the kind of hot that we need right now, which is crazy for me to see this because look at how they treated Stellar Blade. Despite what certain corners oh. of the internet might believe, there isn't a lack of attractive people in modern video games. Baldur's oh. Gate 3 just set a Game of the Year award record, and that game was full of hotties. But oh. when compared to something like Stellar Blade's Eve, the standard bearer for the latest gamer culture war, the manner in which Hades depicts its characters and their attractiveness is fundamentally different. Ow. Bro, I literally have to censor her own article picture like it's some new Twitch meta to avoid YouTube striking the video down. What kind of brain rot do these people have? What? This is fucking naked, yeah. People are actually acting like this girl, Aphrodite, who, by the way, is like the goddess of love and lust, is less sexualized than a girl in a latex bodysuit. That's where we're at. I'm really excited for the game. I'm going to play it whenever it comes out. But these are some of the characters the here. Fuck? And obviously, all of the uh, games journalists are soy-facing over this because of the fact that now they have a, a Greek god in a wheelchair. I th I'm, I'm really glad. A Greek god in a wheelchair, bro. If he was a god, couldn't he fix his legs? If he was a god, couldn't he just fly? Why does he need to be in a wheelchair? Oh my god. Whoa, that is way too loud. Sorry about that. Dude, Columbia University is fucked right now. Like, regardless of either side that you're on, you know nothing productive is happening in that school right now. As far as, like, their goal of maintaining a higher education curriculum. Like, that shit ain't happening right now. <laughs> Holy shit. Streamer gets repeatedly spat in the face on in Shibuya. Uh-oh. Oh, dude, he's about to cry. You see it in his eyes, dude. Why is it the volume all the way back the fuck up? Put her fix that. Damn. some very Yo, white spit. Blood. Also, what is the blood spot right there? Did he get assaulted? Guys, I gotta go to the police, man. You won't stop. No, 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 I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Jesus. What the fuck? What the fuck? I ate cricket mi meat mints and it was delicious. Here's why we should all be eating insects. I will not eat the bugs. Don't eat bugs. It's bad for your health. Whoa, okay, hold on now. 
Ah, uh, you know, I, uh, what? Two ladies flipping a guy's car after he burnt the, what? Flipping his car? Oh, is he in like a smart car? Is he in like a smart car? How do they even know which book that is? What the hell? What the fuck? Come on, we're gonna get this get this motherfucker. No way, dude. No way. No way. Pit maneuver that motherfucker. Holy fuck. Insane, dude. Who is that? Fucking Michelle Rodriguez in that bitch? Fast and Furious, dude? It's all about family. It's all about family. A lot of Hitler stuff. I guess it was his birthday yesterday. Whoa, dude. This is weird. That was wild. Dude, a little bit of civilian justice there, I guess. I don't know what the fuck. <laughs> um, an AI drive through To Wendy's, what would you like? Can I have a chocolate frosty? And I have a chocolate frosty. Which size for the chocolate frosty? Medium. Oh, bro, it's Can OV. I, I want, I want the AI drive through that's like. What you want. Otherwise, it just don't feel the same. It just don't feel real, you know? Go ahead. Just, <laughs> I, need, I need the AI to be like, go ahead. No, thank you. Great. Please pull up to the next window. Welcome to... Dude, how do you, what if you pulled up to it and you were like, yeah, can you go ahead and take uh, $50 off of my order? You think it would listen? Nipple drama. What? Charlie, why are people talking about Charlie D'Amelio's nipples? Isn't she like 17 or something? <laughs> I've lost my life to playing and modding Fallout 4. All four is pretty cool. Do people genuinely think all gay people do is have sex with each other? I mean, that's all straight people do. But gay, gay people, are you having sex? What's the circle? What's the purple circle about? I don't get it. God King of the Daily Wire. He refers to himself as that. Jeremy Boring. Everyone's always hating on blue hair. Are they? Uh, do you believe that God created the universe? Okay. What are they doing? Fallout 76? No, I don't know what this is. Oh, Elden Ring. Got it. Okay. All right. So, 
I'm thinking, what do you guys think about some some black flag? What do you guys think about some black flag? Or we could do some hell divers. We haven't held of in a while. Assassin's Creed. It showed my key. Don't look at that. I'm pretty sure since I've already redeemed it, it would just error it out anyway. My lower back's been hurting lately. Like a lot. I don't know why. Oh, I need to re-enter my password. Okay. How's that? Preparing to launch my game. Alright. So we are playing Assassin's Creed Black Flag. How's uh how's everyone's weekend been so far? What have you guys been up to? Yesterday I took off and I went to uh, a friend's birthday party. That was that was a lot of fun. Uh ate some good food. Uh and then came back home. So loud. Um came back home and uh Watched a documentary and what? How? We only played one, one, one go. Loot cloth. Okay, I don't remember where what I was doing in this. I don't even remember how to fucking run. Okay. Right trigger. Got it. Yes, I've returned, boys. All right, let's go find some cloth, I guess. Ooh, what's that? What's that right there? Sugar. Trim the yards off the wind. Ease the spanker. Hold down. The spanker. What the fuck? Ribs and dogs. Hey, fuck yeah, dude. I had a damn uh, grill once, and that man, I loved cooking out on that thing. There's just something about it. All right, we need to find us some damn cloth. There's two. All right, maybe we can find one off these one of these ships. Oh, they're done, dude. I don't even think we'll have to get off the off the ship. Oh, yep. We'll have to get off the ship. Damn it. You thought you could. All right. Well, it's over. We did it. Fuck. I like the grill fire pits you see at the campgrounds and parks. Oh, yeah, dude. Like those, those ones that uh, fucking got the big old shits on them. Uh, with like the big handles that are like those things. I don't know, like spirals or whatever. Dude, those are so fun to use. Like the big open... They're like open, kinda. Alright, we got six cloth now. Oh, dude, let's go fuck this ship up. 
We're gonna go fuck this ship up. See if they have any. They think they're gonna get away, but they ain't. She rises early in the morning. Dude, they're fought. Ooh. That's a pirate hunter. Where? Oh, dude, fuck him. What's he gonna do? What's he gonna do? Let's move. What's he gonna do? I feel like we could take him. Done, dude. We didn't even have to board it. Shanties are my jam. Yeah, dude. I would like to uh, potentially drink a little bit later, maybe, and then just sing them, sing them with the boys. I kind of want to see if we can face that pirate hunter, dude. To make the ship stronger, what do you think? What do you think? Do we try the pirate hunter? Or do we just go back and finish the mission? I guess we'll go finish the mission real quick. Pirate Hunter? Alright. Dude, let him. We're doing it. We might have some private talk. I go no roven with you, fair me. Restricted area, I don't give a shit, dude. Your seven seas, you have to sink him. Dude, I'll find him. I don't know where he is, but fuck. He was out this way, right? From me, Mark. Well, what I do say, so take a warning, boys, from me. With other men's wives, don't make too free. I'll go no more a roving. We're sailing straight for land, sir. No, we're not. No, we're not. No, we're not. Where is this dude? Where'd he go? He was out this way, right? Is that him? I think that's him right there. I think that's him right there. Dude. I think that's him. That's a big ass ship. I return with the blue snail. What up, DB? Dude, I feel like that's them. Oh, that hurt. 
That hurt. Oh shit. Dude, there's more ships. Fuck. We did that shit, dude. Oh man. Oh no. Dodge it. We fucked him up, dude. Oh, there's another ship right there. Oh, dude, you think you're going somewhere? Think you're getting away from me? Oh! Oh, we miss. Aha, get fucked. Yes, let's go. We're boarding. We're going to fix it. Easy. Last one I played was Origins. How about Odyssey or Rag uh, Ragnarok? Valhalla? Is this Black Flag or Rogue? Black Flag. I don't know what Rogue is. Is Rogue good? Okay, we did it. I think we did it. Alright, so we're going to turn back now. Nah. We're gonna turn back now, yeah. Ooh, or there's a ship out there, dude. This is a big ass ship out here. Holy fuck. So is that one. Damn. Oh my god. Okay. Who's this? I don't give a fuck what it is, dude. Dude, they can mortar my ass. Oh, wait. Oh, fuck. Oh! Oh no! Oh no! We did it! Oh fuck! Okay, there was more than one ship, I see. So I'm not ready for that yet. I see that. All right, well, we've made it back to the merchant, at least. There you go. Mission complete. Silk on the waves. Okay, so I'm wondering, can I buy upgrades then? Buy upgrades. I need more armor. 
Damn, it's 15k. I don't have enough for any. All right, I guess we're gonna go to the next uh, mission here. Let's see. Wait, can't we do something here? Outfit ship. No, okay. What's the fleet about? I think that's the last thing I did right before. Loading Kenway's fleet. What does this mean? Why is it taking so long? I never played Odyssey, but I did play a little bit of Valhalla. Valhalla was fun. I feel like there was way too much stuff to collect, though. I don't know how anybody else felt, but it felt like there was so much shit to collect. It's a fine day for any kind of mischief. What's your feeling? I'll make no secret of wanting to see the British brought to heel. If we can take their gold and put it to use ourselves, I'll be a happy man. Spoken like a true Welshman, Ade. And what's your aim? Master Kidd hinted at a prize he was eager to show me down in Tulum. Quite some distance, mind, on the Yaktan Peninsula. You trust him to play it fair? I can't be sure. He has a way they should of leave me alone as long as I don't me pause. fuck with them, right? Should go see him soon. So long as don't we do it, dude. Along the way, I'm sure the crew will understand. I'll set a course for Tulum. Let's go, dude. What do you guys think is the best Assassin's Creed? Do you think it's this one? I played uh, I played one all the way to the end, and I played three all the way to the end, and that's about all I've done. Three made me stop playing them, if I'm being honest. Ooh, there's a cave here, dude. Oh, fuck. Oops. Okay. Well, uh, sorry. You guys be here when I get back. Let's go see what the fuck we can find over here, dude. There's a cave. Which is interesting, because like I haven't, I haven't been in a cave yet. Depends which game is more favorable. Um, so I always hear that this one is the best one, but what is this? Okay, some note. I'll read it later. Find the smugglers' chests. Are they in this cave? Enjoy the first one the most. Yeah, dude, the first one was so good. Oh, damn. Come here. Back and forth and 
back and forth staring at these damn walls. I know, right? I've ended your suffering, good sir. There's a guy up here. Ooh, can I find anyone else first? There's some people over there. Hold on. How do I... Heal vision. Is that it? Is that all we got? Okay. Oh no, there's more. Oh man, too bad. That's too bad. Oh, stop it. Thank you. Uh, from one of the bins I've played, I'm enjoying playing the first one. I will say the first one really kind of like set the stage for a lot of, uh, I don't know. It was, it was just good. Who said that? I demand an apology. Leave my mother out of this, or I swear. Sick. Oh no, I'm on fire. But uh, the first one, I don't know, man. It just like. I feel like everything in the first generation, or like the Xbox 360 era, was so goaded. Like Gears of War, Halo 3, dude. Come here, my guy. Come here, my dude. Got him. What a dummy. Uh, what else? What else? What else came out in like the the Xbox 360 era? Oh, there will be nothing left anyway. Fallout, New Vegas, yeah, Fallout, Skyrim, fuck, dude, that's right, dude, all these, like, oh, Mass Effect was another one, Mass Effect, people don't really talk about that anymore, I guess Andromeda kind of killed Mass Effect, Watch Dogs, was that 360, really, damn, alright, let's go find this last chest, I feel like it was over here, wasn't it, yeah, 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 yeah. It's up top. Resistance, Fall of Man, dude. That game was way ahead of its time. What was that other one where they, like, promised to have, like, uh, what was it? 150 player multiplayer or whatever? What was that called? Wasn't it, like, Mag or something? Guitar Hero? Fuck, dude. Yes. Guitar Hero was. It was, like... <sighs> Uh, like rock band and shit was way big in the day. Oh my god, I keep setting myself on fire. Alright, so I guess we can return to the ship. Mad Max? Aw, oh, dude, fuck. I didn't even. I forgot about Mad Max. Get the main screen! Loose all and swim sharp to the wind! I played one and two, I never played three. Uh, what else, man? Fucking, ooh, Oblivion? Yes. Max Payne? Fuck. Yeah, Max Payne, that's what it was. Fuck, man. Or, uh, do you guys remember Crackdown? Like, Crackdown 1 and 2? Ooh, Saints Row back when it was good? Dude, Saints Row 1 and 2 were fucking awesome. Saints Row 3 was even okay. 4, they kind of lost the plot a little bit. The whole alien invasion simulation thing was crazy, but... Oh, 
Why does it echo it like that? Why is it echoing? Ooh, Bioshock 1, 2, and 3. Yes, dude. Dishonored. So many, like, fucking legendary games. Dead Island. Dead Rising. There's a chest here. I want to grab it. Seen it. There it is. Far Cry 1, 2, 3, and 4. Yes, dude. Jack and Daxter. I fucking love Jack and Daxter. I play I beat all three of them. Which is rare for me. I think I've done that with that and God of War. And Call of Duty Modern Warfare. I think that's it. Just listing off games that I have. Dude, uh, so Bully, I actually have on like a, uh, a, a, a thing I can't mention the, I, I don't think, am I allowed to say that I've, uh, I have Bully in a playable thing. Fuck, um... Ooh, Grand Theft Auto 4 was so good, dude. That's when they finally like started making GTA again. Now I have 70 games on my Xbox Series S. Oh shit. Ooh, a bag of gold, bro. Ooh, can we take this other pier thing? Oh, God. What? Wait a minute. What's happening here? on 360 fuck yeah it was dude halo wars was awesome i've got developer mode on series s well worth it can play medieval god of war and retro arc uh-oh uh-oh all right they're after us dude they're after us Trying to come after me, dude. Eat my ass, brother. Or wait. Sorry, I got a little excited. 
Mercer! Trying to hunt me, dude? Who do they think they is? Developer mode? Dude, are you able to like play online still? Or they can can they see that shit? How do you get away with that? This is coming from a guy who wanted a JTAG Xbox but was always afraid that he would get his account fucking perma banned. Oh, dude, we got loot here. Or something? I don't know what those are. This is a new spot. Dock us, boys. Look, it's a British. What are they gonna fucking ram into my ship? Dude, chill. Dude, I could easily just like. Shooting them for me. Good shit, dog. Hey, fuck the British. You am all right? Uh, they let you buy it on the Microsoft Store? Oh, shit. So you can, like, buy game hacks on Microsoft now, and they're just cool with it as long as you pay for it? Is that, like, the... Is that right? Hello. I've come to bargain. <laughs> well, it's on some. I'll fight you with your weapons, dude. got Assassin's Creed Unity. Is that the one you can play online? Oh! <laughs> Ow. The remastered version? Oh! Oh! Oh my god. Puedo hacerlo. Oh no. Ow. You bitch. Fuck you. Don't ring the town bell. 
you fucker. Alright. You guys are making me get the swords out. I had it when uh, I got on an Xbox. I think it came with it, the Xbox One. You're fine, dude. I'm only after the British. Done, dude. Oh, I've already been here. Xbox One. Dude, it's, uh, fucking. That's the one with, uh, is that Ezio? Shit, I better hide then? Why? What happened? What happened? Oh, are you British? Oh, don't worry about that, dude. I'm just after the British in the game. Ah, Mr. Kenley. Captain's trip. Okay. Fire! I'm American. Hell yeah, brother. Close down, guns. Hell yeah, brother. Alright, how do I look at the map? How do you even look at the map? Fire! Not that. Like this? Okay, where the fuck are we trying to get to? Holy shit. Okay. Alright, so we'll set a marker for this. So that way we know where we're going. Cajun City. Hey. Hell yeah, dude. What's that? Uh, that French. French influence. That, that Creole. Like the seasoning. We could probably just take this thing out, just for the fuck of it. And the fellow from Unity is Arno. Oh, so not a, not a damn, what's your loser? Oops. Done. This is the longest stream you've ever done. Oh no, brother. I did a 24 hour stream when Starfield launched. Made it this whole big thing. Which one is the American Revolution one? That was the uh, Assassin's Creed 3. But no, we, uh, we did a 24 hour stream when Starfield launched and that is my longest stream currently. I think my second longest was like 16 hours, maybe. Oh, then I meant that one. Sick, dude. You were right on the money. You got it 100% accurate, actually. Do we bully this tiny ship? Believe it. Believe it, dude. Starfield was good. In the halftime. Uh, so I basically got to the final story mission by the end of stream. Um, but I was nowhere near strong enough. Oh, 
it, uh, like I got to the point where you're making the thing at the end, like that decision or whatever, and I made the decision. And then it was like, all right, so you gotta, you remember Doritos Crash Course? I don't. What was Doritos Crash Course? Where you get to redo the whole campaign? Is that it? Uh oh. What are they gonna do? What are they gonna do? What are you guys gonna do? Fucking nothing, that's what. Oh god. That fort might do something now. Oh god. Oh god, and there's tornadoes. We're in the sight. Sounds all but me. Batten yourselves. Yes, dude. Uh, Starfield keeps all your skills, you unlock and abilities for the next universe. I've done it for the whole campaign several times, kind of like trials, but running through the obstacle course is your 360 avatar. Oh shit, that's kind of cool. Gotta be an easier way up, right? Captain has the helm. Let's see if we can go around the other side, maybe. 
Fire! Dude, we fucked him up. Get the you get to do any relationships with the main characters and start feeling like romance. Dude, I tried. So I had that blonde lady with me. I think her name was Sarah. Uh, I tried to fucking riz her up, dude. She wasn't going for it. I think she was a lesbian or something. Maybe I was a, a what? Maybe I was a girl. Yeah, one sec. Cannon ready! I wanted to grab that loot real quick. Sorry. Yeah, dude, Sarah didn't want anything to do with me. I was so pissed. I was like, what the fuck? I'm wasting all my goddamn time. Oh, was I supposed to be... Oh, well. Dock us, boys. Dock us, boys. Dock with me, men. Dock with me, my men. Yes. All right, we're going to make it. Oh, you bitch. Yes. Oh, you bitch. Oh. Yes, dude. Fuck with me. Docked and loaded. Dude, leave him alone. Now, now, now. You thought you could get away from me. Son of a bitch. We got him, dude. We fucked him up. There's a chest around here. Oh, man. Dude. Alright, so we gotta reach the war room. You fuckers. Alright. War room. So what is this? I, I don't know what these things do. We did it. My fort now, dude. Me and my black flaggers. What is this SI? Sacrifice Island? Now hold on. Hear me out. Maybe that would be kind of cool. Seems you can use a little help disappearing, friend. Sure. Oh, there's an assassination contract. Well, where's this guy? 1500. Thousand. Okay.
four more days until the new update of Fallout 4. Aw, oh, dude, you know we're going to be downloading that shit. We're going to be downloading and playing that shit. That's going to be incredible. Dude, I have crowd control, too. Um, so where we're at in Fallout 4 so far is uh, not very far. And I was like, oh, dude, we can fucking... Look, I'll get my bearings and stuff, and we'll, we'll, we'll get it cranked out and stuff. We've got, a, we've got a fresh playthrough that's been going on where I am not doing very well. I basically just have been running around with a big-ass hammer and, like, one-shotting everything for the most part. Air sacrifice island. Go get the chest. I can't, I can't not get it, dude. It's right there. Oh, I've seen it. I see it. It's literally right there. Oh. Risky business with that there uh, eagle dive. Oh, dude, I can help you with your special. There's a glitch where you're able to max them all out. Wait, on Fallout? Or on this. I think Sacrifice Island is a DLC island. Oh, shit. I mean, do we go to it? Should we go? I feel like it's worth worth exploring. Right? It sounds legit. Like, hey, let, meet me on Sacrifice Island. What do they do there? Oh, you have to ask. You're going to be the one they sacrifice. They don't take kindly to stupid on Sacrifice Island. Ride this blow? Hold on. What up, Pastel Misfit? What up? We're going to Sacrifice Island. Yeah, I guess so. Sure, it'll be fine. You need your special book from Sean's room and you'll need a contra contraption and electrical build. Sick. Okay, find Drake's treasures. Drake? Who we sacrificing? I don't know yet. Usually? Okay, so this is just like, from everything that I know, typically it's virgins? So I think we're okay. Okay, none of that goes anywhere. All right, we're going up. Going up. Ooh, restricted area, huh? Why didn't I secret, secret kill him? Why didn't I kill him secretly? Hmm. Dude, we can't even make it up there. The hell? Come on, man. Hmm. Can I climb this? Oh. Sacrificing Quinn. Hey, nah, bro. I wouldn't do that to you. You fucker. What? Oh. But. Well, that's the way she goes. He almost got me.
Come on, Jack Sparrow. All right, dude, we got him. You just sit there. Sit there and chill. Wait, there's a chest. I guess, it, is it above me? I'm guessing it's above me. Oh no, who could have done this? Nice try! We will catch you! Maybe he did not run home. Hold on. Did he dump his shields here? Dummy. You big old dumb. Big old dumber. Alright. We did it. Alright, where's this fucking treasure, dude? Now hold on. Ow. I can hear it. There it is. Aha. Okay. So that's one. Where are the other ones here? Oh, what's that over there? Dude, I love that in Assassin's Creed you can like, ooh, what's that over there? And then just fucking, oop, we've climbed to it. Ow. Okay, we're doing good. Dang, I wish Jack Sparrow was in that game. I mean, I'm borderline, you know. I'm pretty close. Not quite, but, you know. Hey, we can pretend. Ooh. Why would you do that? Hey, we hit that shit. Let's go hit this damn... Go hit this sink spot, and then we can see where all the rest of the treasures are. Synchronizing, fantasizing about guys that, uh. heard it. Perfect. Pervert, dude. Hello. I was about to attack one of them jockeys like from Left for Dead, but they on dying light too and the zombie started running and ended up tripping and died. What up, big dog? Fucking idiot, dude. I can't believe he just let me do that to him. How did he not see me? I ran into the bushes. There's the next one. The 
this little Chester here. Come on. Come on now. Come on now. Okay. That's weird. Alright, where's this last chest at? People buried with it. Captain Drake's sword is now available in the captain's quarters. What? Dude, that's sick as fuck. And we can use this boat to return to the ship and then we can see what the swords are like. That's dope. That's cool as hell. Alright, so they're in the captain's quarters. Yeah, I'm back, boys. Sacrifice Island was bountiful. Alright, let's check these swords out. Captain Drake's sword. Oh, dude, they're terrible. Well, okay. That was, uh... Maybe not as, uh... Not as productive as I would have liked. But that's fine. Sorry, guy. Captain's at the helm. Okay. Sail to sea. We're out of here, dude. Of course today, Captain. It's a fine day for any kind of mischief. Yes, What's it is. Feeling? I'll make no secret. Okay. All right, where are we going now? Gonna go down. So we'll uh, we'll set a course for. Oh, we can fast travel there? Dude, fuck yeah. Tis the pirate life. That's what I'm saying, brother. You already know what it is. Okay, so now we need to go like this way. What's our course today, Captain? It's a fine day for any kind of mischief. What's your feeling? I'll make no secret of wanting to see the British brought to heel. If we can take their gold and put it to use ourselves, I'd be a happy man. Spoken like a true Welshman, Ade. <laughs> and what's your aim? Master Kidd hinted at a prize he was eager to show me down in Tulum. Quite some distance, mind, on the Yaktan Peninsula. You trust him to play it fair? I can't be sure. He has a way of picking away at my conscience that gives me pause. I should go see him soon. So long as we take some prizes along the way, I'm sure the crew will understand. I'll set a course for Tulum. Dude, we're crushing it. at the objective. Alright, we're starting it. Dude, I have the fucking hiccups. I've had them for like an hour. And I can't get rid of them. Oh, dude, these are assassins. Oh, shit. Yeah, you got damn right. Wait. So am I not supposed to be killing these people? Is that the is that the is that what I'm hearing? Is that what I'm Did 
you check the pistol you got? No, did I get a pistol also? Oh, fuck. No, I didn't check it. Damn, I probably should have. Sorry, I wanted that, wanted that fragment. Coming with me. Coming with me. Coming with me. Dude, how do they not see that? Isn't Metal Gear Solid on Xbox? I don't know. Okay. I think, uh, uh, was it four? Okay, so I'm thinking. Can we, can we climb the tree? Damn it. Dude, we were so close. I got greedy. Oh, fuck. Okay. All right, we got it this time. I'm just going to swim over. ship passed this way, close upon the shore, then gone. Artabai warned us to be vigilant. We've been closing in for well on a year now. God damn it. Okay. Fuck. There's the HP collection. Okay, so clearly the way that we just went was not the the most effective way to go. Alright, let's try that again. There's treasure chests also? Did you guys see any treasure chests? Come here, dude. Come here. Got something I want to show you. When uh, they're about to do the uh, Metal Gear Solid 3 remake too, right?
Oh my god, I can't believe that worked. Jesus. wait. We'll just wait. The power of patience, dude. God. The mentor bids us be ready for anything. The Templars men know our whereabouts. Oh, oh, oh. Not right. Ah, uh, he played us from the start. Betrayed our confidence. How could we have known? Even our Tabai was taken in by his charms. Diddy. What up, Catherine? What up? How you doing? Okay, so we've got them knocked out. Huh. <laughs> Alright, so I'm thinking... I'm thinking... Go back. around maybe are you gay I'm not are you come on now one use. Just one, though. Hold on, what? Hold on. I guess I gotta loot them first. How did... Man, the one thing I never understood is like... Why aren't these guys like... Where the fuck did that guy just go? And where is the... Like, what was that noise? You know? Dude, we've taken, about, taken out just about every assassin on the island so far. There's like three, five, six of them. Seven of them total left. I saw a ship pass this way, close upon the shore, then gone. Our Tabai warned us to be vigilant. Temple has been closing in for well on a year now. Indeed, but Templars make noise with their comings and goings. Right, I guess we'll just keep going. We made it. We made it. Sit me. Whistling keeps throwing me off. 
What? Sit be. Okay, we got a few more to do. Like. Is he gonna come all the way up here? It's looking like it, but it's hard to tell. Okay. Go ahead, brother. Come here. Come here. Come here. Got him. Dude, I'm not fully convinced that that's not AI talking to us right now. Bro, come on. Is all I get? Okay. Okay, we might just take this guy out and then time it. Got it. Let's go. Oh no. No! Fuck! Dude, I thought we were at the end. God damn it. Dude, I hope it doesn't make me start the whole thing over. Okay, thank God. God. All right, patience, virtue. Ooh, dude, we might just be able to get past all of them, maybe? I'm looking at the trees. Come here, dude. Come here. Come here, brother. What's behind door number one? It's me! <sighs> oh, dude, that was so much easier. Do what now? No! What? What did I come back to? I'm not actually sure.
Come on, big dog. One of you is. Damn, I'm for real gonna have to go all the way across, aren't I? Alright. And if you see me walking, just walk on by. What? That's not what I wanted. That's not what I wanted. Go away, dude. Go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. Probably like, where did my bitch just go? Oh my god. Oh my god, it's working? Come here, motherfucker! Ooh, there's a chest? Where are you going? Oh, you just go right there. Okay. I'm not too worried about that. Look at this, dude. It's working out. It's working out. It's all going according to plan. Bitch. All right, and then we'll get this other guy. Hey, you, motherfucker. Hey, yeah, you. Yeah, you. Oh, dude, we fucking made it. Jesus, Kate. You led me into a mess. Is it these monks? Oh, it's the lesbian. Where 
on to something. I can feel it. Captain Kenway? Whoa, hold up. Hold up. Hello. Where is the assassin, Dunker Walpole? Dead and buried. After he tried to kill me. We are not sorry to see him gone. But he it did was try to you kill who carried out his final betrayal. Why? Money was my only aim. Should I find comfort in that? You murdered our brothers and sisters in Havana. Who? He has the sense, mentor. The what? James tells me you treated with the Templars there. Did you see the man they called the Sage? Aye. Would you recognize his face if you saw it again? Yes. I reckon so. I Smash must be it, certain. Lad. Fuck yeah, dude. The sense? Oh no, like the stink? No he has the stink, my Come lord. On. Smell him. We fucking did it, dude. Look at that. Don't mind that last part. 100%. Yeah, I think that's it. You walked me blind and backwards into this mess, kid. Who the hell was that jester back there? Atabai. An assassin. And my mentor. So you're all part of some daffy religion? We're assassins and we follow a creed, I. But it does not command us to act or submit, only to be wise. Oh, do tell. I'd love to hear it. To be wise. Is true. My religion mate is says that I should be wise all the time, too. And if people well disagree that I'm wise, then they're wrong. They're disrespecting my religion. Like the sound of that. Thinking what I like and acting how I please. Parrot the words, but you do not understand. Don't. Ah! Bye. I guess I'm going up this way. The way forward's blocked. That's a Are you a Jedi? Like a Not even close, dude. And there should be some way to open it. Never that. A mechanism. Like a capstan. I'm a dark side boy. Those blocks up there. Try moving them. Moving what? Oh, I accidentally did the objective. Cool. So it's you lot them Templars have been chasing then. Until you came along and mucked things up, it was us chasing them. Oh. We had them running scared. And then I fucked it up. They have the upper hand now. Go, you bitch. Go. Come on now, Don't women are supposed to be, to be fucking brave. Or something. Follow on, man. Shut up, dude. Jump. Er... Oh, hell no, dude. What the fuck? What the fuck? This bitch got me going to Atlantis. Air pockets. I don't see no damn air pocket. Oh. You still drawing breath? Enough to curse you with, kid. Oh god, I'm all turned around. Okay. Be a great treasure beyond. Treasure. Treasure. Oh fuck. How's that? Well, I'm taking you to see me spin your head right round. I only hope you can take the shock of it. I can handle myself. Go, dude. What are you? Go, dude. We gotta beat her. I'm gonna beat that woman. Uh, in the race. Let's go, dude. I won. Is this it then? Solve. The grand prize. Your Solve the puzzle. To see. Looks nothing Solve like the, the man puzzle. they call the sage. I'm sorry to Solve say. Solve the puzzle. Keep your trousers tied up. 
one more riddle to solve. These statues are like the ones we've seen before. Pictures carved. There's pictures carved on the floor as well, but not of the same sort. There's a correspondence then. But what? There's a difference between them animals on the statues and them on the floor. Do you see it? Well, fuck Aye, no. One group is predators, the other is prey. Which predator goes with which prey? That's the question. Right, there's your correspondence. Match a predator with its prey. Ah, I see. Lend me a hand here, will you? Oh, camera died. Camera died. You gotta beat, beat her, beat that woman. Someone beat that. Look. Chase that woman and beat her down. Or wait. No, we were just trying to be faster than her. What the fuck? Do you guys see that second me right there? What is that all about? Hold on. You guys see that second me right there? Whoa, hold up. Hold up. Game crash? Hello? Bro, your camera's glitched? Dude, my whole fucking life is glitched, it looks like. Yeah, when my camera dies, so that's something you'll learn, uh, Quinn, is when my camera dies. Be those storms are oh, wait. Fuck. Uh, it freezes. It freezes. It's great. We love it. That's too much. Oh, wow. It's a face. Drop down. Okay. Thank you. Okay. So then we'll do like this, right? Release. We'll motherfucking drop this one. All right, and then grab the lever. Ayo. Hey, oh. We're making it slowly but surely. I, I figured it out. We figured it out, I think. I hope. All right, dude. One more face. Oh, dude, and we're done. So wait, so people weren't able to figure out how to match colors? I'm glitched. I'm gonna start saying that every time the camera dies now. Hey, we glitching. Are you glitching? Are you glitched up, dog? Jesus, that's him, the sage. But this thing must be hundreds of years old. Damn. Older still. You're certain it's him? Aye. It's the eyes that mark him. Did the Templars say why they wanted this sage? Uh, they drew something some of his about blood into sex. This small glass cube. Like this one. Oh All yeah, right. like that one. They meant to ask him about the observatory too, but he escaped. Huh. I'm We're sorry. Every time here. I type, I think also. Hey man, you're not alone. 
Pipos are a, are a, look, they're a mainstay around these parts. 100%. What the hell did I just see back there? I'll do a picture Jim. of me, but frozen. Quiet. I guess every picture of me is me frozen. In the huh? temple. Was that the man you saw I in the watch on two devices here. Laptop eye. runs too slow. We it can't chat on the two has been Oh man, the I'm sorry. For the I'm sorry, DB. Is that why we're whispering? Usually this the phone. Is your doing, Captain uh, the does maps pretty you well. saw to the Templars have led yeah. them straight to us. And now the agents of two empires know exactly where we operate. Leave this to me, mentor. They have taken Edward's Unless course you're like me well, and your phone's I almost dead. I wonder what their lives are worth to him. My phone's at 51%, surprisingly. Take this. You'll attract no attention. And take fewer lives. Fewer lives. Okay. Wait, did I just get a blow dart, dude? A blow pipe. Dude, we're gonna start blowing guys to sleep. Or wait, uh Use them darts on this one coming now. Quick. Quiet and effective, see. I see. <sighs> Hold on, there's a chest over here, lady. Once, but I've had a better life sailing under a black flag. You could sue, mate. Wait, what? Uh, you don't know what my phone is like. You don't know what I gotta deal with around these parts. Oh, dude, can I blow him? Blown. Many thanks, but no forgiveness. Nice, dude. Nice. Let those British people not see those guys like right there. Oh well. We'll go after all that shit in a second. First, we gotta take this dude out. He's off, mate. He ain't got nothing on us. They got perish. Who reload? He 
was a slaver who brought these soldiers. Lawrence Prince himself. Kick them all to death. Fuck them. Wait, what? Uh, it's Alcatel 1. Got a free, but holy fuck, is it slow? I feel that, brother. I feel that, man. I've been on the uh, I've been on the burner prone grind before myself. Motorola, Motorola. Didn't we just look up? So or wait, no, that was Nokia. Never mind. It was Nokia. Nokia was the the one. It was Bell Laboratories. What was that about again? It was some shit. It was something to do with some shit. Double stomp, dude. Fuck him up. Nice, dude. Nice. Blow him in his ass. God damn! We got him. Also, there's the Mayan face thing up here. I don't know what that's about. Oh, it's, is, it, is it this one? Can't tell. I guess I can't do it while I'm on a mission or something, I'm assuming. Let's see. So we still got quite a few left, but we'll we'll swing up this right side. Go from this way. Bro, you're welcome, maybe. How about that? Come here, dude. 
You were pressed into service? Ah. Yeah, no, he's off me. He ain't got nothing on us. dude. Come on over, it's fine. Them up. All right, I need some more darts. Let's do this, dude. Wait, did I win? Oh. Who's out there? Uh oh. See that mangy old Motorola. Uh, wait, what? He's a Dutch slave I'm saving up to Lawrence get a decent Prince. phone. Got a budget Living of eight to nine hundred, like so I'm Jamaica. open to suggestions. Or if you want a reliable phone, I got some that'll help. Edge 2024, the G Play, oh G Styles. Cheery bunch, eh? All frowns charge. and furrowed brows, Captain Kenway. Anyway. You have remarkable skills. Oh, thanks, mate. It comes yeah, Motorola makes good like uh, like prancing around in a uniform budget phones. You like if you're trying not to break the bank, but get everything like everything that you need. Isn't that your motto? I absolve you of your errors in Havana and elsewhere, but you are not welcome here. Surprisingly, Sorry, like mate. Samsung has some we pretty good otherwise. budget phones now too. Like the Samsung A series is pretty good. It's like 200 bucks. Cheery bunch of mates you've got. You deserve scorn, Edward. Prancing about like one of us, bringing shame to our cause. And what is that? Your cause? To be blunt, we kill people. Templars and their associates. Folks who'd like to control all the empires on Earth. Claiming it's in the name of peace and order. Sounds like to cast his dying words. You see? It's about power, really. About lording over people. Robbing us of liberty. That another message from one of your friends? Aye. I'll show you. All right. So we're... What? What? Why didn't... What did... What... Did, what? What? Okay. Use berserk darts on guards. Berserk darts? I know you ain't exactly impressed by our creed. So would the sight of money make you more friendly to our ways? Yeah. As ever. <laughs> then work these contracts around the West Indies for us, and we'll pay you. As simple as that. Easy? Now follow on. I have one last secret to share. Okay. How long have you been one of these assassins, eh? Couple years now. I met Atabai in Spanish Town. Okay. And there was something about him I trusted. A sort of wisdom. Is all this his idea? His clan? No, sir. Assassins and Templars have been at war thousands for thousands of years. of years. All over the world. The natives of this new world had a philosophy like our creed for as long as they've been here. And when Europeans arrived, our group sort of matched up. Okay. Cool. Cultures and religions and languages going? forked, divided. But there's something in the Assassin's Creed that crosses all boundaries. A fondness for life and liberty. Sounds a bit like Nassau, no? <laughs> here we are. Take that stone you discovered from the Mayan stealth. Oh shit, okay. That's one. Couple dozen more and you're in. What we have like effort a, a few. Respect some for a start. Got a whole extra from the men and women you put in danger here. One. Yeah, hell yeah. And if that ain't enough, there's a treasure behind that door. 
Oh. Something many centuries old. Oh. I reckon if you made the effort to find every last one of those, it'd be worth your while. We could probably do that. There's one here on so the island, right? So you're back to NASA. When I have another contract there, right? This is my home for now. Okay. How do I add more? I guess I don't. Okay. up and grab that real quick. Uh, looks nice, don't it? Make sure you get a protective case also. Yeah, the case is necessary. Every time I didn't have a case is every time I broke my... What the fuck? Every time I didn't have a case was when my phone broke. Alright, hold up. Hold up. We're gonna get this motherfucker. God damn it. I don't know why you didn't get it the first time. Oh, dude. Alright, fuck it. Whatever. We'll be back here, I'm sure. Alright, we're we're gonna get the fuck out of here. I wanna go I wanna go take on some more British. No offense. Pop and lock their stockings, dude. I'm not too fussed about the design. I want something to crash on the lock screen. Oh shit, dude! Sail to sea. All right. Yeah, you should be solid. Loose all and trim sharp to the wind. Loose tops and royals. I'm gonna grab this real quick and then go to the next story objective. Starboard, blood some sir. Looks like Yeah. Yours. We got that there, loot. The loot is gotten. Oh dude, when can we start like fishing? Oh, is there treasure? Oh, oh, oh no! Okay, we're fine. Yes, dude. A golden compass. System. I agree. I agree. I've had iPhones since 5S. I usually get cheapest, but they never last. It's, uh, they call that the, uh, the pole man's tax. It's like, uh, if you, oh, wait, you wanted me to go look at the pistols. Um, if you buy $20 shoes versus $100 shoes, you have to buy $20 shoes like five times, and then you end up sp spending the 100 anyway. Captain Drake's flint locks. Oh, still not as good as the ones I'm using, though. I want the golden flint locks. 
all naval contracts. Ooh, or the cannon barrel. Those are the ones that go real slow, though. Seven, don't worry about offending me. It takes a lot. Dude, same here. Same here. Like, I, I behoove you all. I encourage you all to talk shit. Captain has the Just as, uh... As, uh... Heads up. Like, if you guys don't feel comfortable shit-talking me, I'm doing something wrong. A lot of, like, uh, especially the flagship androids now, they've, like, taken out their SD card slots, which is... It sucks, but, you know, what are you gonna do? Most of them have plenty of storage, though. Doing fine. Hell yeah. I. What the fuck? Um. Hell yeah. Wait, does that mean like I'm very insultable? What does that mean? Uh. Dude, we're making it. It's all misty out here. I wonder why. I don't know. It's fine. I'll I'll take it as a compliment that it's so easy to insult me. Or wait. Uh or wait. Uh what? Uh yeah, the whale dude. That was insane. All right, we're going we're going into restricted waters here, boys. We're looking good though. We're looking good. There's a chest over there. Ooh, it's so tempting. We're going to keep going, boys. It's saving. Whoa. All right, I guess we're doing this. Did it, dude. Fuck them. Oh, oh, 
Yeah, get on the getting, motherfuckers. All right, we're gonna dock. Uh, I need to get a repair on my phone, but it'll cost me because I cracked my screen a little bit two years ago. Dude, you do that thing where you like hold out and just hope that like it doesn't cut you. Or like it doesn't get worse. Is this as far as we're docking? Come on, you guys can dock further than that. Oh, there's crabs. That was crazy. Damn. Cannon's going off, brother. Let's get this shit. We got this. Alright, so there's two fort officers. One over here. So let's just go get this guy. The other one. Oh, you bitch! Oh, you fucker! You hit me! Alright, let's go get this other guy. Alright, 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 alright. Yeah. Ha, ha, ha. Bye! Get double penetrated, you fuck. Pass all them up. Pass all them up. Pass all them up. Oh! Fuck you, dude! Uh, got him. Alright, loot. Got it. Alright, the other one I'm assuming is. Up. Boom, we got the chest. Suck on my dick and balls. I'm the captain now, motherfucker. Sleep. Oh, did I miss? All right. We did it. Take theirs down and put my black flag up. Cool. We did it. Uh, damn, so what do we got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven left. That seems kind of easy. We've already done three? Dude, this one fort for this whole thing? What is this? Legendary ship? Oh, dude, they shouldn't have told me that. What is this? Pino Isle? I think I'm good for that. I think I'm good on on penis aisle. Ahoy, Captain. Need to go underground. I can keep the heat off for a thing. Do we miss some stuff up here by chance? I'm assuming not. I'll tell you what, no better feeling than talking your gang out of sword wielding bozos with your fists. Hey, right? Dude. I'll fist these losers all day. Or wait. Eye for an eye. 
Okay, we'll hold off on that. I want to get a little further into the story. I just want to unlock all these, like, fast travel locations. So I can, like... Oop, 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 oop. Alright, boys. Where's our objective? Okay. Let's ride this blow, lads. Damn, there's so many ships out there. Alright, we're just gonna fucking get out there. You guys are going to have to move. Okay. I feel like we've reached a somewhat of an understanding. Ooh, dude, there's a chest out there. Oh, sorry. I don't know why I'm apologizing to a video game character. Especially an NPC, dude. What the fuck's wrong with me? Yeah! Dude, it's a Flaminger. You can't shoot him, I guess. We got it. Yeah, you can't kill them. Damn it. All right, so we're going to... Oh, oh, ew. All right, we're out of here, boys. Flamingos are just bulletproof. I have, I've come to realize the that the flamingos uh, are probably the strongest enemy in the game so far. Usually one, two bullets does it every time. Dude, where the fuck is my objective? Oh my god. Can I just like fast travel somewhere? Oh, sick. Oh my god, dude, that would have taken me forever. Give me some speed. Shit. Man your stairs, we trim two. Yeah, we trim two. I don't know what that means, but it sounds good. Yep. I'm grabbing it. As much sail as you can. On full aloft, man your sheep. Oh, dude, there's one ship right here by its lonesome. What did they? What did they just say? Timmy! Alright. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. How do we get in there? 
I guess we gotta go around. Okay. I have an idea. I have an idea. I'm gonna wrap around. Timmy! Yeah, it looks like we can get in and around. Timmy! Timmy! Hey! Alright, then we're gonna... Ooh, 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 drifting! Just like that, dude. It's that easy. Travel to Nassau? I guess? I don't... Uh... I guess? I don't... I guess? Oh, yeah. So okay. What? Area, Wheel? Stinks the same as every other squat I've robbed this past year. Oh, what about a wheel? What a long face. You falling in love? <laughs> With your blouse. You're welcome what? to Nassau, gents. Everyone is that does their fair share. Fair share? What is this, a fucking monastery? Maybe. Um, we was uh, led to believe that Nassau was a place where men did as they pleased. Safe keeping others from doing the same. Aye. Aye. Captain Thatch. Captain Thatch. What is this magnificent muzzle you've cultivated? Eh? Why fly a black flag when a black beard will do? Amen. What brings you two gents this Amen. far north? Word is, Cuban governor himself is fixing to receive a mess of gold from a nearby fort. Oh, really? Until then, it's just sitting there. How interesting. Itching to be took. Governor Torres himself, eh? Sounds promising. Oh, dude, we're gonna fuck governor these guys Nassau. up. Captain Vane. Mr. Rackham. Uh, 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 now, uh, where can a man find a bit of rough? Do you know what I mean? A bit rough. Isn't that women's? Isn't that women? In the rough, a woman? Because, uh. Yeah! Do what now? How the fuck am I supposed to get that? Bro, what? Here we go. Okay, so now we're just sailing again, I guess? I'm sailing away. Where am I going now? Okay, where are we? doesn't say or does it does it say where we're at or no you know I don't know where I am what the fuck Oh, that's where I am. That's where I need to be. So I can probably... Oh, 
gonna go around. It's all fast travel there. <clears throat> all right. And we're off. Loose tops and royals. All right, dude, we're gonna fucking make it. Oh, there, dude, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna sink this ship so I can, uh, so I can prepare mine. No, we're gonna board it. Get off my damn cannon, boy. What the fuck? Okay, guess we're not gonna... Oh shit. Done. We did it. All right, we got to repair my ship, dude. We're fucked. Okay. Ooh, and now we can fate we can we can fucking fuck this ship up if we want to. Hello there. Dude, we're just getting all these damn supplies. All right, let's turn it. Oh, too high. Too high. There it is. Oh. We did it. We're min-maxing that shit right now, dude. We're gonna lower our wanted level. Alright. And we're off. Alright, we're in good shape now. There's some loot. Johnny Lever. Tomorrow you will get your pay, and it's time for us, us to, to leave her. Leave her, Johnny Lever. Oh, leave her. Hey, fuck yeah, dude. Lever. For the voyage is long, and the winds don't blow, and it's time for, for us to leave, leave her. her. Fuck yeah. You can up you should upgrade before starting this mission. Fuck it, we're gonna start anyway. Dude, we're doing it. So, what'll you do with your share of the gold we take from Governor Torres? Return to Africa, prince among men. I cannot return to a place I've never been. I was born in Trinidad. A slave from my first breath. Yeah. But well, wouldn't you feel, I don't know. Hey, real quick. Well, welcome there. <laughs> real quick. Do you guys want me to drop five gifted memberships? Because I can. Because I can fucking do it. I don't know. I don't know who they go to. Uh, 
a so I can do that twice a month and give it out to random people. But I thought now would be a good time. So I'll be giving out free memberships every time I can. And uh who knows? You could you could get one if you sub to the channel. Goofy guy got one. All right, uh, where's my damn game? Hello? Fuck yeah, dude. All right, all right, we're back, we're back. Upgrades. You might feel more welcome in Paris. Didn't get one. Fair point. Man, that's the thing is it's uh, it's like five and 927 <laughs> chance. This country here is oh, my best man. chance. Maybe one day though, Jack we'll Dog. look, we can build one up. We'll build it up. I'll get everybody on one at least together. once. Not always out of love, but to keep our country afloat. I understand thee. Let's take her then. For the citizens of Jackdaw. Hey, I what are we doing? Oh, okay. Let's see. The fuck? What the hell? Get there, get there. Oh my god. Aim for the towers, Captain. Yeah, I know. I know. Fucking did it, dude. What do you mean I need to upgrade? What do you mean I need to upgrade? The fuck out of here, dude. What were you guys thinking? You missed? Dude, fucking... Almost right yeah, blow that bitch up. Oh, I guess we missed. They wish I'd take them in. Fuck them, dude. They ain't even worth it. They couldn't even keep their own damn ship afloat. Oh! Boo! <laughs> We're in. We're on, dude. Let's go take this fucking fort. I swear if I got one, I would have been dropping Oliver Swanick one. Hey. Hey. Oh. Oh. Jump. Jump. Oh, we just got the one? Just the one? Just the one guy? Just you? Just you? That's it? Okay. All right. Sweet. That was easy. All right. Now there's going to be one other guy up here. Let's go kill him. We'll take the fort and then we'll go get the treasure. Yeah. Uh oh. Oh, okay. Well, hello, Your Excellency. I'd got word you might be here. I know your face, pirate, but your name was borrowed the last time we spoke. Ah, yes, that's I true. Mr. Duncan Walpole. I missed that one. So, 
What's a Templar Grand Master doing so far from his Castillo? I'd rather not say. And I'd rather not cut your lips off and feed them to you. Two years ago, we offered a reward for this sage's recapture. Today, someone claims to have found him. This gold is his ransom. Who found him? Uh-oh. A slaver by the name of Lawrence Prince. He lives in Lawrence Kingston. Prince. In Kingston. We like this story, Torres. And we want to help you finish it. But we're going to do it our way. Oh yeah, you can Using use coins on Tangia.co. I think it's like 15 cents or something to do it. Uh, text to speech, a bunch of different custom voices and stuff. We did it. We didn't use a mortar. We didn't use a running assassination to kill the officer. You know, I wish they would tell me my objectives before they're my objectives. Okay, so we have two, three, six, seven, eight, seven left. Seven left. Okay. I gotta go get these chests, dude. Someone just fell into the water. There's one. Ayo. Where's the other one? The other one's probably up here. We're down. What the fuck? Nope. Climb back up there. The gold flintlock. Uh, the chest? Or the fragments? I don't know. I've just been getting all the chests because they also give me money. Oh, wow. That's high. That's high up, dude. That's high up there. Oh! Ow. Is it the fragments that give you the flint locks or he must have taken that sofa? So I'll tell you what. Someone's row. Ow. Minus naval contracts, not the forts. Ah. Well, I'm unlocking the forts mainly for like the uh, the oh, fast sir. travel. Yeah. Next thing's there, Kingston. So I guess we'll set sail for this fort. Alright, let's go, dude. We're in the fucking high seas, my guys. Larboard, Captain. Some sort of oh, sir, she'll take it. I'll sing you a song of the fish in the sea. Dude, what is going on? We found uh, a good bit of the the shanties too 
Man, that's such a tiny little island out here in the middle of fucking nowhere, dude. It makes me feel like there's going to be something good there. But probably not. Damn, it's storming. Oh, all this there is a damn animus fragment. I don't care about all that, dude. Shanties have been cool. I like your thinking. Yeah, my thing is like, uh, with the Animus contracts, uh, or the Animus fragments and stuff, like, you don't also get money. You just, you're collecting them to unlock something. I don't know what it is. Uh, the Shanties have been cool. I think so, too. I'd like to unlock some more, but it's going to take a while. Oh, God. Okay. All right, we've already made it. Oh, God. Okay. Dude, we're getting fucked up. Fuck. Okay. All right, we got to do this a little more, a little more strategically, I think. Fuck, dude. I don't even know how to use like the mortars and stuff either. Fuck. Damn it, dude. Alright, let's see. Crowd on every inch of sail. Race for impact.
Are we back? I think we're back. I think we're back. Let's see. Yeah, we're back. Yeah, sometimes my uh my stream labs will shit the bed just for like no reason. Glurched. My fault. My fault. My fault. We back though. I got back in time. I saw it glitch out on my phone down here and I was like, hold up. Hold up. Wait a minute. Alright, come on now. Don't fail me now, Assassin's Creed. Don't fail me now. Alright, cool, 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 cool. Alright, we're right back in it. Alright, so I died. Oh my god, dude. What is fucking me up right now? life for me what up ninja my ninja long time no see brother how was uh how was shooting guns dog all right so here's what i'm thinking
Oh god. Oh god. See that? Dude, we were doing so good. Playing some pew pews down on this. Fo I'm trying to, man, but fuck. It's like I'm not doing enough damage. But I'm already here. I guess that's why they warned me. Can I, so can I, like, leave? Can I leave this? Go back? Oh, dude, but I didn't, didn't fast travel, so I'm going to have to sail all the way back. Fuck. Uh, that's fine. We're kind of just like Sisyphus Boulder right now. So let's see if we can go upgrade some stuff. Good afternoon. I would like to purchase some things buy upgrades okay ram strength is all we have and fire barrel strength and storage rowboat armor okay so we have to we have to oh yeah oh yeah all right what do we need what is this I need 75 metal. Uh -oh. No matter, another time. Oh. Seems you use a little help disappearing, friend. So we got to find some metal. Oh no. God damn it. Every time. Every time. All right, so we're gonna go find some metal. Captain's at the helm. Unfold, mates. Let's move. So we're gonna go fuck some ships up. Go take their fucking metal, dude. Metal? Rum. Captain. Watch your elbow, 
on my mark, eh? Alright, so I guess we'll take one of them out. Damn, imagine getting hit with a fucking cannon, dude. Fuck that. Like, dead on. We did it. Port missions were always dope in this game. Yeah, dude. I, I just have to upgrade my ship is all. So we got to get some metal. Some metal. And they didn't have any. They had fucking none. What am I supposed to do with all that? Surely these guys will have some. There's some bigger boats. Oh man, we gotta catch them. Oh man, or maybe. on his ass. It's ours. One scene where the cannonball is just bouncing off the ground and then absolutely B day someone. Yes, dude. His own guy shot him in the back. Nope. Go oh, ride the the things. Oh, you bitch! Yes, dude. Can't you inspect ships before attacking to see what materials they're holding? Oh, that's a good question. Probably. Ooh, a hundred metal. We're gonna repair.
Whoa, are they fighting each Hang other? Out. Let's go. Get on that main seat. Trim two. Dude, they're fighting each other. All right. We're going to fast travel back now because I think we have enough. Oh, we're in this way. Oh. But yeah, good call out there, DB. I, I completely fucking forgot. Get down off the damn store, Edward. Fucking well, then, will you asshole. Upgrades. Broadside cannons. Okay. Okay. So now we need 300 metal. My fair winds favor you, sir. How might I address your needs, sir? So what do we need for the hull? We need... It looks like wood and metal. So really, I just need to be on the lookout for a fuck ton of metal. Can you buy, like, cargo stuff? Like, uh, materials? Captain has the helm! Get the mains free! All right, I don't know what this this house thing is, but we're gonna go see. We got some rum. All right, we're going to the fucking high seas, brothers. Oh, I need to get some of my crew back. So we'll do that right here. Oh, it's gone. What the fuck? Oh, there's a chest here. Oh god, no sharkers. No sharks, please. No sharks. I don't like the sharks. Fuck. Okay. We made it. It's in this chest up here. Ooh. 250. Dude, I saw the the tip of my ship up there, and I thought it was a shark fin, and I was like, oh, fuck, here we go, I'm dead. Swim, Edward. Swim, you bastard. Come on. Okay. All right, we made it. I always think of Patriot with Mel Gibson, where the cannon just takes the dude out. Dude, fuck yeah. Captain has them. Right there, Kevin! Fire! Fire! Look, Kevin! What 
Dude, we're in like a big ass fucking naval battle right now. Holy shit. Holy shit. What is happening? Oh my god. I could see past this damn fog of war. Oh my god. I don't know how to use the mortar, dude. Oh no! Him up. We got that motherfucker, dude. BRB, no buying materials. An Xbox, yes, sir. Dude, fuck yeah, that was awesome. I am using an Xbox controller. We should definitely repair our ship. Sick, dude. Want a level raise? Uh oh. No bueno. She's gotta go away. Got her. Oh, hi. Yes, dude. I am using an Xbox controller. I got the uh, the Elite with like the back paddles or whatever. I only use two of them though. Repair. All right, and we'll board one more ship and uh, hopefully raise our, or lower our wanted level.
Okay, we got a 360 and hit that shit. Get the main salt into the wind. Every last scrap of duck on the wind. We're going towards that house, by the way, if you guys were wondering. Alright. Here we go. Timmy! Left bumper, then aim and fire with R2 for mortar. Ah! 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 Oh, dude, we fucked him up. Fire! Fire! Down to the drink! Ready to fire, sir! Brace yourselves for collision! Fire! Wrong way. Oh, oh. Bye. I need help. Bleed it out here. Yeah. We did it. Thanks for the uh, mortar thing, by the way, dude. That's going to come in so fucking clutch. I had no idea how to use that shit. Alright, so I'm thinking, ah, uh, repair us. Alright, now we're going to lower our wanted level with everything else. Alright, but first, I actually want to, like, board in this. So we're going to... Get the main street! Let's ride this ball out! A dock right here. Or? There we go. 
There we go. Come on, dude. We're gonna fucking make it. Oh, there's a lion thing right here. Let's do that. Ow. We're digging. Oh, it still says I'm playing Kingdom Come, is that right? Die, another keystone. I can't tell. Got him. All right, there's got to be a way up. Oh, not like that. Eastman for the dogs. Quick, over there. Yeah, motherfucker. You never saw me. Don't kill me, please. Mercy. What? I haven't done a thing. Please don't hurt me. Who the fuck is he? Who who's talking? Climb. Climb. We have to sink with the eagles. Madonna. Holy shit, dude. Man. Fucking did it, dude. Shit. This. I'm no part of it. Don't mind me. This, this is not what I came to the new world for. Oh, no, no. Alright. Doing pretty good. We got him. All right, there's another chest. Looks like it might be around here. Nope. Hey, let's go, dude. There's no 
another one right here. All right. Looks like another warehouse. This one done. That one's done. Okay. What's left here? Oh, they're up this way. Okay. So we'll we'll start getting these as we make our way back to the boat. I feel like we're making pretty good progress. Oh, and there's a secret map somewhere. Let's fucking go, dude. chest. Ooh, there's a there's a cadaver right there. Well, go down. Come on, you motherfucker. Oh, you jumped too far. Nice. Yes, dude. Alright, we'll figure out where that is later. Portuga. Bro, just climb up the dam. God damn it. Alright. Swim around. Man, we might do a stop at nine. Getting to the point where my fucking nose is starting to run for some reason. I think it's because my eyes is getting tired. Give me a couple hours to decompress before we uh, start hitting it again for tomorrow. What do you guys think? Nine o'clock? Good, good stop. You're going on half a day. I mean, yeah, but you know. It doesn't feel like a half a day when I'm hanging with you all. I'm thinking it's, you know. All right, we're back on the ship. Fuck it, dude. We're out. We're out of here. Alright, so I'm thinking... Check this out. How much... How much stuff do we have of stuff? Okay, so we need another 115 metal and like 160 wood, essentially.
got it, dude. Alright, if we finish, it's going on 2.30 hey, here. I should be going to sleep shortly. Hey, brother. I appreciate you hanging out with me so much today. Uh, DB and Quinn, you too, man. You guys have been awesome. for me to be up this late. Hey. Dude, I'm a night owl myself, dude. What the fuck? Hey. I did it. I appreciate you letting me be here. Oh, for sure, man. You're good company. Good company, my brother. I guess we'll start lowering our wanted levels so we don't get blocked. Fire! We have looted oh. some goods useful for upgrading the ship, sir. Good. But we're not quite there yet. Pirate hunters! Oh, yep, I see him. Close down, catch some wind! Fire! Come on! Got that ass, dude. This is a big one, I feel like. I mean, it's just big as us. Hey, it happens, brother. Okay. All right. You fox. You fox. Let's go, dude. All right, so we're gonna just repair our ship. We must 
us off the wing! Alright, we're gonna hit that castle with our fucking mortars now, dude. dude up we're gonna fuck this fort up my baby needs to be carrying on all morning like at one every day oh dude that's rough dude babies crying are like so fucking hard to get through like sleep through or like ignore i guess is like the most blunt way i could put it oh god Got that ass, dude. Go get him, dude. Loose all and trim shot to the wind. All sails loose and stairs tight. Close up. Ease her sticks. Here we go. That's the walk. I know that's rough. Yeah, dude. I couldn't do it. Stop it!
Yes, dude. Yeah, it's a lot rougher because my sister passed away last year. And me and my parents are now proud. Oh, man, that's rough. I'm really sorry, man. I couldn't imagine. It's fucking... It's hard enough with, you know, everybody being there and shit. And fuck, man. Sorry, Queen. We now have the materials required to make the ship stronger, sir. Stands out! Let's get moving! Loose tops and royals! Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Mindy, brother. That shit's man, that's a that's a lot to take on and I know it's not easy. Yeah. Doing the right thing when when fucking life hands you a shit deal, man, is is probably one of the hardest things to do. Kick them overboard. Yeah. Yeah, they are. Yeah, they are. All right, so we're almost down with one that wanted levels, and we got a bunch of materials. Get the mainsails into the wind. With what we have taken, we can improve on every inch this. of sail. Is that the fort right there? It looks like it. It looks like the damn fort I was going after. God damn it. Okay. One is like 17, soon to be 18, the other is 7, and the other one's 10 months old. Oh shit, man. 
It's wearing me out. Yeah, man, it uh, it it's all worth it in the end when like you know they're they're able to understand exactly like what it is that you're doing, you know, for them or that you guys like sort of sacrifice for them. Uh, it'll be worth it. Dude, how am I doing so bad right now? Maybe I'll just get closer and then... Dude, the mortars are so difficult. Huh. Sacrifice my first shot because I want to spend some time with my sister Let's before I regret. Man, I'll say yeah. this. Uh, you can always get another job. Can't always get another sister, you know what I'm saying? God damn. Uh, uh, talked about it, but I'm pretty sure GameStop is like a pretty good company. Oh, yeah. Not a lot of customers that come in and someone has a great job, but a toxic company, go with a good company, you'll be happier. Your complaints about a manager ain't doing nothing about something, having a clean bathroom 24 7. Yeah, dude, fuck that. 
Fuck cleaning bathrooms, dog. That shit's for the birds. Ready to fire, sir! Wall ship incoming, Captain! Fire! Schooner! Royal Blood Captain! Hey! Wall Punch is on the house! Fire! Just on the deck! Ready to fire, sir! The sword exposed to the saucer! So much better. Ready to fire, sir. Fire! That's a good shot, the crippler. We're ready. Brace yourself. Fire! He's vulnerable there. Brace for impact. Get a hit, Cap. Still clear. Coming fire. Fire! Ready to fire. Fuck it. Yes, dude. Alright, what's left over here? Trim the yards off the wind. Ease off the ways. Pull it all sail. Hold down and pull up. Pull those men. Close Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Because we only have one left. Oh no. 
Dude, fuck. Finally. Down to the drink. She's him. Uh, oh, fuck. Okay, close that time. Horse had to go through. I'm like a clean freak. Had to clean up public bathroom through facts. Come on, we're almost there. Let's carry down the lancer. Hold down and clue up. Clue up. Raging clue. All right, we there basically. Um, victory streets. What the fuck? Dude, I feel like this is a big ass fort. You saying how you miss the toilet? Just get it everywhere. Oh fuck. It's a good question, my man. How does patch? A lily, 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 lily. Dude. Yes, we got his ass. We got his ass. What the fuck? The way. What the hell is this guy? Hold up. Tangia. Did I hear? Yeah. Old Tangia. shoot each other? I think we did. I've clear shot. You ain't gotta clear nothing, dude. Eat my fucking balls. Alright, we made it. Alright, let's clear. Let's become anonymous. Okay. Is this the Krusty Krab? Could be. Hey. No, this is Patrick. Man, I really feel like SpongeBob might end up being one of the best like cartoons of all time. Now, I don't know why I would think that, but I do think that. We did it. Need to disappear, I don't need to do shit, Something dog. I can assist with? Oh, fuck. It's 9 o'clock. Okay. So, we're going to buy the upgrade. Okay, we can't buy the upgrade. But we can buy... Mortar shot... Okay. Wait, where you live? Uh, East Coast. East Coast. So I'm, I'm in. Well, I'm technically in Central Standard Time, but. But it is nine o'clock here. Uh, but my eyes is tired. My eyes are tired. 
So I'm gonna probably quit right here. Quit the main menu. Really? Yeah. Yeah, I'm uh it is 9 p.m. here currently. So we're uh it's 9.05, yeah. Yeah, show enough. Show enough. This has been a good day though. Good stream. Let's see if we have anything going on right before we close out here. Anything crazy? Uh, it's looking like no. Looking like no. Okay. Let's check Twitter. Just in case. Girl allegedly finds plastic in her Chick-fil-A sandwich. Oh my god. Beam me up, Scotty. What the fuck? Wow. Dude, Chick-fil-A done falling off. Bomb, right? Yes, you could. And you could say that we have to develop it like Oppenheimer felt before the Nazis did. I love that. How'd that work? <laughs> How'd it's that a worm. Work? No, I look well, like Saran Wrap, bro. Way, that people on my side, I'll just say, I'll just admit it, on the right, you know, have spent the last 80 years defending dropping nuclear weapons on civilians. Like, yeah. What? What? Hold on. What happened? Look between R and W. E? Fifteen-year-old McDonald's employee brutally assaulted. Their child shot in eight days in Kansas. Call of Duty. Senator Blackburn. Okay, there's not a whole lot. So when's the next stream? Tomorrow morning, ten o'clock, brother. Tomorrow morning, ten o'clock. That's probably when we'll be. Uh, okay, so I'm not seeing much. Uh, so it looks like we covered everything today. Again, Joe Biden and his administration are suing a gas station after using them for a, uh, for a press thing. Or no, sorry, Tuesday. Tuesday is next stream. So we'll always do Tuesday through Friday. Saturday I will take off. Sunday will be the long stream. Monday I will take off. And then Tuesday through Friday again. Yeah, so not tomorrow. Uh, Tuesday. Tuesday. Tuesday at 10 a.m. So we're thinking 36 hours from, or 37 hours from now. <laughs> but yeah, uh, I think that's going to do it. Uh, thanks, everybody, again for hanging out. Your uh, love and support. Uh, Quinn, Paso Misfit. Uh, Tomato was here for a bit. DB hung out for a long time. Vika, Crimson, Ninja Camaro. Uh, yeah, I think that was everybody. I uh, appreciate you all. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your night, and I will see you all on Monday. Peace out, everybody. Gorilla penis.